Hello, everybody. Welcome, welcome. Today's gonna be fun. Long stream. <laughs> A very long stream. I can hear myself. That's awesome. All right, cool. How's it going? Let's see, did I forget to move my audio track over? I didn't. Awesome. Hello, everybody. Welcome in, welcome in. 12 hour stream. Yep. Or longer, we'll see. I have no idea what to expect with this. How's everybody doing today? Miles is with me here. Refuses to sit with me, so he's sitting next to me. But yeah, let's um, let's get some things out of the way right off the bat. First of all, thank you guys so much for 7,000 subscribers. That is an insane number. I did not expect to get there. Uh, that is just crazy to me. Hey guys, welcome in, welcome in. Hi Crazen, how's it going? Hi Kayla. Hi Lainey. Don't feel like you have to. It's not it's not requirement. It's an optional thing. Um and then on top of that, a hundred Discord members. Or I guess what are we at? 179 or something? That's crazy. I'm, I'm blown away by that that number. That's insane. Uh, but yes. That is, that is pretty insane. Uh, the second thing I want to talk about is what are we doing today? So it's not just going to be 12 hours of Minecraft like the title says. It is going to be 12 hours of Minecraft. But, yes, I know my camera is shaking. I have it on my monitor and at the moment I have no no better way. So it's going to... It's going to shake. But we're doing something a little special today. In addition to doing the 12 hours of Minecraft, which this will be in the 12 hours, uh, you'll notice in the description I've got... This music's a little loud. Hold on. In the description, I've got um, some information about the memberships. If you get a membership during the stream, it will lengthen the stream once the timer starts going. And in addition to that, I have various tiers of like numbers of subs and if we reach that number which I have no idea how that's gonna go um, I've planned up to 60 subs which I don't expect to get to but we'll see um, various levels of rewards for that so I'll play a little song on my guitar or uh, I'll swap my keyboard and mouse so I'll be playing with my left hand and then using my keyboard with my right which is so backwards to me. Hello, hello, welcome in. Um, having a character take over stream for 20 minutes. Now, I, I might do longer, depending on how long it actually feels doing the voice, but I'm going to do an impression, or try to do an impression for 20 minutes, and um, I'll try, t I'll do a poll for when, if we get there, for what voice I do. I have a bunch of options. And then for 60 subs, I will be doing i haven't decided how much yet but i will be i will be taking not a shot but maybe like a little teaspoon or something of da bomb which is a very hot hot sauce which i was told and i have no factual evidence of this that this is like the top tier uh hot sauce that they use on hot ones that's what my brother said so he might be right who knows but regardless if uh if we get there, then I'll then I'll drink a teaspoon of hot sauce, which that'll be fun. <laughs> oh, gosh, if somebody but I literally I didn't ex I don't expect anybody to ever get the prismatic tier. I did that more as a joke than anything. I wanted to do a prismatic tier before I even did the memberships and. I didn't I wanted to keep all the the other materials of sniffer eggs like Minecraft related, but I still wanted to do Prismatic, so I kind of did it as an excuse to add the Prismatic tier. 
But then also I thought, you know, why not? It'd be funny. But yeah, I'll be... I got some challenges. I've got a surprise for the last three hours of the stream. Um, I'm not sure if we're going to finish it in three hours. If not, then I'll probably go past the time anyway, because I, I want to finish it before I stop the stream. But, um, yeah, last, last three, four hours of the stream, I can't decide if I should spoil it now or not. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Bass bong. Welcome in. Oh, they got, I got both of them up. And whoops, that's not right. Welcome in. Thank you for becoming a member. I hadn't even started the timer, so I'm going to add that manually. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. I should probably do that now, actually. Hold on. Boom. Timer is going. In There it goes. A timer is going. I will add the... I'll start the timer over. Because I... Oh, gosh. I hope this works. So that would be 12 hours and 2 minutes. All right. Now we're going. Oh, dear. <laughs> That's a long timer. Okay. I'm really hoping this works. I've never used this app before for the for the timer. And I was struggling to find one that worked well for YouTube. So hopefully this works. We'll see. I don't want to run over you, buddy. Move your tail. Thank you. Hopefully this works. We'll see. I've got it set up so I have an application that has the timer and supposedly it's supposed to add time automatically whenever stream elements detects that I I get a member but because I've never used this I have no idea if it's going to work so we'll we'll see yeah, move this over that so looks better there we go all right cool well welcome in uh, if you join the discord the link is in the description you should automatically be given your uh, you should automatically be given your role. Well, it took two seconds. It's already not a lot. Yes. Ink. Alignment to the right. Oh, that changed nothing at all. That's really great. There we go. Cool. Perfect. That's close enough. Okay, cool. Awesome. Oh, geez. That's... I don't expect anybody to stay here all the way through. I know it's a ridiculously <laughs> long stream. But uh, if you if you want to be my guest, I'd love to have you. <laughs> I'll do my best to entertain you for the, the for the duration of the twelve hours and nineteen seconds. I need to get a glasses cleaner. Okay, <clears throat> not even down to twelve hours. Nope, I've already started. So, what are we doing today? I've got some ideas. I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I've got some ideas, and I think we're actually going to start it off with a poll. I'm gonna I'm gonna offer three options right now. Let's see. Uh, start Q and A. Start poll. So let's do. What do we do first? Do we do blueprint artifact? Or, Coldcraft. Let's see. Which will win? What will we be doing for the first few hours of the stream? YouTuber Wisdom. Um, do it at your own pace. Make sure to prioritize your health over your content. You are the most important asset of your of your channel so make sure to prioritize that first if you need a break take a break if you need to take extra long in a video to make it the way you want to make it take extra long as long as you're happy with the outcome that is the overall goal some people are really into numbers they're really into making the view count big or the subscriber count big my number one goal is prioritize quality and self respect self happiness uh, make something you're proud of if you can make something you're proud of, other people will be proud of that too. That's how that works, I promise you. The more you make things you are happy with, 
the longer you will be happy with your projects, the more the the more genuine of a connection you'll have with your audience because they are just as um, just as in love with the things you're making as you are. And that's why I don't have or that's why I have so many different projects is because I have so many different hobbies that I'm constantly working on so many different things. So if you can find a way to uh, maybe write down the things that you like, either in real life or in other games, things that you like to do, write those down and then do whatever you want. That is like <laughs> that's some terrible advice. <laughs> take take your hobbies and say, can I do this in Minecraft? What would I like to do? And then do it. If you can find a way to do what you want to do, that is the goal. I have so many random projects because those are things I was like, I really want to do this. And then I did it. So yeah, that's that's probably the biggest thing is just finding what you want to do and making it just you. What is what is your thing? For me, that's filmmaking, that's trying to inspire people, that's trying to create stories and um, kind of cross filmmaking with Minecraft. It can be, you gotta find some way to, to mash up all of your, your favorite things. All right, so, so far it looks like Artifact is winning, which honestly I'm surprised by. I thought it was gonna be, I thought it was gonna be Blueprint for sure. But we'll see, I, okay. I'll give it a few more seconds. I think there's a timer that automatically... Oh, no, I can I can do it manually. And manually update live chat. That's weird. Hmm. I've never seen that before. Um, we are... And I'm not sure it's... I think it's working properly. Yes, it is. Okay, cool. So, you'll notice... And I'm not sure how many of you this will affect, uh, depending on your device. We are streaming in 2K right now. And I upped the bitrate to 10,000. So hopefully there should be a whole lot less um, quality loss in the stream today. Hopefully. And I think I think this is the first place I've actually talked about it. This after after the next mods video will be the first time or not the first time, but it, well, I mean, yes, the first time after the mods video. I will be switching to from 1080p to 2K resolution videos. So I will always be uploading in 2K, meaning that there is now a option above 1080p for those of you with a larger monitor or want a smoother video to watch. So it'll it'll be larger file sizes for me, but it'll be much prettier and hopefully the cinematics will benefit from it as well. OK. It looks like Artifact has won. I'm as, I'm as, nobody has submitted a vote in a bit. Artifact has won. Right? Yes, Artifact has won. Yeah. The video is looking a lot nicer today. I did that like five seconds before. I was like, wait a second. I actually clicked start streaming and then was like, before I hit go live, I should probably switch up the the quality because if I'm going to do this for 12 hours, I want it to look good. So yeah, let's uh, let's go ahead and hop into Artifact since 50% of you wanted that. That's kind of crazy. Seven, seven people were like, yeah, let's go ahead and build a dungeon. <laughs> um, and actually, since the last stream, I have worked on it a little bit. Um, the door that we were... You good, bro? Okay. He's good. The door that we uh, we were making in the last video, or the last stream, I made a temporary uh, model for the door. So it actually opens and closes now. There are still some sh sh issues. Hold on. Still some issues with it. Still some issues with it, but it works. And it was a proof of concept thing that I now know is a functional thing. So that's pretty dang cool. We are doing artifact. I think I already clicked. Yeah, I already clicked good. Okay, cool. And it looks like my activity feed is finally working, which is wonderful. I tried to get that all sorted. I've got a bunch of things that I fixed and, and moved around. Um, 
I had to completely redo this camera screen because it was not the way I wanted it to. I redid Snip, so the music, which is currently not on the screen, I've just now realized. Um, I forgot to copy over that asset. That's okay. What happens if I click this button? Ah, it's a black screen. It's wonderful. Ba 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 ba. MCR Creative. Woohoo! Yeah, so we've got. What else should I do? Yeah, setting up the, the thing that supposedly adds time. Oh, yeah, I have to turn on the things. I forgot I hit those. Bam and boom. Cool. Load the world. All right. First activity of the stream. Artifact. <laughs> I don't know why it's it's like, whoa. What in the world? Okay. So here's what I, what I worked on. We took that concept from the last stream where we made the door and I made a custom model. If I move this up, this is the animation. A little fast still, but you know, it's okay. Um, we've got a carved pumpkin with, uh, <laughs> with the door on it. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I put the carved pumpkin on and it's a really big model. I think this is the only way I can really do it. So I might have to change the door. I wanted it to be the same size as the blocks around it, but I this is literally the biggest I can make it, and it's not the same size. So this is what I modeled it off after. I just took a bunch of um, PNGs of the blocks and then rebuilt it in Photoshop and then put, applied the texture to the same shape. So this is the, I think it's slightly smushed. Yeah, it's definitely slightly smushed, but um, it's it's way too small. And I wanted this door to be very large, so I might have to either figure out some alternative or make the door, uh, say, four blocks by five blocks or something instead of whatever this is. Or just like seven or something. I don't know. I can't count. It's too much work. So... Might have to change the door. I'm not going to do that right now because that's that's something I would do off stream. But it's a proof of concept. It works. The door opens and it closes. I like it closing more because it's slower. So I can go. It's so cool. But I do have to fix the model. It, it kind of goes into the floor anyway. So there's already some tampering I have to do. Um, but now I guess we should figure out what to work on with artifact. We've got six by ten. Wow, you did the thing that I I said I wasn't going to do, and I am very proud of you for that. I was too lazy to count <laughs> six blocks and then ten blocks. I, I don't know why. My brain was just not ready for it. Hello. Welcome in. Uh, but yeah, this... Maybe we work on this room and just get the scaling out for the, for the large-scale product. Maybe? I feel like that probably would be fine. Yeah. Or we could mess around with more mechanics, because that was fun. At the end of the last stream, we just messed around with a bunch of pipes and stuff. I do have Sus Insert installed. Thank you so much for that. Check this out. If we get a piece of sand... Where's sand? There's sand. Or even... I think dirt works too. Um, uh, Yes. One thing I've actually noticed with it, and this is completely fine, I, I don't have any preference over it. There's two different types of dirt. There's philosophous, philosophous, fossil, 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 furus, fossil, furus, fossil, furus, <laughs> that dirt, and then suspicious dirt. Um, I can take even the door, actually. Let me try that. Open this. Watch out. Give. We can have it back. I can take a dispenser. And I can put dirt here. I can put sand here. This is modded. This is vanilla. Put the door. And then it turns it into suspicious dirt, suspicious sand. And then I can take a brush. And I can dig it out. I've never dug out a custom model. That's really odd. The reason it looks like that is because I had to do some 
some custom model magic to even get it to be the correct shape. In the custom model thing, there's only so much space you can work with, and then the scale up tool changes what it looks like when displayed in certain places. So that doesn't doesn't get applied to when it's being shuffled out of dirt. So <laughs> when it's being dug out, it's just really not the correct shape at all. But yeah, I can put anything in here, not the brush. Does it, what does this look like? Oh, nothing. Okay. I can put anything in here and it will just give me whatever I want. Ta -da! So this is how we will automate um, refilling the automation or refilling the artifact spots um, in some of the, the dungeons places. So thank you, Lion, for that. That is actually literally game changing. I no longer have to figure out some some other alternative for it. So now these blue rooms and probably some of the purple rooms too will have um, spots where sand will be on the floor and then there will be a dispenser under it and then it will shoot up a shirt or a totem or something in there and then we'll have refillable loot, which means it has replayability, which is amazing. I don't have to reload the world every time I want to play the game. I could have two armor stands but the problem is I'd have to have them perfectly synced up. I'm not sure that would work the way I want it to. One thing I could do though, is I could find a way to have two armor stands inter overlap each other. Hmm. Never mind. No, that's a dumb idea. That doesn't work at all. That doesn't really, the thing I was going to say was having the doors having one door and then a second door like in the other door that's slightly smaller so that way one would move up and the other would move over and they wouldn't be z fighting so the textures wouldn't glitch out but then i could have them move at different speeds and then they have a different size door but that doesn't really work because it still won't be the correct size texture wise at least yeah lion pulled off some absolute wizardry with uh with mod making which is just insane that that's that's so awesome uh but yes let's uh let's work on what should we work on i do play guitar yeah i'm not great but i i do play a little guitar okay cool let's make sure i didn't miss anything I'm pretty sure everything's still working right yes perfect okay um what do we do so we've got the rope the other things we could work on are the actual cosmetic part of the room. The other thing we could work on is the collection system for buying items. I've got two ideas. Number one, I think there is a way. I forget how it was. I think there's a way to move. I think there's a way to move um, items like barrels and chests horizontally. And I can't remember how I did it. Oh no, I don't want to crash my game. Hmm. Oh, I know how to do it. I think I already did this in the last stream too. I just want to make sure I'm not losing my mind. Cool. So that should shoot it out the side. Perfect. Okay, I figured it out. Yeah, I've been I've been playing. How long have I been playing? I've been playing probably. I think since my my sophomore year of high school. So that's. Oh, geez. How long has it been since high school? I think, I think six years ago. Let's see, today it's 2024 now. Oh, gosh. I was a senior in 2021, junior in 2020. So, 2019, 2020, 21, 22, 23, 24, six years? Something like that? On and off. I don't play a ton. I think that's how you count. I don't know. I might be dyslexic. <laughs> so yeah, this is this is the plan. Option one would be this is probably what we'll do, just because I remembered that I could do it. We'll we'll send an item. There will be I'll have to figure out some way to detect putting an item in. Maybe you ring a bell or something. But it'll say, oh, you put in an artifact, or or oh, you put in something. And it will send the barrel up this way 
and then as it comes up, then it will shoot out the item, detect it, put it through a sorting system, and then shoot out the appropriate re response. So if you put in a shirt or something, it'll pop out a key. And that will be how you submit points. It will also be how you submit um, shirts for keys to go further into the dungeon. So that way you can unlock these purple rooms and maybe even some of these rooms as well. Um, for two player things, it could be pressing a button at the same time. It could be having these Enderman heads because these a player can look at it and it will give off a redstone output. And if they're far apart, farther apart or like behind a wall or something to where only one person can see one at a time. I could make it so both people have to to look at the Enderman head to get through that passage. So we need doorways that two people have to get through because this is co-op. Um, what else? I think we'll work on the decorative part of the room. A piston I don't think can move it. But either way, I think, I think it'd be better just to use the pipe. Uh, the rope is part of supplementaries, yes. Yeah, I thought so, because it's a tile, tile entity. I think that's what they're called. Yeah, so what I'll do is probably bring it up, which might be a problem considering the distance it would have to drag up that barrel. It might take forever. So you'd have to either time your... Um, time your like submitting your artifacts appropriately or you would have to just or I'd have to find some faster way to do it two pressure plates for going up and down you mean I almost just took a bite of that okay have a good day good luck at work salute you for your for your Dedication. Chapstick in there. There... I don't think there's a rope limit. I mean, I'll try. I mean, other than how much you can put in the pulley. So as long as it's under 64 blocks, it should be okay. What happens if I fill it with a hopper, though, actually? Rope. Rope. Aha. Uh -huh. So theoretically, and this will not work. Oh, for two players, they're just going to come down the same rope. Theoretically, I could just continue putting rope in here. The problem is this goes down faster than the hopper goes, so I'd probably have to use a pipe for that. And then on top of that, getting the pipes back out. Which actually, now that I think about it, is still possible. That's going all the way down. Oh, it's slowing down. Oh, it's because now it's at hopper speed. Okay. It has now gotten to the floor, I'm assuming. Yeah, okay, cool. So my idea... Take these, and then I take what I do. I do this. I have one input here, where I have a chest. Let me get a wrench. This will spit out items. Cool. And then I need a fiddling. Fitting. So I'll take a white fitting. Do you know the stream is like 45 per sec 45 seconds behind? Oh, is it? Huh. It shouldn't be. You might be 45 seconds behind. Let's see, where am I? I just grabbed the fitting in where I see myself in the stream. So that was like maybe 10 seconds. I'm not sure. That might just be for you. Uh, do we know any good... Mod packs with create mod. Oh boy, do I. You're going to have to stick around for later in the stream. Uh, Blueprint is the mod pack I made with create mod. And I think it's a wonderful mod pack. Although that, that's just my opinion. Um, it could be terrible. I would never know. But yeah, um, Blueprint is a good one. I like that one. 
Let's see, what else? Uh, create Above and Beyond is one I haven't had the the honor of testing out yet. I, I played it briefly, but I, I haven't really given it a whole lot of time, and I wanted to. Create Above and Beyond. Is that what I just said? Hold on. There's the Skyblock one. Create... I think it's just called Create Block. Everything in the Sky. That's one I, I've spent a bit of time in, and I've had a lot of fun with that. Um... Yeah, that's a good one. What else? I can't think of any other ones. Those are like the those are like the big two, other than the one I made myself, which I'm biased because I made it, so it's it's my perfect mod pack. But as far as ones other people have made, I think those are the only two I can think of. Ooh, I'm gonna make sure that works. So then theoretically I can do theoretically do this. Bam. And that should go into the rope thingy. That's cool. That is fine. Okay. Grab rope. Let's see how fast this fills up. Okay, so it's faster than a hopper, but still slower than a hopper. Wait, faster than a hopper, but then still not... Actually, let's see. Can it catch up? It's the same speed. Okay, that's good. I'm doing good. Nice to see you again. Oh, I already had... There we go. Cool. That works. I'm doing well. How are you? I know... I forgot what I was going to say. Never mind. <laughs> yes, how are you? Welcome in. What time is it? I think it's like, it's like what, 8 p.m. or something? No, 6. I forget what time. But it's it's not early, so I, I appreciate you stopping by. Um, What do I do? What do I do? Yes, that was what I was going to do. I need a block. That's a block. We'll take that one. I'll take it. And then I got to power this. No. Rut row. How do I do this? Uh-oh. I'm losing all the rope. Um, I swear that was how you did it. What if I do it like this? I'm trying to figure out how to power it directly. If I do this... Nope, that still does it. What if I do it with a repeater? Sure. Yeah, we'll we'll still be here. <laughs> We're gonna be here for a long while. Let's try that. Nope, that did not work. That did not work at all. Okay. How do we get this power? It powered it when it was right in front of it. If I take an input from above. No, because that's not gonna work. I need to power this one specifically. It oh! I know how to stop it. Actually, wait, no, maybe not. Hold on. If I put something in here, that's going to shoot out the side. If I switch it, would that go... That's going to go up now, no? Yeah, okay. Hmm. Oh, how... how uh... I can't think of words. How interesting. A block between the pipe. between In between the repeater and the pipe. Maybe? So like it's powering the block? The reason why it worked before was not because that lever was powered. It was because there was an item or something in the way. If I put something as small as a torch. Just get like a regular torch. It will switch directions. Because right now it will shoot out the side. If I have this here, now it's going up. As soon as I take this away, just so I don't lose my, my rope here, it will shoot out the side. Pipe, fitting, pipe. Well, the problem is then it's going to start accumulating in this pipe, and I want to avoid that. Yeah. If I can move a pist or move a... Move a uh, one of these. 
I cannot. Okay. Hmm. So now we're left. So what I want to try to do is I'm going to try to input pipes through the or input a rope through this one and have this toggled off. So that way is it will still accumulate in here. So even having an item in front of it doesn't help. It just doesn't shoot out. Well, I want to have I want to have rope in here. The rope goes in here. This this is a system that I might not even need to use, but I, I still want to see if I can figure it out. So I want to take um there. That makes me happy. Oh, it just shot out the side. Whoops. Okay. I want to have the the rope go up through here. So this is overriding the fact that this has nothing behind it, so it just directly goes over. It goes directly into the rope pulley here. And then I want this to be toggled off so that way it doesn't suck out anything that's in this block. It will use all the rope. You put a lever on the pipe directly last. No, no, I didn't put a pipe directly on the lever. I put it in front of it. I did, I did this. And I thought it was because it was powered. It was stopping it from going through, but it's just because there was something in the way. If I put something in here until this is broken. This pipe isn't long enough. Until that's broken, nothing will happen. So that can be powered. It can be not powered. As long as there's something in the way, it won't work. I was able to put signs as long as it was long enough, but I don't think levers... Yeah, levers don't work. Can't put torches either. I put torches on this? Nope. Okay. So I gotta figure out a way to... I know there's a way to power them. I know you can power fittings. Hmm. But yeah, I wanna I wanna take rope out of here, put rope into the pulley, send down the rope, and I can put in as much rope as a double chest could, theoretically. Or a double chest plus a hopper. I don't I won't need that much, but um redstone torch underneath the pipe. Maybe we could try that. I don't know if powering the pipe is going to do anything, that's the thing. I don't think it is. That seems that seems like it wouldn't work. Oh, whoops. Need the fitting. Yep, it didn't work. Oh, well. We'll figure something out. I know there's a way... So you can do it with the... You can do it with the fittings. You can power these, and that will stop it. So if I have it like this... It won't go through, because it's, now it's caught here. Sticking it out there does that. But I want to figure out a way to do that, because I can't use the fitting to suck out blocks. It has to be a pipe. Which means the pipe has to be accumulating. There is no special pipe variant, I don't think. In redstone, I'm assuming, yeah. The closest thing I have to change the mechanics of something like that would be corroded, but that just makes it slower. I mean, I guess I could revisit the wiki. Probably a good idea. Um, but yeah, I want to have it go in, go all the way down, come back up, and then the second pipe suck out all of the excess, because if I that way I can have more than 64 rope in a pulley. Let's, let's go to Mudrunth and check it out. copper pipes deposit their inventories blah 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 mm -hmm, mm -hmm. cooldowns transfer copper fitting is placed behind a copper pipe pipes transferring cooldown will be based on the fittings cooldown instead well, that's good to know Certain items like ink sacks, glowing sacks, and scope sensors will emit particles. So theoretically, this has been updated. This is different than the last time. Oh! Oh, that's cool! Oh, this is new! More things! I think my mod pack is out of date, though. Let's see, can I update this mod? 
We've got no, so much new stuff. Let's see. Simple copper pipes. Where is that at? Might have to restart the game. Uh, update. Hold on. We gotta update this. More features. Gosh, I hope this works. This is such a specific mod pack. I'm not sure it will, but we'll see. Try rope pulley pipe. I could try rope pulley. Fitting pipes, chest, redstone, the fitting. Maybe. The problem is, if I do put a fitting there, I still need the pipe to go over, and that means the items are already going to get sucked out into the fitting. So I can stop it at the fitting, but the pipe itself, I, I need to be able to stop that. Hi, Spider. We are having fun. We are doing some dungeon building to start out the stream or subathon. I hope you have a wonderful day. Thank you for stopping by. Okay. Hopefully this works. Oh, that's a start. Gray screen. Oh, a logo. That's even better. Do not crash on world start. Do not crash on world start. Do not crash on world start. Please. I do not want to have to troubleshoot a mod pack in the middle of a live stream. <laughs> Please. Hey. Okay. Yes. Okay. We've got the new stuff. Encoding overloaded. If it's lagging, it should, it'll be the second. All right. Cool. Okay, so we've got a bunch of new things to work with. So, new stuff. Let's see, I'm going to put this temporarily on my second monitor, so I won't be able to see the chat. Um, whoa, 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 hold on. <gasps> Roba. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> it worked. Oh, yay, I'm so happy. Thank you, Roba. I really appreciate that. I'm so glad everything's working. I got new sounds. Oh, it's working. Yes. Okay. Thank you for the super chat. That is awesome. I never know how to respond to these things. Maybe the sub thought it wasn't a good idea. <laughs> but thank you very much. I really appreciate that. Uh, I'm always I'm always awestruck whenever I see that. I don't know what to say. <laughs> Thank you so much. Um, okay. All mobs. Yep, knew that. Okay. Let's try this. What happens if I do that? So I think this is... Oop, that's not right. I think this is new. Oh... That's awesome. Interesting that it comes out here too. What if I make it longer? Is it going to do the whole pipe? It does do the whole pipe. Interesting. Okay. The word is starting. <laughs> Super chat. Okay. Well, that's cool. I'm not sure exactly what I would use this for. Theoretically, not that this really does anything. Theoretically, I could shear a bee. Oh, it's gonna take a while. Nope, not even gonna. Not even gonna. It's not even worth it because even if it does work, it doesn't mean anything. Nope, not doing that. I was gonna wait for a bee to pollinate the hive. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll just move it over so I can see chat. Smoke follows the same rules. Needing a lit campfire to be placed behind the entry pipe. Copper fittings will renew the flow of smoke. Beehives and bee nests will now count smoke. Okay, so I didn't even need to do it anyway. So I can smoke campfires using the smoke pipes, which is awesome. I wonder if that's why. So I could just have a line of them 
and no fear of the bees burning themselves because the pipe would keep it from doing that. Um, can be used in honey farming. So that's pretty awesome. Copper pipes, alt clipping. Oh, that's for, that's for waxing it. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. When a copper pike's exposed to air, pick up vibrations. We already knew that. So maybe it isn't new. Maybe I just missed stuff last time. I think, it, yeah, I think that's it. I thought there was new stuff. Maybe it was just the pipes, or maybe I'm going crazy. Let me check the actual uh, change log. Fixed crashes. Yeah, okay, so there's nothing new. I just missed it last time. Okay. So, how do, how do we dis, how would do we dis, dis? Oh, I know how to do it. It's going to be slower, but it will function. So that's pretty nice. Nope, never mind. I don't know how to do it. Change my mind. It won't work. Hmm. Let's try doing a rope pulley on the, the copper pipe. I don't think this will function, but we'll see. Oh, oh. It works. That's good to know. Where are you even getting? Oh, it was already in there. That's pretty awesome. Okay. Well, that 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 uh, that changes things. So now this is gonna be such a dumb system. So we're gonna do this. <laughs> Put it in two, and then I'll take a, a turntable. Like that. This on here. Switch the rotate. Oh, this is such a dumb system. <laughs> uh, I have to set up one of those, basically. Or uh, a, a T flip flop. T flip flops aren't bad, I guess. So this is such a dumb system. If it works, it works, though. Let's see if we can do it. I'm just going to get rid of this. This is annoying me. Yeah, yeah, I know world edits faster. Okay. So now, theoretically, what I could do... Oh, no, that's not going to work. I lied again. It's not working. Wait, no. Hold on. Maybe it will work. Let's see. If I take this out here, that's going to shoot into... That's going to shoot at the side. It's not going to shoot out the right direction, isn't it? Dang it, I thought I was big brain. I'm not big brain. Oh, I might be big brain. Hold on. Hold on. Take this. Ah. Uh, hold on. That's not going to work. It might work. I'm going through a roller coaster of emotions right now. Let's see. So I've got one turntable for going up, one turntable for going down. Now this is this is this mod pack is so much fun. Crazen and I put this together and we had a blast putting all together, like combining all these different mechanics. And this is without create mods, so we have to rely on features rather than devices specifically for doing those things like they have um elevator pulleys i could just make an elevator but now i have to figure out how do i make an elevator without an elevator pulley that i love that kind of stuff just make the input go in from the side the problem is the input going from this what do you mean input going from the side oh <gasps> oh that would that would make it easier I don't have to make it go in from the top. You're so right. Not sure if that's what you meant, but that works. And then I could have that. Boom. Maybe, theoretically, just a theory, a game theory. 
Perhaps? Maybe? In a world? Let's see. So if I have this go up, that's actually too high. So many pulleys in my inventory right now. Just need the one. This is this is such a dumb system, but I oh no, but I love it. Okay. Theoretically, I could tick this down one and it will spit out anything in this one. Move this back up and it will stop. Oh, I think we just figured it out. This is <laughs> this is such a dumb system. Okay. Oh no. I just realized this isn't gonna work. Oh wait, no, this could still work. Hold on. It might still be big brain. Let's see. Ooh. Yeah, it's still big brain. We're still good. I was gonna say we need one of these on this side too. Yeah, we're fine. Okay. Yeah, that works. Okay. Rube Goldberg. Pretty much. That's what this whole thing is. Up here. Oh, wait. No, you were here for this. Oh, yes. This one's permanently going. Push a button. T flip flop. Goes into this. That changes the polarity. That goes down. Sends uh, a signal. Once it reaches the bottom, sends another signal. On the second signal, start this timer. Timer finishes. Go back up. Do this. Toggle T flip flop. Boom. Machine. That is a Rube Goldberg device definition. Like the definition of a Rube Goldberg device. I made a Rube Goldberg device in, in middle school. Never finished it, but worked. Okay. So really, I only need a one tick pulse. I don't need this to go on and off. This is such a dumb system. Oh, wait, no, it's fine. Never mind. I was gonna I was gonna have a, a meltdown until I realized I already finished it. I was like, how do I get the ropes in there? There's already a chest for it. Okay, so theoretically, what I could do is I put Hold up. Wait a minute. That do that. Do that. And then do that, and then that, and then that, and then I, th oh, come on, do I, is this really necessary? Do I actually have to, <laughs> I need another one, because I need these to be opposites from one another. This is so dumb. Okay. <laughs> so what I need to happen is I need two of these, I think. So overly complicated. I'm probably doing this in the least efficient way possible. I can't think of any better way to do it. Okay, let me grab, let me grab this stuff. I'm going to build the systems off to the side just to make sure they work. Okay. Funny, let's go up one. So I need a T flip flop, which means I need a jar. An invisible jar. I need water bucket. I need a dispenser. So dumb. Should do it. The jar. Where's the jar at? 
Jargon. The guy who made own kingdom. Alright, there we go. Now we got ourselves a T flip flop. We've got an input. Boom, push button, go in. Boom, push button, go down. How's the direction of a pipe determined? It's based on the lip of it. So if I place it, you'll see there's this, this rim here. That means it's going up. So if I do this, it's still going to go up. I think. Actually, let's, let's see what happens. I think it should still shoot up because it prioritizes the, the straight one above it rather than switching directions. Oh. Really? Is it random? I've still got some learning to do about these. Hmm. Never mind. Okay. So what you're trying to do, but if you need a state of each pulley, control the opposing. You're right. Could I do that? So what I'm trying to do is I need a second one because once this goes down, then it will just be a big loop. The, it will suck the, the extra rope out, send it back into the chest, but then this will suck it back in. So what I need to do is make this pipe go up so that way it stops taking um, items out of the chest. And then when I'm done, when this is now empty and everything is back in the chest, then I need to flip flop them when I'm ready to lower the rope again. This is so dumb. I, I, this is, this is so dumb. You can make a texture pack that make the jar invisible. That's fine. It's, it's only invisible as an icon. It's okay. They fixed it in the next update. Um, but for some reason, I have that next update in Blueprint, and now the Enderman head is invisible. So I got the jar, but now the Enderman head is invisible. That, it doesn't matter. I'm, it's good. So you said I could try to. Alternate it with the same redstone. So that's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to basically do this. So I have a, an input here. Is this hooked up? It's hooked up to a comparator. Comparator. I say comparator. There we go. So now it will detect if there's something inside of the jar. And then I go like this. Is that it does not invert, doesn't it? Oh, I need the redstone dust. Wondering why that wasn't working. That works, okay. In an hour? Oh my gosh, it almost has. That's supplementaries. This is so much brain power for noon. Feel like I'm still waking up. So, what I need to happen is flick this lever, and then flick this lever. I gotta reverse the polarities here. Theoretically, I could just do this, and then also And then when I click this button, that will stop pulling. Let me add this to a... Man, I hate doing this. Stupid. I think that's all. I just need to do one more. Bam, boom. Jar. Down, that's got water in it. Cool, do that. Boom, repeater. Cool, now that will extend it. So when this one is powered, it should power this. And then likewise, I need one. This is such a dumb system. Oh, is that not connect? It does connect, okay. Oh, it's so slow. But that's going the wrong direction, isn't it?
This is boggling my mind. If I push, where's the button? Button, button. Push the button. It goes down. What? Uh, this is 1.20.1. Jarstone? Did I say Jarstone? I meant Redstone. You flip the direction of one of those pull. Yeah, this might be it's going up, it's going down, it's going up, it is also going up. But right now, are they offset? They are not offset, so I need this. That goes down. These should both be same. If I push this button, nothing changed. So dim. I don't know why I'm doing this. This is, I mean, I know I need this system, but at the same time, why does it do that? Okay. Why does it do a double pulse? I don't know. It works. Hi, Treyas. Welcome in. Pulling the chest into the two pipes. Did that work? Maybe? Possible huzzah moment? Perhaps a yippee? Let's see. Enjoy your breakfast. I should probably do that too. I haven't eaten. I've had a banana. That's it. <laughs> Enjoy your food. We will be here when you get back. We are currently making a mini game right now. We uh, we did a poll at the beginning of the stream, and we voted um, we voted to work on this. This is my my dungeon runner co op modded. Uh, that's it. That's the whole thing. A co op dungeon runner, co op modded dungeon runner. So right now, what we're trying to do is I have a system. Let me, let me go down here. I have a system. This is like a model of the version, like the full size room. So it will be bigger when we're actually building it. But I just wanted to get the vibe. It's going to be a really big room where you two of the players come down on the rope. And then there are different ways you can go to go explore different dungeon rooms. Um, but in the main room where, where we are now, there will be a rope that comes down here. You put an item in it. It sends it back up. It detects for that item and then sends it back down and throws down a key or whatever. So, yeah. We're trying to right now figure out how do we make it so the, what are we even doing? Oh yeah, this, okay. Now I remember why this system is basically dumb. So we're trying to figure out a way to make it so more than 64 rope can be used because right now this has a max inventory of 64 blocks or 64 chains or whatever. So we're trying to make it so you can put two stacks of rope perhaps and it will it will go down 128 blocks instead of just 64. But that requires an external storage system. So I'm trying to make it so the pipes will input extra rope into this pulley here. So that way, when this rope is lowering down, it has extra rope to lower down into it. But then, once the rope comes back up, then suck out the excess rope so that way it has enough room to store 64 in here, back into the chest, but then stop this rope from sucking it and putting it right back in so it doesn't create a big loop. So I'm trying to make a really terrible system to have it loop, and it was just suggested to me to... Just move the chest instead of moving the pipes. Which theoretically sounds like it could work. So I'm, I'm going to try that. That would save a lot of time. Let's see. 
So if I have the pipe up, let's just do two blocks just to be safe. No, I want... Yeah, we'll do one up here. That's going into... Into that. We have a pipe going from... No, no, no. I don't want this. I want this to be offset. What happens if I put something in here? Get shot out this side. Okay. Theoretically, what I could do... Have this. Go into that. Go into this. Boom. So that should be at the side. The chest here. Go here. I then have a turntable and a pulley. Like this. And then I take this system from before and I apply two turntables to it. Like that. And then I, and I rebuild this system again for the third time. How long do I need to be? Three, four blocks? Five blocks? Let's do five blocks just to be safe. Like this. Let's grab the cog blocks. Do that, right? Should be fine. Yep, cool. Do that. Redstone torch. Stop it. Wasn't done. Similarly to the system up here, it's going to be permanently uh, going. This will be so high up, it shouldn't matter. Assuming we even need to do this. It might just be 60, less than 64 blocks. Which it probably will, because... Why would it be 64 blocks? That's a ridiculous number. So let's get this. Right there. This can be three blocks back. Peter. Yoink. There, yoink. Need the glass jar with the water in it. And then we need this with just the... Bam. Cool. In theory, that should work. And then we need to button... Boom. Okay. That should alternate the polarity. Oh, I didn't... I didn't build this in the right spot. Push this again. Oh. <sighs> Yeah, great start. I'm gonna come down here. I will copy this with the axe. This is position. And then I cut. And then I paste. So now it's one down. In theory, according to my calculations, push this button. Yes, that works. Kind of don't know what does that still. That works. So I could hook this up to here. Like so. And then have the wait, wait, that's not going to work. Bye, dish shop. Thank you for popping in. This isn't going to work. And the same problem from before. You, you possibly stop this very much. Your line is by dish shop. A weird line to have. Hmm. Now the problem we had before, where this is going to suck out the pipes anyway, that's not going to work. But that was a good idea, because that stops, that stops it from intaking from the chest and, and outtaking from the, from the pipe. That was a good idea. Is there a way we could... So it looks like I'd still have to pull up a pipe anyway. 
that would that would stop it at this pipe but we need it to stop over there so it doesn't take any rope out that was a good idea though well matt pat always says in a theory a game theory or whatever you do not own the copyright to those two words i could say whenever i want huh we gotta do about it huh you gonna you gotta copyright strike me for saying in theory in theory you can't do that so mm -hmm. <laughs> we are making a rope extender for some reason i don't know why we're doing this let's just let's just take a break from this this whole system is not working um I mean, theoretically, it does work, but it's just really inefficient. Let's actually try it. Let me let me put two stacks of rope in this. Look at how fast that's moving. Oh, okay. So inputting it into storage blocks is slower than inputting it through pipes. That makes sense. Okay. So, you could flick this. What we're trying to do um, is we're trying to make it so we can have a system... This is inputting rope at the same speed that this is dispensing it. That will go down 128 blocks, which normally the capacity is 64 because it has one slot here. But because we have a, a pipe consistently feeding it rope, we can we can do infinite. This is not create mod, no. This is supplementaries mixed with uh, simple copper pipes. This mod pack does not have create. Rope pulley shares an inventory. Feel like the rope pulley shares inventory with the adjacent inventory. If that if that's true, that simplifies this quite a lot. If true, gamer moment it does not. I'm assuming that's what you mean. I we don't have a mod list for this. There's so many mods in this mod pack. I can, if you ask me about a specific component, I can, I can tell you which ones are in it. This is, this is all from supplementaries, the jar, the copper pipes, or not the pipes, sorry, the copper, the, the, what are these called? Cog blocks? Cog blocks are from supplementaries. These pipes are from simple copper pipes. Um, that's pretty much the main things we've been working with so far. We've got decorative blocks. There's audio player mod with uh, automated music discs. That's from, this cactus is from Wilder Wilds, I believe. Uh, suspicious variants are from Better Architecture, or Better Archaeology. That's from Supplementaries, that's from Supplementaries. Flags are from Supplementaries. Most of the stuff is from Supplementaries. I think that's pretty much everything. Supplementaries is like the big mod in here. Um, it adds pretty much most of the... Oh, I don't even have... Hold on. I did. I built this two blocks too high. Is there more? Oh, dear. How many blocks did I give it? Is that 128? I think that's 128. We should see 128 back of the chest. Let's teleport up here. Um, love to see, be here for the entire stream. Most of all, plays want to see. Yeah, that's fair. I mean, the VOD will be here if you'd like to tune in then. Um, yeah, the really quiet. There we go. Turned up the music just a little bit. This is really loud for me, so I might turn it back down. But yeah, that's uh, that looks like 128. Actually, let me just... Let me pull it back up. That's probably the fastest way to do this. Press this button. No, wait, 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 wait. That. And then push that. That starts bringing the rope back up. Press this button. That should bring this down. That will put the pipes. Now we start seeing the ropes go back in. 
So that system functions. It's not ideal, but it works. So that's pretty dang cool. And hopefully we should see two stacks of rope in this chest by the time it reaches the top. If not, then I probably accidentally broke one, which is fine. 61, I broke a few. Hello, hello. Let's see. Let's try this again. Test number two. Oh, and push this button. Wait. There we go. It's gone down. It has like a cooldown, which is fine, but it's kind of slow. It just means we have to start it earlier. Although I guess if it's for the for the treasure thing that we were working, yep, it's too left. If it's for the for the barrel for buying items, that delay is kind of unfortunate, but until I can find a better way, that's the best we've got. Uh, wait for that to stop going down. That's it. That's all we've got. And then flick this lever, flick this lever, push this button. That will move the pipes down. As long as there's no ropes stuck in this pipe, it should work just fine. I think it's I think it's working. So this just needs like a one tick pulse. It doesn't need to be consistently on. I'm going to pretend like I know that word and definitely not look it up. I know I know the word. I just can't remember it. Yeah, that's not good. Coming radioactive is not something uh, I would recommend. Where did we get the extra rope from? Excuse me. That will go back down. Push this button again. This will go back around if any pipes do happen to get through. Which it doesn't look like it matters anyway. Where did I get that stone from? Excuse me. I've got two monitors. I see, I see. Well, now we know how to make an elevator. I think I will phase through the block if it goes up, though. I'm not sure. And also, it's not super smooth, but it's an elevator. That's pretty cool. I'm assuming that's as far down as it goes. Just so I can see it better from up top. Just add a... I'm going to add a lamp. Or no, let's add an illum... A loop... Illuminator. There we go. Now it's permanently on. Teleport. Cool. Put that in. Put that. Ropes will start to come back up. Push this button. That will switch which pipes are up. Should be all good. No ropes stuck in this pipe. Awesome. After experimenting with create elevators, that looks so clunky. Yep, no, this is... By no means a small device. And this is also just to make sure it can even work, because I don't want to start by minimizing the scale. Like these other machines here, I they started a lot larger than they'll probably end up being. Okay. I swear if I see two stacks in one, we're good. Okay. That works. That's pretty cool. So now if we want to do more than 64 blocks, then yeah, we can. I do use essential, but not on this mod pack. We did not add it. I, I don't think we knew about that mod before um, before this was made. Because this was made in the summer. So we've, I've had this for almost a year now. Which is kind of crazy to think about. Alright, let's focus on let's focus on building. 
So what we want to do is try to make you feel really small in this very grand scaled cage or cage cave. So priority is atmosphere. We want something that's quite large. We'll start off. Let's just do concrete. That's what all the builders do, right? Sure, cyan works fine. Why not? So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to fly out because I have no idea how big this is going to be. Go for it. That'll probably be big enough. The nice thing about this is I don't think I don't think I have to I'm not limited to scale because I'm not using a map like Tango does in his decked out or his his dungeon. So I don't think I have to maintain the uh, the scale that he did. I can go larger if I really wanted to. Hi, Ohio, Gyat, Rizzler, Sussy, Baka, Skibbity, Toilet of Ohio. Welcome in. My goal for the stream, this is a, a celebration for 7,000 subscribers and 100 Discord members, which we're currently at 179, so I'm a little bit late on that one, but I thought I would put them together since it took me so long to set up everything. Um... I copy and paste on a 10x scale. Maybe. I feel like I would rather just start from scratch because this is not the shape I want to go with. It's going to be very rough, but I could try it. If that's even the thing. Oh, that might crash. I'm, I'm going to try just like a 2x scale just for testing. I don't want to crash this, this world. You forget there's a delay. I can't see. I don't know why you're saying why. Oh, did it go down? It was at 7k when I started the stream. Womp womp. Oh well. It was going to be preemptive anyway. I announced this much before. Oh yeah, it went down. Oh well, that's fine. Yeah, I'm going to go... It was 7k right when I hit hit uh, start. Really? 10? We lost 10 subs? Oh no, it's just it's one off. We're literally at we're literally at six nine nine nine. Wait, 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 wait. Six nine nine nine. A one off. Okay, uh what block am I looking for? This one. I was gonna say, <laughs> if we we lost ten subs, people really didn't like this stream. <laughs> I'm not disappointed. I'm not I'm literally fine by me. If people don't like my stuff, that is totally okay. Okay, I want to get this copied. That's correct. Yep, that's right. And that's fine. Whatever. It's just one person. Um, copy. I guess just go over. Sure, that's fine. Just to test it, we'll see. Go up one. I'm not going to use this, so it doesn't really matter. How do I paste it? How do I make it big? How make how make not small? I don't expand. <laughs> I appreciate that, Ivan. Oh geez. You've nuked an egg. Very impressive. Slash slash scale. Forward slash. What? I think it's just slash scale. Yeah, it's just slash scale. Multiply. No, nope, that's not it. Um, control. It's not control V. I promise you it's not control V. It's actually Alt F4, that'll do it. Don't really don't know the button. Okay, I will I'll look it up then. Ah, I see, I see. Scaling things in world edit. I don't know what to call it. Out of the egg came Tremorzilla. <laughs> sure. I'm using world edit. 
there's no i don't think there's if there is axiom for this version i i, I don't know how to use it i know more world edit than i do axiom how to scale or double the size expand it is expand okay to double it just do okie it's not expand Cursor error at six, no viable alternative. That's too many things. I don't know. No axiom. Nope. I used it one time and then never again because I didn't understand it. I've not. Yeah, that's definitely going to help. Don't do that. It's going gonna, it's gonna to close out to your browser. All mobile users, press Alt F4. <laughs> press Q with your diamond sword and then looking at lava. Oh, yeah, that's a good one. I've learned that I learned that the in the alpha days back when when iron golems just handed you d netherite blocks and in, in alpha minecraft okay I guess we're building by scratch that's fine too many too many big brain things I I don't have big enough brain for try expand vert two what does that mean Two, 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 two. Too many arguments. Expand vert. Ooh. I know axioms easy. I've used it before. I was just, I didn't have the patience to learn how to do a mountain. I don't know what that means. Wow, it's so much larger. Wow, it really changed a whole lot. It didn't do anything. Hmm. Okay, well, at least I didn't destroy the world. I saw... Where was it? Where was it? There it is. I saw 193,000 blocks and that scared me. <laughs> I didn't know what that meant. Uh, do I know the function? No, I, I I have no clue how to use the jigsaws. I'm just going to hand build it. I like being detailed anyway. Want to be the next video of your blueprint series? I have it on my schedule. I'm not sure how tightly knit I will be with that schedule. It might be April 12th, but I, I might move around my videos. I inevitably will. It could be... Because I got... Hoping... I'm not sure how uh, if I'll be able to get it done by then. I've been working on this this mods video forever. This is the one I needed 408 people for. Somebody's honking. Um, this mods video hopefully is going to be done on Tuesday, so the 19th of March. We'll see. I'm working with a musician right now to write a piece for it. And then I've got how to make Minecraft feel like a movie. Uh, in four days, because that should be a smaller video. I should be able to get that done fairly fast. I've got how to turn Minecraft into Sims, which will be four days after that. And then 15 plus mods that fix Minecraft missing features. And then the finale finale, finally, of the Create Mods World's Fair. Hopefully. Hopefully. <laughs> really hoping I actually follow through with that this time. The last time I had it on there... I got overwhelmed with the amount of amount of stuff I had to do for that. So hopefully I'll finally get that done. If not, then I'll swap blueprint and create mod and delay it even further. And then I got to figure out some way to be more accountable because that one video has been on my weighing on my shoulders for like months now. Um, so blueprint will either be on the 2nd or on the 12th of April. Hopefully. If I am at a position where I can still make videos in April, <laughs> we'll see. I am I am unsure. Every day is a is a new day. Let's start with uh let's start with just the basic palette. We want to start from the darker tones. Should we start from deep slate or should we start from stone? Tough. What is what was our we had a palette I thought I think I broke it. Yeah I broke it. Jigsaw is used in placing huge structures in the world's randomizing each structure. Ah. Okay. 
Yeah, I think I had heard about that. I just, I haven't used it myself. Okay, let's get tough. Let's get, let's get nuts. Let's get, actually, that's not bad, tough. I'm just going to make like a gradient. Those look almost identical. That one is darker though. No, that doesn't work. I could go directly. No. No, no work. Then we need... Cobblestone stone. Cobblestone. Stone. Every 24 hours a day passes. Every day is a new day. That's actually a really good quote. Because that, that really defines... People are often stuck because they're like... Everything is consistently bad. But every day is a new day. If, all, if nothing else, you can start fresh. On some things, obviously. It doesn't apply to everything. But you got a full day. That day is done. A new day. Boom. Fresh start. You get one of those every 24 hours. That doesn't mean you can't keep a good thing going after that 24 hours. I'm so wise. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> Let's get rocky dirt. That's what I was missing. And then do I have regular dirt in here? Got dripstone. I feel like it's missing something for the blend. I know packed mud probably should be in this palette. What if I go dripstone? No, I need that gray blend. 24 hours is still today. That is true, it is still today. But it's not today, it was now, yet today is today, but yesterday was today, yesterday. So, you know, like, ooh. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm I'm tired. I went to bed late after hoping to go to bed early because I wasn't I wasn't ready with the stream. I still needed to do the the ghouls the whatever they're called. Making what? Hold on. Oh, I need to watch those. I didn't realize you made videos. Okay, can I do dirt and can I do coarse dirt? Oh, I... They could just go dirt. Does that benefit the palette at all? And then that's not gonna... <laughs> Did we not just listen to this? That'll keep it from oxi or oxidizing. Growing grass on it. Is that our palette? I don't see myself missing anything. I got the um, the mossy variants, but I'll, I'll put that in separately. Five things hanging over the lance text. Those are TCG cards. I love when people ask this question. Uh, these are the Hermitcraft trading cards. I've got a signed Mumbo card. You kind of see it. I've got... i got to get a better thing for this. This is about to fall off. Ooh. I've got signed Scar. Can't even see the signature on it. See the blue? There it is. Signed Scar. I've got a signed Green. And then I've got an unsigned B-dubs and an unsigned Etho. We're good. Okay. I'm always worried that's going to fall off if I touch it. Because it's it's hanging up on push pins, but the push pins have been re-put so many times it's almost loose now. So I'm always scared it's going to break. Um, let's copy this. 
What am I looking for? Brush? Wand. That's it. Good. Fifty. Seventy. Haste. Ta-da! SpongeBob. What is today, but yesterday's tomorrow? Pretty much. Yeah, I kind of I kind of put too much money into the CCG cards. <laughs> But it makes for great decor, so it was totally worth it. Alright, I think that's going to be our palette for at least this room. I love how this almost this texture is almost seamless from afar. It looks like they're connected. That's really nice. How have we almost already been going for two hours? That's crazy. I guess we still have, what, half an hour? 20 minutes? Still, a little wild. I'll look at your, uh, your Rex thing that you were looking for, Town Square, I'm assuming. Oh, that's cool. That's from Alex's, right? Alex's Caves? Forget what you mentioned about it. Nuked an egg. Yeah, okay, that is from Alex's Caves. That's sick. You go back to the game. There we go. Music's too loud. Better. All right, cool. Oh. Oh, I didn't get my stand up. Oh, well. Make sure you're staying hydrated. Water's good for you. Hmm. You travel one second per second? That's crazy. I travel two seconds every two seconds. You're slower than me. Or no, I'm slower than you. I mean, there is technically a difference. If I only process time every two seconds, you're we're getting the same. I'm basically lagging. <laughs> Hold up a second. Wah. Dogs were barking. Someone's dogs. I don't have any dogs. Hold up. Wait a minute. What kind of thing is happening with Discord? I can know what you're missing out on. Basically, we've got random conversations about random topics. I got spoilers and sneak peeks on videos, notifications. That's usually... I, I'm very active on the Discord, so that's usually where... Um, that's usually where I announce things first. Like the this stream, I announced it multiple days ago, and I forgot to do the community post until last night. So I was a little bit, uh, a little bit slow on that, but that's okay. I got it eventually. <laughs> Buffering. Yes. I think we're going to focus on the brown tones for the bottom section. Let's grab, oh, the reference is over here. I went the wrong way. Yoink. Yoink. Yeah, maybe don't do that anymore. <laughs> you weren't you were trying to get people to buy games for you. Don't don't do that. You'd like to get Discord, but you're not allowed. Nah, that's unfortunate. Yeah, I, I didn't have um I wasn't allowed to have Snapchat until I was like thirteen. And then they realized there's not really anything worse about Snapchat than any other social media, so then I I, I was allowed to get it anyway. Um, I think we're going to try to focus on the brown tones. No. Let's see, what do we do? So the whole point of having the stone... Yeah, I gotta do the stone at the bottom. It makes more sense, too. Okay, so this will be the starting room. And I can move this around with world edit, too. Let's just get the scale. What is the the thing that we land on? How likely am I to accept a collab with another creator? It's not a matter of likelihood as far as chance. I have to I have to like the content that they make and agree with their ideals as far as how they go about making their things. So if you make good content, but you're really focused on numbers, I'm less likely to say yes. 
if you're a fun personality and you're 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 a cool person, I admire what you do. I'm more likely to say yes. Um, but also at the moment, unless it's something that I'm like, whoa, this is this is just something I have to be a part of. I'm not sure right now I would even say yes, just because I have so many projects. I don't want to start another one. I've got I've got blueprint. I've got cold craft. I've got revolutions. I've got one, two, and I've got world's fair. Three, four, and possibly five mod videos. I've got a series that I haven't even talked about yet. I've got some in-between videos that should be smaller but still take time. Um, I've got another series I haven't talked about yet. And then a few, few other videos I wanted to do in between. So I have a ton of different projects that I've been trying to all do at the same time. So right now I would probably say no just because unless it's somebody I already know very well and they they give me a proposition that's just out of this world I will probably I will probably decline. Need to pay. You don't need to pay for the membership. You don't need to sell games to buy a membership. That's not necessary. <laughs> you wanted to buy games. Save the money from the games to buy other games. If you want satisfactory, spend your save your money for that. It's a great game. That's why I have 120 hours in it. <laughs> 11 series put in the same time, some in between. Yeah, I got a lot of stuff. 11? That seems too many. That, that can't be right. So I've got Cold Craft. I've got Create Mods World's Fair, which was just the last episode. Blueprint. Revolutions, I don't really have a series for yet because I haven't figured out what I'm doing with it. But that is a project. At some point, there will be a series of some kind. So that's four. Mod videos, if you count that, so five. I have in-between videos, I'm not counting that. These are just series. And then the two new series that I haven't talked about yet. So seven. That's, that's still a lot. Can't play it at your laptop. Well, then you could save it, buy it on sale, and then play it when you have the ability to. I think that's what I did with um, with Jedi Fallen New Order. Jedi New Fallen Order? Jedi something? Fall Jedi Fallen Order. I don't think new is anywhere in the title. Uh, but yeah. So I would just save it up. This seems like a reasonable amount, right? If I were to drop in on a rope, let's just get like a temporary. Just like a, just like a little, little practice rope. It has to be hanging from a block. Not quite all of them, still so many. A lot of seeds. <laughs> yeah, it was, that's why I'm, I'm less likely to say yes right now, just because I have so many going on. Oh, whoops. Um... like that didn't happen there we go this is kind of our our point of reference fall down the rope how big does this platform need to be well, that's another thing we need to figure out let me, let me no i'm just gonna do it copy this i need to stop breaking this block up here i keep using it There we go. That's point two. Ooh. Through the roof. Correction. Floor. Through the floor, yes. Copy that. Teleport over here. Paste it over here. Undo it over here. Paste it again over here. And boom. We're good. Dragonfish. Oh, yeah, this is a good one. It reminds me of Stray. Okay. So now we need to figure out how big is this island here. That's what I wanted to start with. That was what I was talking about. Roger, roger. And then also, does this come down? Is it a flat, uh, a flat walk over to the statue or whatever 
this is going to be, because it very well could be no statue. I feel like it needs to be something. Maybe there's a statue, but then that's just decorative. I don't know. Hmm. Who is your most subscribed subscriber? I don't know. I have no clue. I don't think I can, I can properly look for that. I can't even, I don't think I can even tell who's, subs no, I, can, I can tell who's subscribed. Tedious, but I think I can. I don't know. They're talking about multiple accounts. Like, there's no way for me to know. Just because they're not linked together, and it doesn't tell me that even if they are. Yeah, I think... So I want it to be... If I go down the rope... Do I want this to be... I want it to become something like this. Let me, let me see. Let me try to visualize... Oh. Let me try to visualize what I had in mind. Glad I... There we go. I want to have something like this. This is not going to be a perfectly square shape. Should be able to in YouTube Studio. But I can't see if accounts are linked together. And even if they aren't, or even if I can, I can't see accounts that aren't linked together. So even if I, I could, there would be no way I could properly account for every person. Either way, I have no clue. And I don't want to just expose someone like that. I want to come down here. And then maybe have like... Temp this temporary. Uh, um, uh, um, uh, 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 there we go. And then we get like... Some more blocks. Oh, that's what you mean. I see. I'm going to guess polar, not polar. Um, I'm going to guess Portal Master Studios. I can remember names. I know names well. One of my one of my good friends, he's got 300k. That's my guess. I don't know. He's Lego videos. The ba -ba -ba -ba. I don't think I can tell. I thought that was a thing I could. Here we go. Subscribers. The largest person... Oh, I cannot believe this. He's not even subscribed to me. Gasp. 14.8k. I don't think this is accurate, actually. Because I know my one of my other friends has subscribed, and he's got more subscribers than this person. Yeah, this is not accurate. Huh. I did not know that. Yeah, he's uh, he's been doing it for a while. And he, he knows the algorithm quite well. Yeah, I filtered it to, to all subscribers, and that's I don't think that's... I don't think it's accurate because I know he's subscribed to me unless he's got beef he hasn't told me about which I don't think is the case <laughs> yeah this needs to be larger I feel like it has to be maybe we don't go into the darker tones or at least not here Let's turn this, let's turn this all to, turn this all to, uh, tough blocks. Let's do tough. 50% tough. 50% Cobblestone. I can't do that. I need to do this. There we go. Now it's a mix. Chrissy's. Possibly. Won't tell you if someone's subscribed if they don't have. Ah, okay. 
Yeah, that could be the case then. I'm gonna use Deep Slate. This could be Big Brain. Now if I go to the side... Yeah, okay. So this needs to be larger still. And then... If I redo the selection, that, aha, see how big brain I am? I'm so big brain. I don't want this to, be, I think this needs to be out further. I'm just trying to get the scale of everything. seem too far away to the rope. Not far enough. Thank you, Cooper. <laughs> Thank you for the quesadilla and chalky milk. I appreciate it, dude. Thanks. I appreciate you bringing it up. Tell my dad thanks. My dad. Our dad. Mmm. Chalky milk. I love chocolate milk. <laughs> That's nice. All I had to eat was a banana. So now I have actual food. Um, would I be interested in joining Hermitcraft if given the invite? I'm not sure. I would love to interact with the creators. But I've heard it's very corporate, and I'm not sure I'm at the, the stage where I am right now to, to really take on that. I don't think I would be invited to that. And at least not now. It takes a long time. Like, Gemini Tay, Skizzleman, uh, who are some of the other? Pearl. They've been doing YouTube for... Oh, this smells so good. They've been doing YouTube for a long time. And uh, it took it took a long time for them to be accepted. I'm not sure if they just didn't ask or if they went out and asked, hey, do you want to be in here? But I don't know if I would be able to say yes. I mean, I, I probably would say yes, but I don't know if I'm ready. At a family reveal. Uh, I mean, my I think my my family's already on the internet but I'm you'll, you'll have to go find it I'm not gonna just here's a picture of my family he wasn't hiding his face he just wasn't crouched down low enough where you could see him I've had videos of my brother and I on this channel but I have them hidden at the moment until I get a, a larger number of videos out I don't want YouTube to confuse my content because I have like skits and stuff that I, I have previously posted Does that feel... Feel large enough. Let's go up like 40. There we go. Almost seven thousand. Did it go down again? It's crazy. Yeah, it went down again. Man, people really don't like the stream. I'm not. I'm not mad. I'm not disappointed. Man, we've been at six or seven thousand today, like three times. Okay. Yeah. That's fine. I just wanted to make sure, like, how does it feel? I feel like it still needs to be higher. So maybe I will end up using that system we made earlier. Because this doesn't seem big enough. That's kind of the what I'm going for. Yeah, this needs to be even bigger. 
Oh, this quesadilla smells so good. Oops. There we go. Ah. So I want the feeling of dropping down in here to feel significant as well. Does that feel large enough? I feel like I should be falling further. If you're giving one million dollars, can only buy one thing, what would it be? Like one million of one thing or one thing? Like could I buy a million dollar chicken nugget or could I buy a million chicken nuggets that were all one dollar? Which would be an expensive chicken nugget, but still. I'm gonna I'm gonna mute my microphone while I eat this. <laughs> but I'll I'll still be reading. If I could buy, make one purchase. So if I were to choose a Lego, it would be one brick then, not a whole set. Hmm. Or it just has to be like a thing. Like I can't buy an individual Lego or a set. I think I would buy One million dollars. Hmm. It's weird to think that that wouldn't buy much. Like, I can buy a lot of things that are less than a million dollars. And then there's a lot of things that are worth way more than a million dollars. Like middle income houses are million dollars how or now. So that's just ridiculous. Hi, Buffer Fish. Welcome in. Yeah, um, that's that's one thing. Um, I my one of my ideas was to have multiple exits, and then those, the longer you're in there, the more dangerous it becomes, and those exits become less common. But then I also had the idea that you can bribe um, other people, which will just be either custom music discs or. Uh, what are they called? The speaker blocks where I can do text-to-speech or chat messages. I can make it sound like a person uh, is talking. And then you bribe them with the barrel putting a shirt in it. And then they let down a rope for you. Those would, those would be shorter. But maybe the... Maybe there's another way to get out. I'm not sure. I have to figure something out. That is so good. <clears throat> Love chalky milk. Let's see, just, just here, how long does this take? As long as the players don't punch the rope, it, it shouldn't break either. Because one hit and this thing comes down, then it'll break the game. It has been roughly two hours since the stream has started. Actually, it has been. I didn't start the timer immediately, so it has been two hours. Welcome in. You've been here, right? I just miss your name. You were here, okay. You just changed it. I see. You're no longer Windows Terminal. Let me, I need like a point of reference. It's really hard to, to give scale. This is kind of what I had in mind is having for the spots that have the like per sending up the barrel for buying stuff. 
I wanted to have these little tents here. Like this is where the archaeologers have set up. This is very not great. Yeah, something like this. I guess. I don't know. I just want to get like a basic. I, w I want to know how big everything feels. There's a really crappy tent. We're dropping down. Yeah, this needs to be higher yet. So I definitely need to find some other way to, to get back up. Hi, Therese. Welcome in. Wow, rebranding really fast. How'd you get to 100 subscribers? I've had 100 subscribers for like 11 years. <laughs> I, I started this channel like 12 years ago or 13 years ago. And until... Let's see, until... Was it July or something I posted the first Coldcraft episode? When I posted the first Coldcraft episode, I had 100 subscribers. Mostly those were just friends and family. Maybe not. There's probably some random people too. I was at 98 for so long. And that video just blew up way more than I expected it to. So it, it took me 13 years or whatever, but also I wasn't consistently uploading. My videos weren't great. We're working on the the vibe right now, Therese. I just finished my chalky milk that my brother brought for me, and then I also have a quesadilla to eat. But we're trying to figure out how tall this needs to be. There we go. Does that feel... That feels better. I think I think that, that this is going to be a big room. So we're, we're taking that small scale room that we made before and trying to make that as a, a full-scale thing. From Brazil, love all your... I'm glad. I appreciate that. Okay. Can I do it? Yeah! Okay. So now, if I stand up here, and I drop down like the archaeologists would, Mr. Jones. Got to go now. See you in the next stream. Thank you for stopping by. I appreciate that. I know it's I know it's late for you, so I, I appreciate you coming by. I feel like that worked a lot better. Rise to the rate of growth. Yeah, some people grow really fast. One of my one of my good friends, Incy, uh, he made one video and it just absolutely exploded. And he got like, I'm going to guess 10k from one video because it was really well done and it was different. And that's what people appreciated about it. And he has grown so fast, which it's insane. I think he's just hit 40 or 50k now, which is awesome. Thank you, Polyframe. Or you're talking to, you're talking to Ivan. Thank you from, from Ivan. <laughs> I feel like that's a better height. This room is going to be absolutely giant. <laughs> oh no. This is what I do. Every project I make is just ridiculous. Yikes. But I am going to absolutely need that, um, that system we made earlier. Because otherwise, there's no way I'm going to get just 64. This thing. In fact, let's measure it. Oh, not that. Teleport. There we go. Let's measure this. So we'll take this, and then we'll fly the way up. This is a 58 drop block. So actually, I would make it. Maybe I don't need that device after all. That simplifies things. Ridiculous is fun. Actually, that's not the right number. 61. So I could actually go 
62, 63, 64. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, did it again. And then I think, let's actually go back to this. Forget where I made it. Here. Here. Ooh, okay, so I am going to have to use that device. Okay. I'm going to have to use some variation of these two machines together. Okay, that's slightly worrisome. Can I even do it? Because I need one output for the comparator. I need two outputs for the turntable. Hmm, I'm not sure how I would do this. Because there's no way to toggle a block with a redstone input, right? Is there something that like the, you know, like the, from the create mod, they have the deployer where it can interact with blocks. Is there a way to do that with any of these mods? Hmm. Because if I can, if I can half the number of, of turntables we're using, then I have an empty side I can, I can hook up to that comparator. I need to detect how many how many pieces of rope are on it. That's still looking cool. It's it's not efficient, but I appreciate it. <laughs> so this system basically what it does is you push the button and then this pipe goes down and this pipe goes up. Uh, this has two stacks of rope. Normally a, a pulley can only carry one stack at a time, but if I want to fall more than more than that. Um, then I have to, I have to figure out some way to get, um, get rope in and out with other means. So I, I, I pull down this, this pipe here. It starts continuously loading them. This will start turning it. So it will start using them. So that way it creates room for more rope. And then once it lowers all the 128, it will wait for however long and then go back up. And then swap these, so now this will move all of the rope back into the chest. It no longer can be put into the pulley, and all is said and good. Did I have a main before the username? Main username before Lance? I had several. I was... First, I was Rocket Lance. That was my first Minecraft username. That was my first YouTube username. I was a really big fan of Dan TDM, so I was Rocket Lance the Emerald Minecart. That was a, was a little nerd. And uh, then I swapped over to Martu Fodi. I think that was the next one. I think actually, yeah, I think it was Martu Fodi, which my friend at the time had the username Nartu Fodi, I think. Um, and I, I wanted to match with them. So I switched to that. And then after was Simply Puff, which was, I think its own channel. It might still be up, I'm not sure. Um, then I switched to at Lance a lot, which was this channel. And then I switched to Lance. <laughs> Rocket Lance. There was no Y until this username, so it was just L-A-N-C-E. It was Rocket Lance. Um, I The reason that the origin story of that name, uh, I had been playing on my dad's account in alpha days in Minecraft and that was so long ago and I was playing on his account for a long time and he got tired of me asking I guess to use his account so for Christmas one year he he got me my own Minecraft account and I told him King Kitten that wasn't my first username though that was just what I what I called myself because I thought I could I thought I could just every cat would would love me and I would be the the cat whisperer Um, but that was never my username. But, um... Uh, yeah, I told my I told my dad I wanted to be... My username to be Rocket, for some reason. And I wanted my password to be Lance. 
and obviously Rocket was taken, so he just made it Rocket Lance and then created some other password. So I didn't get to be Rocket, but I was Rocket Lance, and then I switched it. Axelrod, do I have to? Oh yeah, I've seen that name. Usernames are are usually uh, fun to listen to because there's so many different stories that can be linked to them. It's neat. I just realized I've taken one bite or two bites out of this. Hold on. Did I miss it? Hold on. Are you able to climb the rope? Rope pulley of create in your version. Yeah, I think so. It, that was in 1.20. That's the same version that Crazen and I played for the, the last stream. And that we were able to climb it in that version. So theoretically, should should be fine. But we don't have create mod in this. That's the, that's the problem. <laughs> I know it's going to pick up me chewing on the microphones, that's why I keep muting. I should, I should actually set up a keybind for this so I don't have to keep doing it. What can I use? This would be old mic. Audio. No audio. Discord. Old mic, here we go. Oh, I have it as F12. What does that key do? We'll try numpad 6. Let's see. It works. Cool. Now you just click the button and take a bite. Have a compilation of me eating food throughout different streams. I think this is the first time I've eaten on stream. So this is this is all you get for the compilation right now. <laughs> That's a weird thing to make a montage of too. That could work. Food is pretty awesome, isn't it? Tasty. Love food. I had to unmute to say that. I'm going back to eating. I was doing a little little jig <laughs> or jig, jiggy I think it's just jig 
Uh, what mouse do I have? I have the Razor Lance Head. <laughs> I wonder, wonder what attracted me to buy that mouse specifically. I also have the... I forget what the other one's called. There's another mouse I have for my, my, my laptop. Um, but that's also Razor. I just don't know what it's called. Um, but yeah, I, I'm using the Razor Lance Head. Very nice mouse. It's got side buttons, it can click on things, it can move, it's great. Got a, adaptable weights, I think, in this one? Maybe not, maybe it's the other one. But yeah, I got the Razor Lance Head. To accompany my Barracuda headphones. Which are also Razor. I'm gonna eat this one more piece and then and I'll go back to building. taking a food break. I'm not sure. I know there's at least at least two, I think. I missed my stand up two hours in a row. I'm so on top of it. Yeah, I, I needed a food break. I hadn't eaten and I'm going to be here for 12 hours. So or 10. Nine hours and 52 minutes and 24. Five seconds. All right, back to Minecraft. Um. So yeah, we're gonna probably have to figure out some way to combine <clears throat> those two rooms. Okay, let's focus on this for right now. Actually, I wanted to build in Cobble Deep Sleep. That was the 12 hours decided. That number is arbitrary. I just thought it would be a quite long stream. I haven't done one that length before. Um, but it's supposed to be a celebration for 7,000 subscribers, which we might be at now. I don't know. We've been at 7,000 and then 7,999 or 6,999 multiple times now. Oh, we're at, we're at 704, so we can actually celebrate it now. Um, so 12 was an arbitrary number. I just, I just picked a random time that sounded appropriate. But it, it is a celebration for 7,000. And also 100 Discord members as well. That was, that was the first reason. This needs to be longer, I think. Pretty excited. Woohoo! I kind of want this to be lopsided as well. I feel like it, it shouldn't be a perfect, perfect circle. In fact, if the water is flowing in this direction, then theoretically it should be kind of a, a curve now. Something maybe closer to this. Hmm. That's probably better. Yeah. 
And then we'll make another makeshift tent as well, because I don't want it to be perfectly symmetrical or perfectly even. Something my teeth. Yummy. What are we thinking about this shape? I need to actually convert this first into the proper material. So, I don't feel like this is far enough away. I like the shape, though. That needs to be rounded slightly. If I were to jump down, this seems too close. I should push this back like two blocks. Oops. That might be better. This tent is, is not good. But it's temporary. It's not going to be great. Already improved it. I barely even did anything. Yay. Ah, yes, the professional, the, the B00 in me is really showing. <laughs> An adventure map, I didn't start watching the stream from the beginning. So this is, um, it's going to be a survival project. I'm just designing it in creative mode first. Um, this is for a SMP that, at this point, I'm not sure is happening or not. It originally was going to be a server. We already had a cast of people, uh, but then everybody got busy right as, because it started. Um, it started right as a lot of people started school. So we didn't really get a proper chance to play with it in survival. And I was going to build this in here. This has been in development since like the f second episode of Coldcraft or something. So many months ago. Um, but now I'm like properly getting into it. This has been here for a long time. That was like a sample just to get a, a pallet working for a, a section of the dungeon. But yeah, this is going to be in a survival world. Uh, similar to Decked Out, but on a server similar to Hermitcraft, but in a modded environment in its co-op. So there are major differences in gameplay, um, but I did want to build it in survival. At some point, though, it will become publicly available once it's complete. Cannot get... piece of cheese or whatever it is. My brother bought, brought me a wet rag, which is awesome. My hands aren't greasy from the quesadilla. Okay. Yeah, this is cru truly a, a marvel to, to behold. The builder and the architect are one. Yeah, so this, this project is going to be super cool. I have so many ideas. The description that you'll sing a song with your guitar. Did I say sing? Uh-oh. No, -uh, I didn't say sing. I mean, I could. But, yeah, I wanted to play a little song on the guitar. <laughs> I'm not great at guitar, so I, I didn't want to, like, have people expecting that I'd just be really good. I play piano, but that would not sound good. My my guitar is much more mobile and quieter than the, the piano is. But yeah, when, when we get to, to 10 members, which we started at 3 for some reason. I'm not sure why it chose that number 
So I just added 10 to that. So once we reach 13, then we will get to 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 play some guitar. And I think I'm actually going to have that as like an unlock. So instead of it just being a one time thing throughout the rest of the stream, I'll be playing on the guitar and I'll, I'll take I'll take requests and ask every once in a while. Um, a campfire. And then maybe I don't know some logs. Oh wait, let's do hollowed logs. Oh, I forgot this gives regen. Hmm. Well, that's good for some things. Three. Thank you for the subscription. Once again, my activity feed is not loading. But I appreciate that. Thank you. I will I'll periodically check on the website because I think that's more more accurate. Yeah. Thank you for the sub. Welcome in. How's that? Yeah, that that looks so good. So bad. Uh so bad. <laughs> it's temporary, okay? I'm I'm just I just want to get a shape fleshed out. This is also too wide now, I think. Manifest the karaoke stream. I don't think a karaoke stream would really work. There's a lot of copyrighted music. I would like to do karaoke, but yeah, no, I I just don't see that happening. It would be fun though. I like the idea of having this cut off. Maybe like two out. Do this way? Yeah, I like that a lot more. Okay. Maybe this goes out a little bit more too. Dia, one of the things you can buy is ignite campfires. That's not a bad idea. I could just like send down a uh send down a like a, a fire charge. Let's see how fast the fireplace works. So I'm in, I'm in hard mode. What is today? Why? What for? <laughs> now I'm scared. Didn't I say that earlier too? What is today, but yesterday's tomorrow. Okay, much better. Am I not supposed to be getting regen from this? There it goes. It just takes a bit. That's not too bad. I actually, I don't hate that idea. I think I will add that to my, my Trello board. Artifact. Um, buy fire charges to light campfire or regen. Not a bad idea at all. Oh, I see. I don't I don't know why unless Therese wants to animate that. I'm not going to make them do that. We I was I was getting all philosophical earlier saying that every day is a new day, which I think is a a quote from is it Undertale. A quote from something. Tomorrow is a new day. I can't remember what the context was. Um, I was just saying gibberish. Therese absolutely does not have to animate that. Nope, this gotta be slabs. The, the logs are too, too thick. Let's do... Thatch. That kind of makes sense. Yeah, that works. And then maybe we get like, uh, what else would they have? Maybe some barrels. Oh, 
If Therese wants to do it, Therese will do it. Therese absolutely does not have to do that, though. If you want it to be animated, you can do it. Hi, Marshmallow. There we go. Some totally functional chests and barrels. This is where I'm going to have the, the pickup slot. Pickup space thing. Maybe? Oops. There we go. Do that right here. That feels wrong. Well, then you gotta learn. Everybody, everybody's gotta learn things. You don't have to animate that, Therese. <laughs> we are building the dungeon right now. We're just trying to get the the shape out for the for the island that you drop into. So this is like the scale model. So this island right here is what we're trying to get the, the shape of. Trying to figure out how big it should be, how big it should feel, how far we should have to drop. I don't need anything animated. This I feel like is too, too big. This is the, the life of a creative person. I'm undoing everything. Something feels slightly off, and then I go back on it, because I'm like, wait, maybe that was right. Does that feel better? I don't want this to feel too big. What if I just get some slabs? Dipper wanted, um wanted it animated me saying that was it yesterday's today is yesterday's tomorrow or something I don't think you can back read in YouTube live chats it only shows you the things you were here for I think going down is the play or do you think going up Oh my gosh, Drew, you madman. Thank you so much. Rad coming in with the with the five gifted. Thank you, dude. I appreciate that. <laughs> oh, does it play for every one of them? Oh no, I have to I have to fix that. It's only supposed to play once. We get to hear it three more times. Oh, it's different. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> Thank you, Drew. Love you. Mwah. I'll be on the Discord later. Oh, wait, no, I won't. I'll be here for 12 hours. <laughs> I'll be here tomorrow. A gifted sub means he bought... That's, why did it play the different one? Thank you. Is that too loud? You guys, oh, you guys can't even hear it. Oh, you can, okay. He, he, he bought subs, uh, and it gives it to random people. Let me know if that's too loud. It's, it's a little loud for me. I'm gonna turn it down slightly. Yeah, that's better. All right. Still going. I don't know. I don't know how many times it's gonna do that. <laughs> okay, it's done. It's good. We're good. It picks people at random. Okay, so this does this go down or does it go up? I 
do like that length. I do like it going up as well. Hmm. Should let's do this on the other side. Oh, geez. No, we beat it. Yeah, we already got it. Okay, guys. I'm gonna... I'll pause the music here so you can hear it. Let me get my, my guitar. All right, we're gonna play some songs. Play a little guitar. So, so what song should we should we play in the little guitar? <laughs> I'm I'm so good. <clears throat> I need some suggestions, or maybe I should get a guitar pick. That might be that might be helpful. There we go. What songs are we playing? Radioactive. Okay. It's already ten, yeah. You can do radioactive. What else we got? I I'm not even gonna be able to hear it. This is not a loud instrument. <laughs> uh, let's see. I forget how this goes. Okay. I'm not gonna be able to play the whole song because I don't play guitar, and this is a little small for fingers anyway. Let's see. Oh, Drew, do you want to pick the song? Since you did it. Thank you, Beep. I appreciate that. Do the fl nope, we're not doing that one. That one's uh that one's a little out of my skill level. Let's see, does it even pick up? It does. <laughs> Freebird. I, I, I try, I guess. I'll try I'll try just like a section of Freebird. Let's see. Um, <laughs> yeah, this is not helping. the rest of the song um. oh no I've had enough rush E in this house my brother plays on the xylophone all the time um is leaf even know I don't know if she's here then she probably does not know you might just have it tabbed. I'm not sure how it works. Um, I'm gonna try radioactive, I guess. This is really terrible. I'm to play it like this. Yeah. I'm good, Dipper. Thank you. All right, bye, Drew. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, what else? I'll do. I'll, I'll do. I'll do two more. If you guys want to suggest more songs, it's really hard to play because my fingers are much too large for the strings here. Uh, it's like a classic guitar. I wonder if I can play. I don't even know what the song is. I don't think I can play it. Let me see. Get out of here. I don't think I can. Yeah, I can't. 
It's it's too small, and it's obviously not tuned properly. Which you can tune it surprisingly. It's just not accurate. Um. Oh, I don't know that one. I don't know that one either. <laughs> Let me see. I'll mute Discord or I'll mute Spotify. Ba ba black sheep. I can do that. That one's that one's. I know that song. Ba ba black sheep. I could do uh, somebody that I used to know. I don't. I forget. I can't play. I can't play songs on this. It's so small. I didn't think this through. I can play. Um... I am Iron Man. Neener, neener, nee, 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 nee. Where is he lost his mind? Nee, 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 Barrel. It bang it bang it bang it. I can't go any lower than that. I can't play. Barrel. Ding, arrow. Uh, is it smoke on the water? Rest in peace. Yeah, that is a. I told you I'd play a. a I play a little song on my guitar. <laughs> I'm not gonna join Dipper. I'm gonna make part. Oh, <laughs> uh, we—I mean, we have—we already have like Paladin Lance. Did I, did I miss something? Hold on, let me refresh this. No, it didn't. Okay. <laughs> Just have a whole like Dungeons and Dragons. Uh, timeline where it's just me playing all the different classes. Be like Rogue Lance. That'd be some. I do. I do have a. I do have a, a D and D campaign in Minecraft that I've been working on. That's a lie. I haven't been working on it, but I have it in my head. I, there's something I want to do with it. I just haven't made it yet. I, that I should have specified that from the beginning. I, I'll I'll put the guitar down for now. But that, I, I told you I'd play a little song of the guitar, and it was definitely a little song. Or I guess I should have said, I'll play a song on my little guitar, but you guys would have, you guys would have figured it out. Plucking is hard on that thing, because it's, it's so, it's like this, the distance between the strings is just so small, I can only play the one, the one string. Oh man. But yeah, that was uh, that was some. I gotta get my activity feedback. Oh yeah, we gotta do the next sub goal. Now that we've we've met this one, so for twenty five subs, so fifteen from now. So that's what twenty. Can I gotta delete this? This is. Oh, it's so laggy. Oh dear. I fear this will crash stuff. Delete. There we go. We're good. I'm going to delete that too. Cool. All right. Now it's not going to crash. Awesome. Uh, let's do... Copy this. 
There we go. And then so that's 15 more. So 13 plus 15, that'd be, that'd be 28. Yeah. Save. There we go. Look at that. Yippee. I'm glad they're happy. Uh, the, the neck pains are already starting. But yes, I did want to do a, a Dungeons and Dragons campaign in Minecraft. That's something I thought would be cool. And uh, I have an idea for it. It was going to be in Coldcraft before it ended. But then um, I obviously did not get to, to finish that. Or even start it for that matter. We'll get to it eventually though. I do want to end up doing it. So now we got to figure out. For this, uh, for the spot where you deposit your your artifacts, do you do you deposit them going down or do you deposit them going up? Are we looking up at something and then you throw your artifacts off the cliff, or do you look down and as you get over here you'll start to see it? I'm thinking up, but then also if we have a big empty cliff face behind it that'll be obscured. So we have to figure out what's more important, the empty cliff side behind it. You know what? I think we do up. That was uh that was Rad or Drew. He's no longer in the in the in the stream, but he was he was here earlier. That's one of my good friends. I'm thinking we go up. Because if I go from the side, then I'll still see it. It's going to be a large enough hole. I'm going to see it anyway. So I'm thinking we're going up. Welcome in. Welcome in. But yeah, that was that was rad. That's his literal name. It's it's not just me saying it's cool. It is cool. But yeah, that was it was ITX rad. OK, we're going up with this. Thinking, do we make this natural or not? I think what we're going to do is is basically this. I want to get stairs as well. There we go. Mix in the different elevations so it kind of has a slant. Almost like a rope bridge gonna get a rough shape does that seem right yeah he's really cool thinking that works maybe something like this maybe Maybe? Possibly? Seems like a nice slope. Oh yeah, let me get the music back. Bam. I'm thinking that works. Maybe it's too... That's probably better. And then this is where it would start transitioning back to... Stone. So I guess the center would kind of be here. That. Oh no, this is the center. So this goes out three, this goes out two, three. Yeah, Minecraft D&D &D is, is, that would be cool. Um, I haven't decided yet how I'm going to go about it. And that's definitely not something I'm ready to start working on at the moment. But that was what was going to be, um, actually maybe I shouldn't spoil that. Never mind, you're not gonna you're not gonna know. Ha ha ha. when it comes closer to that project existing, I'll uh, I'll explain more what I had in mind. D D is quite fun. It's never something I could get into a long term just because my attention span is so short. But uh when I do play I do like it. And I really like the worlds that people build with it. I'm just, my attention span is, is not there for that much sitting. 
I don't know. Do this. Yeah, okay. Looks like a big boat mixed with some small campsite. Kinda. It does look like that. It'll make more sense once I get the shape finished, but... Yeah. I can see that. Never played D&D, but I want to play it with my friends. That is, that is kind of a hard... Th I mean, you can play it with one person, I guess, but even then, it's... You kind of need more. I I don't have the the friends or the patience for that game, although I have played it with my my family. I just uh, don't think I could do that for that long. Oh, this is okay. So I... do that. Yeah. Some variation in the slope there. I don't know why I'm putting so much detail. I really just need a shape. There we go. Might as well bring this out as well since we're going so detailed for some reason. Alright, cool. That'll be like the temporary shape. an online one uh, I don't know I mean that'd be cool but again I don't think I have the time nor the, the the patience to be able to get through that but that would be super cool yeah you are welcome thank you so much <laughs> you can thank uh, you can thank Drew for that he was here earlier I don't think he's here anymore though he's just lurking he came in here and dropped five gifted which is pretty crazy this is artifact yes we, uh, this is the project that got voted on. Um, at the beginning of the stream, I, I, I hosted a poll and said, which which project are we starting with? And, and people, 50% of the people said, we're doing artifacts, so here we are. Although we'll probably switch off of, switch off of it soon. Just because we've already been doing it for almost three hours. Look at that, there we go. So maybe we do Blueprint next or something. I also did want to throw into the mix MCC Island, but MCC Island makes me lose hair. So I'm not sure yet if I want to actually put myself through that. But also, I would like to, to play on MCC Island, because I know they got a new game I haven't played yet. I think it's Crossbolt, but I'm not sure. No, it's not. Or Dodgebolt. Maybe it's not. I don't know. It has been nearly three hours, yeah. <laughs> Area Math is, is one of my favorite T418 songs ever. I love this one. Reminder to like and subscribe. Thank you. <laughs> oh yes, I should probably mention, for those of you who don't know, in the description is... Uh, if you if you become a member it adds time to the timer which by the way need to need to add that because the timer did not go up like it was supposed to so I got to do that manually so let's see um, I wish I could just add it in the middle nine f I'll pause it I'll take a picture so that way I don't lose the number but inevitably I'm gonna forget this okay so the magma is supposed to add 6 minutes each so that was 5 we're adding half an hour oh dear <laughs> all right so i need to go to here and then add 30 b9 45 52 oh i can see the number it's nice 40 oh nope that's 90 hours 9 4552. There we go. Ah. Thank you for the extra half an hour, Drew. I'm so mad at you. Grr. 
There we go. I'm going to use the bathroom real quick, though, so I actually I'm going to pause the timer. We'll be right back. Talk amongst yourselves. Decide what, what game you want to see next, or uh, what project. I'll be right back. Crowley and as a uh, as a I forget how you say it. As um, I want to I want to know. Good omens, cast. As if as if as if real. <laughs> Pronunciation. Zero fail. Apparently. Supposedly, that's that's how you say it. Uh, that's a good one. Unless it is officially endorsed at some point in the show, I don't know why it needs to be romanticized. They make a fantastic friendship. I haven't seen it the second season, so I'm not sure. But in, and it's been so long since I've seen the first one, I'm not sure either. Like people, I've seen people ship them together, and it's like, just, just make them good friends. Not everybody has to be in love. I get it, but at the same time, they didn't. If they wanted that, they would have written that into the story. Yeah, I need to. I need to watch season two. Welcome back. You got back just as I have. Okay. I don't like the fact that this goes goes up. There we go. That's better. Mm, too even. This is literally not something I need to be doing right now. Maybe I make it slightly difficult so you actually have to jump. That'd be mean. Certainly do it. Okay, that works. Currently building interiors with Crazen. Fun. Wow, okay. Th thank you. <laughs> Is this the pineapple apple guava thing? Pat pag? It's not pog, I know that. Thank you. Wow, I have it's been three hours and I'm already accumulating garbage. 
I'm going to move this water bottle so that I can put the cold one on the stand. And now I got juice. Let's hear it for Cooper. Yeah. Mmm. Oh, that's just yummy. It does have guava in it. Mmm. Ice. I don't know where to put this. I only got one... Whatever you put drinks on. Um, oh, there might be another one over here. <coughs> nope. <coughs> Just the one. Um. <coughs> okay. Interesting. Interesting hobby. 16? That's crazy. Welcome in, guys. Oh yeah, this is what I wanted to do. I'm gonna try this. I'm not sure how well this is gonna work. Let's bring this down. And then I need stairs. Stairs. That. Maybe one of those. Yeah. Put that there. Maybe one of these. Pretty great. Yeah, there we go. Maybe we can take the connected chain. Mm, maybe not. Mm, that's too low. Maybe you can make these too tall. One that updates. Go. We do this one to here. And then this one to here. And then this one to here. Look at that. Mm, actually, you know what? maybe not. I used to make Lego guns too. I made a Lego Karambit once, but it, it shattered. Who's leaving? Teresa, are you leaving? Bye bye. Have a good day. Thank you for stopping by. Welcome back. Thank you, nurse. Oh, jeez. Ah, mean. Actually, you know what? I can make this more slopey. Let me make this a solid block. There we go. Yeah. But yeah, thank you, Nurse. Welcome back, 8 bit Or 16 bit. I know how to say lit numbers. What mod adds the connected chains? You're never gonna believe this. It's connectable chains. It's one of my favorite mods. Because it's so simple and so elegant. Oh, that's too long. I say that and it breaks. I love this mod. It's so simple. And the best part is, oh, we don't have it in this mod pack. There's another mod called Diagonal Fences that works perfectly with it. Yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, it's better. We do one here too. Yeah, so detailed. It's connectable transient. Yeah. <laughs> I have this, I have both of those mods in Coldcraft, I just haven't used them yet. This stuff is so good. I apologize for the ASMR. Yeah, it's not picking up every crunch, that's good. I like ice. What side? I feel like there needs to be more wood over here. There we go. Is 
That's not bad. This is the main, um, this is the main, like, room. So you'll drop down from a rope. Oh. Ah. This is the wrong rope, isn't it? Yeah, it's the wrong rope. And then this is a miniature. So that campsite that was up there, that's where this will go. That bridge thing we're building right now is this here. And then there's going to be a bridge over there and a bridge over here. And those will go into the different sections of the dungeon. So if you can imagine, this island is this island here. Which means this room is going to be absolutely massive. <laughs> but it's going to look so cool. And we were trying to work out how exactly big it needs to be. And we're thinking maybe this height. Because this this feels like a good... That feels like a good, um, a good level to me to fall from. And imagine just looking up and seeing this giant cave. I think that's going to be so cool. So now, now I guess we have to figure out how how deep down is it going to go. I want to kind of curve this around a little bit. You'll be able to go down here, but there's no reason to. And you might get stuck anyway. So. Going down to. We have vertical slabs in this. I can't remember. We don't. I think we ultimately decided that was too far from vanilla Minecraft. Or something, because I can't remember. The loot will be randomly generated. So the reason, the way it will be different um, is you'll drop down. This is the main room. This is an even smaller scale. And some of the rooms will require two players to get into. So like this hallway... You need both players. They'll be working together. And the the main things that will change how the runs are different are um, you're getting better at navigating the dungeon. The loot will be different, so you might have to take different routes. Maybe some access points are blocked, so you can't even go that way. This is small scale, but this is also really not detailed. So there might be two pathways to get here, for example. And maybe one of them is accessible, the other is not. So the person you play with will be can be different. So that, that will change the experience quite a bit. Um, it could also be there are certain pathways that are just straight up blocked, so you can't use that route. Um, it'll also be choice. Because you only need one artifact to escape, which means you only need to access one of these purple vaults. So choosing which one, maybe you want to collect them all, maybe you want to figure out which one's the easiest for you to get through. There's that too, or maybe you want to get them all. That would be difficult, but it's pro I'll, I'll try to make it possible because I think that'd be neat. Um, What else? There will be some randomized elements as well. Like you'll have where mobs spawn, um, maybe parkours will be randomized. There will be puzzles that are randomized. There, I'll, I'll find some elements to make it random. Because you're right, at the moment it does seem... It does seem very, um... Very stagnant in its progression. That is good juice. Hmm. Trying to figure out what to do to add more detail. Because we got to make a segment that's like sending up items. A hidden cookie. <laughs> Why a hidden cookie? Does this seem too far? No. Because there's going to be a pathway be here. Maybe one of these will be made of stone. I don't know. Something like this. That needs to be wired. There will be Easter eggs. Yes, I already have some planned. But you don't get to know yet. That's what's called a secret.
Fair point. Why not a why not a hidden cookie? Trying to figure out where do I want the the bridges to stem from? It was like down here. They're very um they're very straight, obviously. I guess there is some off, but like because it's such a small scale, I'm working with full size blocks. So how much of it should be a path? Should it be more like should just go down there? Should it be more like this? Where it's one? Or should it be the bigger ones? I'm thinking something like this. Yeah, I'm thinking of that. I think that's what we're doing. I don't want the whole thing to be... Like that feels maybe slightly too wide, but I also don't want it to be too close. Maybe there needs to be more interest. Oh, I know what I'll do. Hmm, what would be the easiest thing to change? Uh, let's take, take this. I work on my draft as I do play. Could I work on my draft as I watch or do it later, like after dinner, when I can even pull my attention? Hmm. Which one do you feel like you'd be more productive doing? All right, don't don't put it off to the last minute. So now I've, I've moved it back a little bit. That should help with the problem. Does this and this feels closer too? That was one other thing that I was I was worried about. It's not not feeling. Yeah, that's way better. Okay, I'm liking that much more. Probably the second. Okay, that's do that then. There you go, there's your dance break. <laughs> what version of supplementaries? This is... C... Looking for it, there's so many mods that need to be updated. Two point 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 five point two one two five two one. There you go. Currently writing up some homebrew DD. Okay, nice. If I'm if I'm distracting you, then by all means, feel free to leave. I know it can be difficult for me to work on projects when I'm hearing other people's voices. I would not be mad or disappointed at all. Okay. So I think this is good. I feel like I need to move this over a little bit. Just like back. Maybe, maybe one block actually, not that much. Cut, paste, yeah, that's much better, okay, cool, 
Now I gotta figure out how deep is this part. Maybe something like this. Does that feel deep enough? Okay. Yeah, that's fair. That is a pretty important factor for a game like that. Og. Egg. I don't know what's in this. I think that's pineapple orange guava. No, that's Pog. What is this? Hold on. Taste test again. Brennan String, thank you for the subscribe. Thank you for the subscription, subscriber. Thank you for becoming a subscriber. That makes sense. I appreciate that. Welcome in. Right. And Sloth Bones, that's another person that didn't show up on my activity feed. Also, welcome in. Oh no! Nobody told me to unpause the timer! Oh well. Whoops. <laughs> I don't know how long ago that was. That's okay. Got some extra time. That is on me. Hope it wasn't too long. <laughs> I was like, wait a second, it's been 9.45 for a long time. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Earliest version of mod. If you're looking on CurseForge, you might try, um... What is it? You might try... Uh, mod runs, that's the other one. Treyas upgraded their membership to Gilded? I don't have a sound effect for that. Thank you, dude. What do I do? Uh, I didn't plan for upgrading subscriptions. Uh, I guess I'll... Can I... Can I... Where is it? Mm, uh, where... Where be... Oh, it's not even here anymore. Thank you so much. I... Oh, I can replay them. Okay. Why does it not show up? Oh, because that was so long ago. Well, thank you, Treyas. Let's see. I'll do that. How do I do this? Okay, here we go. Here's what I'll do. You upgraded to the Gilded, so I will add the extra 10 minutes. Now we're looking at... 9.53... Wait, that's 95 hours. 9.53... Awesome. 22 minutes. Oh, <laughs> That's on me. Okay, this time I'm going to press start on the timer, so now it's going. <laughs> I don't know how you forget something like that. But I managed to. Yeah, this needs to be steeper, I think. Thank you, dude. It's, if it doesn't um, upgrade your, if it doesn't upgrade your Discord, let me know. I, I think I need to manually add the Paladin roll. So, if it doesn't do that, actually, I just do that right now. There did that. Gosh, there you are. The red name helped. Oh, it didn't. Okay. Well, I can give you Paladin rule, but I think YouTube will automatically give you... Oh, it just changed. Okay, cool. No, that was me giving you the rule. I'm dumb. Huh. Okay, so hopefully it automatically does it. I'm not sure how that works. YouTube should automatically upgrade your tier to the correct version. Increase the counter. I did. I added 10 minutes. Comments plus Lance gets the song. Just drop kick back. Huh? I recognize the lyrics. Never mind, I don't I don't recognize the lyrics. 
I thought I did. That was what I thought you were singing. You check on the version. I just told you what the version was. 1.20-2.5.21 fabric. That is the version. If it's not showing up, then maybe check Curse Forge. I don't know which one you're doing. That would be why I didn't know. I have not watched Ninjago. I've seen the Ninjago movie. The Lego Ninjago movie was was great, and I need to rewatch that again. Lloyd. Oh, Whitey, I named you. That's another voice I should add to the to the list. Wait, no, the reward. Oh, did it not update? Oh. Okay, well, that's weird. There's so many quirks with this system. Here, here's what I'll do. I can't manually add it to that counter, but I can reduce the goal to simulate that. But now it's 27 instead of 28, so there. Please don't yell at me. I'm not entitled to give this to you. 2.8.4. Oh, that's the... Why is it different? This is 2.5.21. Well, try that one then. Now, see? 2.5.21. Told you. I don't appreciate that. I do appreciate you, though, uh, Treyas, for upgrading to the Gilded Tier. I think that gives you early access to videos. Um, I can't remember what else it all does. Well, then you're on your own, because I don't, I don't know what to tell you. What do I... Do I bring it back? Could start bringing it back. I want to maybe go like this. Yeah. So either they removed a version from the from the platform or you're not looking in the right spot. That's all I can think of. I don't know what you're trying to do. Get powered on Discord. Okay, cool. Yeah, I got you. I, I equipped you with Paladin, so now you should have the proper role for that. Okay, this seems too even. I think I need to just add texture. And it using 1.20 version. Hmm. I was not aware of this. Wait, I already did that. I thought I was using 1.21 because that's the version of the game we're playing. Oh, that needs to be up here, actually. Ta da! And then replace cobblestone with 50% cobblestone and 50% tough. Oh. Undo. Ready, start. Down, one, up. Uh, second, there we go. Now it should be selected. Yeah, much better. But that definitely helped. Because now it's, um, now it added some variation, some texture to it. Yeah, okay. 
Let's build with the deep slate again so that makes that easier in the future. Yeah, okay. Okay. So, I think I do want this more rounded. That seems... That's not too bad, though. On a large scale, this should be better. I do think the some spots here are a little bit flat. Yeah, that's probably better. Okay. I'm like trying to... Trying to picture how this is going to look in my head. How deep do I want the water to go to? Just let me try. If I go down... Just to here. Having the water come down to, like, this level? Flaps and stairs for the curves. That's true, I could. I forgot about that. Probably. No idea what I said, but probably. If, I could, if this is going to be the level for the water... That doesn't seem scary enough. Four. Hmm. More. Let's work on the curve. I think we'll do. So the thing I was I was thinking about doing is what do I what do I do when somebody jumps off? I could have safety ladder. I think that's probably what I should do. I could have a safety ladder or I could put spikes at the bottom and then they just die if they fall. <laughs> that seems a little mean though. How about that? Does that seem too deep? Then the water level could be like here. Imagine the sponges of water. Yeah, that's it. I like that. Okay. So this is how, how deep the water will go. I'll just put sponge here for a reference. That way I can tell. All right, it has been three and a half hours. When we hit 345, we'll, we'll do another pull and we'll switch games. Not games, we'll switch worlds. Now I have to figure out this wall back here. This one. We do, yeah. Pretty crazy. Getting a chocolate milkshake. Ooh, and hot dogs. Yummy. We are currently at 7.09. Not bad at all. Yeah, I'm trying to work on where this back wall is. How far away. This back, like... Compared to the start and end of this island, it's about the same distance from here to here. So, if you'd like to, sure. I'm thinking, see, that's, how, how long is this? If we were to count it from this sponge to this sponge. 34 blocks. So if I were to measure this out, 34 blocks. Okay. 
That's my super counting ability. <laughs> 31. 35. Okay. Does that seem like an appropriate distance? I feel like it needs to be farther. I need to make this more atmospheric. And then this theoretically could be where the where that cave is. Farther! This is gonna be such a massive project. <laughs> this room alone is just giant. But it's all about the atmosphere. That's what's gonna make this pop. So it's going to make this stand out. I'm thinking I'm thinking that's a good distance. What are we thinking? What do you think? Is this too long? Too short? Can you hardly imagine it? Because it's just a sponge with a, some blocks on it? Probably that one, I'm guessing. How it's going to work is there's going to be the cave. The one that was, was down here. This, this distance here. From here to here is the sponge so that's that's where that is so does this feel this needs to be pretty pretty large I feel like that should be larger which means this space needs to be farther can't imagine okay well yeah you you have trouble with that I know I was I was more so talking the to the people who, who can. What would... I can't, I can't really imagine this. I need to make an actual shape if I can actually see this. Because I, I can, I can imagine what I want to be here, but comparing what I have in my head to what's actually in the game is a whole different story. I'm trying to build a replica-ish shape. Something, something like this. Yeah, some things I, I can remember. Other things I just completely forget. <laughs> Maybe that's not... Ugh. Nope, that's that's gotta be rounded. Or something at least. How's that? That's better. This is this is the water level, by the way. That's what that's supposed to be. Except water level is one down. I am doofus. That's better. This might not feel grand enough. Definitely not. It needs to be taller. More dangerous. Scary, even. Do something like that. Now the shape seems too odd. Eh, it's a it's a contrasting color. That's why I picked it. I also just had it. I don't know why I grabbed it. I forgot. That's better, but it still needs to be bigger. Yeah, that's much better. There we go. That's much better. Oh, that feels okay. Yeah. So this is decorative. You're not going to you're going to see it, but you're not going to be like go over there. I guarantee people. Oh, 
I just realized uh, this is not where the water level is going to go, so that you're not going to... Hold up. Let me make this more accurate. This is wrong. Water level is going to be down there. Whoopsie daisy. Let me copy this. And come up here. Just to the, the edge. That's second position. paste it without overriding the blocks. I'll just redo the curve. It's fine. This is one off. There we go. Yeah, that needs to be taller by far. Liking that. This needs to definitely be taller. Maybe the water level's too low. Yeah, I think the water level's too low. Because if we look down here in this one, I didn't have the ability to work with the water level because it's so subtle. So if I have the water level higher, I think that's what we do. So let's actually undo all the stuff we just did. Here we go. And then we'll have the water level lower than this. Like maybe... This would be here. The water level would be there. That might be one too low. Let's go down one block. Yeah, I'm thinking this is it. So now water level will be a cat in this room? No? Okay. Water level will be there. I think that's better. So we'll put the, the sponge markers. Oinks. Is this, this is eye level, so it's one up. There we go. And I guess we just move this whole thing over. Hut. Haste. Do. Now paste. Does that look good? I'm thinking, I'm thinking a yes. A yes for that one. And then this can be a more shallow river since it's still kind of leading out of a cave. 
So it would kind of be like a... Not really a waterfall, but... There's going to be some altitude change from here to here. Which can be very gradual. What? Okay. Maybe that's not gradual enough. Let's bring this down more. I'm not sure what you're referring to right now. Down. Okay. That's not a bad shape. I feel like this is still too s not steep enough. Something like that. Well, I know it's from the office, but what made you say that? Okay. Come back in. Cool. And maybe instead of curving this off to the side, not like I have anything there to show anyway, Curve this upwards, ever so slowly. That might be even too slow. <laughs> mm. That was a while ago. <laughs> Yeah, okay. And then we'll kind of curve. Because this will be like the exit of the cave. So what we'll kind of do is have this curve out. Something like this. Maybe, maybe steeper. Making it really hard to to identify what this is supposed to look like. Yeah. Yeah, I think that I think that works. It's hard to tell. Maybe. And then obviously we have to get the... Let's work on this curve. You know what? Why not? See, this is... How many is this? This is one full 64, right? Yeah, okay. Oh, this is gonna be bad. Not bad, but kind of annoying. How do I do this? Okay. Well, let's go back to over here. What is the height of this? From here to here. 18. So we need 18 blocks of space before we start hearing it. I could make a, a texture pack that mutes the sound. That wouldn't be hard at all. I would just basically need to replace it with an empty audio file. Kind of annoying, but that's okay. So this is where we would be to avoid hearing it. Does this still feel large enough to feel it grand? 
I think it could work. I do feel like that needs to be larger, but I'm not gonna see this from this angle, but you kinda see the beginning over there. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. I think that's fine, yeah. Alright, I think um I think we've got a shape. Let me I'm gonna do this curve here and then we'll switch. Because we now three forty six. Or three hours and forty six minutes. No. Three hours forty seven. So let's make this way more, uh, what's the word? Steep. Oh, that, that came over to this height Y level way faster than I thought it was going to be. That way it has a little dip in it, so it's not just a flat roof. I don't want it to be like a like a tube or anything. So I'm trying to trying to vary it before it gets to the to the hole. Because I want it to be like it was kind of broken down into. And I think maybe No, never mind. I was gonna say maybe we could have it like a well or something. And that you go down the well. And then you can see, like, uh, maybe it's like a, what were they called? Like, they, they built the well, the inside of the well, out of bones. But A, I can't really do that, and B, you wouldn't see it because you're moving so fast anyway. The thing I can't wait for, I think, right now, is when this room is fully shaped out, stepping into it with sound filters. Yeah, I'm going to make this in survival. <laughs> gonna be fun but now you can see how much more height difference there is oh yeah oh oh yeah that's that's what I'm talking about <laughs> this is gonna be so cool now imagine a full cave this size now I think uh, and I want to keep working on this but I know I gotta switch to the other the games Time. Dedication. Hello. I don't know how how long these should be. Maybe maybe about the same as this. Maybe long I think longer. Longer and thinner, I think. Something like that, yeah. Alright, I'm gonna get my first stand-up in like four hours. It's gonna be awesome, my legs are gonna be so stretched. Oh my gosh! You guys should stand up too. Wonderful. Get your stand-up, stay hydrated. That's how you say that word. Nope, I don't want this one. I want this one. It's got ice in it. Oh yeah, that's the good stuff. Cold, refreshing water. Good for you. Delicious. I just realized this angle makes me look really short. I'm 5'11". Not short, I swear. But I know. Welcome back, again. Oh 
<sighs> yeah, stretching is nice. Ooh, Finish off the last of my delicious juice. So short. So short I could reach a book on the top shelf. But I'm actually taller than B-dubs, which isn't that much, but like it's pretty easy to beat that. He says he's 5'10", I think, right? Or 5'11". But that would mean we're the same height, and I refuse to believe that. So he must be 5'3", or something. As I know he's just a little guy. What did I want to move? I want to move the camera up. And the mic back. Uh, there we go, that's better. I'm going to change shirts real quick. It's really warm in this one. Like two seconds. Much better. Instead of wearing two layers, I'm just wearing... Welcome back, 16-bit. No, oh, my cat snuck in. Hello, Pablo. What's up? Yeah. Hi. You know who I am. You've lived here for like seven years. Don't, don't squeak at me. Fine. Won't pet you. Mm. He refuses to come here. Average cat activities. And now he's leaving. He's decided it's too scary because Cooper's... I got the door for Stuff and... Bye. Yes, I did eat today. Cooper brought me chocolate milk, juice, quesadillas, and ice water on top of my already existing water bottle. So I have been I have been treated. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna switch in, in just a moment. I wanted to keep building on this now that I'm have, like working out of shape, but uh, I think I am going to switch. So, that being said, what project do we do next? Let me start another poll. Well, we might come back to revolutions later too. So let's do... What's next? Where's my document? There it is. So, are we doing print, or craft, or MCC island? Do I have anything else on this list? No. Okay. What are we doing next? Curious to see which one this will be. So far, oh, nope, not yet. We'll see. So far, it's blueprint. Blueprint's at 67% right now. We got some votes coming in. Blueprint so far keeping the lead with 75%. 80%. People are really loving Blueprint. Can you make it to the finish line? 
57%. He looks like he's, he's taken a little swerve and he's, he's lost some of his, his first place positioning. Can he recover and continue his, his first place sta status? He's getting... Oh, but he's, he's slipped and now he's good again. 62% in the lead. It's close. It's going to be a close one, ladies and gentlemen. Will Blueprint secure the victory royale? They're approaching the final corner in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And that is it. The race is over. We are doing Blueprint. We'll do we'll do a 50-50 a between Codecraft and, and MCC Island after. <laughs> we'll come back to, to Revolutions 2. I mean we're gonna be here for almost almost or nine, nine, almost yeah, almost nine hours. So there'll be a plenty of time. I am excited that Blueprint run the won though. I have uh, I've been itching to play some survival. So I'm getting that. Switch to this for now. This one does have uh this one does have an essential installed. I did a I did a secret stream in the Discord like uh, a few days ago. So we did a little bit of off or on camera mining guys technically. Get back down. But yeah, we got lots of ores. Still need a source of XP. But you know what? We got nine hours to, to figure something out. That's actually not true. The last three or four hours, we're going to spend doing something pretty awesome. Um, assuming it doesn't go much longer than that. See a creeper in the back? Yeah, I got a creeper and a flamingo back there. My two buddies. Yeah, I'm. Uh, I've got a project that we're all gonna work on, um, near nearing not nearing the end, but in a bit. I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. Waiting for the game to load. I need to find more copyright free music because all we listen to is C four one eight because I know it's safe. I don't know what else is copyright free. Maybe I could find like an uh, I should create like compile a essential sound. Uh, not essential. It is essential sound, right? What is it? Epidemic sound. Epidemic sound playlist. So I know some of those songs are on Spotify. But yeah, it's uh, we're gonna do a a a project all of us together towards the end. I think it's going to be pretty great. YouTube audio li library. I'm not sure if YouTube audio library's music is any good. I know it's an option. 9,000 hours. That would be ridiculous. Big <laughs> Chungus. Adorable pandas. Oh, you can already hear it. So true. Kevin McLeod is good. I love Kevin McLeod. Give it a second. It's gonna load. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. And we are not joining any servers now. I'll explain what it is in a bit. Alright, we're in blueprint. Yippee. Okay. So what are we gonna do right now? First of all, I want to get a horse, because I want a horse. Horses are nice. Um, but I wanted to dye the horse armor. Uh, Minecraft dye. Color generate. I want the perfect shade of green. Do something like... Go to move down a little bit. Take that. Perfect. What do I need? 
Need three black dye, one cyan, one lime. Okay. Already got music, so I don't need that. I don't have any black dye. Okay, we're going on a walk. Scott Buckley. I haven't heard of that person. Where did I get this lectern from? What is this for? I have forgotten. Not from down here. I finished that. Oh, I know what this is for. We'll do this next. That's not bad. Having alternative ways to make black dye is awesome. So definitely going to make something that. Books. Yeah, I was going to get mending books. That was, I think, the reason I, I made that. So I was going to go find a villager. Yep, the elevator is there. That was one thing I did want to work on, too. Frames are a little low today. Hello. Hello again. Yeah, I wanted to work on the elevator, expanding that sucker, making it wider, like I said I wanted to in the video. And then... Why is everything so laggy? Hmm. Where are my frames at? We need to get squid. Shaders are off, right? Yeah. We need to... Should be fine. Modified the original blueprint pack. So the the problem with uh, blueprint right now is there are mods in the pack that are exclusive to Modrinth, and there are mods in the pack that are exclusive to CurseForge. And I went through the other day, and took all. I went through the entire mod list. And I, I went through and found the mods if they were available on CurseForge or on Modrinth. I think all but six mods are available on CurseForge by its only. Not only, but um, you can get them on, on Modrinth. So what I'll probably end up doing is making a Modrinth mod pack and then uploading that without those six mods and then in the description telling people if you want the exact mod pack completely oh look at the fish if you want the mod pack exactly then you'll have to uh you'll have to go get the mod those mods yourself not afraid of heights i'm afraid of wits an odd thing to be afraid of squid that's what we're here for but yeah i have added actually some mods since uh Oh, a Dropbox is not a bad idea. Um, I have added some mods since the, since that mod list I made a few days ago. Where'd it go? Excuse me. Wow, despawned. Where's the next squid? You like the way the fish swim? They're like more fishy-like. I like it. Yeah, I use Modrinth, but I, I play everything on CurseForge because I had had my mod, my mod packs on CurseForge before Modrinth's launcher even existed. So I just, I haven't moved over yet, and I have so many. Uh, I want to go through them and, and get rid of them. The fear of what? Fish? Or water? Oh, I see. Wide. Come here, squiddy. Squidward tentacles. No. Ha! Got him. I just need a few, but I might as well get extra just in case. Claustrophobic. Or claustroph... That's a thing, right? Claustrophobia? No? Oh, no. Okay, we're good. What should we get? Ten. That'll be fine. What are you guys doing? <laughs> okay. 
That squid? That squid is mine. Going down. 1v1 me, squiddy. You think you have what it takes to defeat me. I'll have you know you are very... It's gone. <laughs> I didn't want that squid anyway. Actually, it was, I'm good on, on ink sacks. That's, that's cursed. Is that a squid I saw? It was not. A humbug. A humbugger. Okay. So, most important thing ever, get dyed horse armor. That will make gameplay significantly better for everybody. Clearly. You guys followed me quite a bit. Unfortunately for you, I'm just better. Pasha. Parkour madness. You wish you could you could have these skills. Look at that. Three block jump. Amateurs. It's probably because I'm streaming it or yeah, streaming at 2k. That it's it's a little bit laggy. It's not terrible, but it's not smooth. I don't know how bad it is on, on OBS. Yeah, that's the elevator. I haven't touched it. Uh, oh, actually, that's not true. I did. I fixed... Um, turn down the music. Um, I accidentally used water at the bottom, and it wiped out my redstone links, so I had to place new ones, so I just replaced it. Other than that, it's identical. But I would like to maybe make an iron farm, because that's not something I really want to do in a video. I just kind of want to have one. I did go mining, though, so we've got lots of iron for the meantime. I think we still got some copper smelting. Yeah. Lots of copper. We're good for a while. Oh, that'll last us a build or two. Okay, we've got black dye. What else did I need? I need lime. I needed cyan. Lime. I think we have green dye left over. No, but I can make some. I have green dye right there. I'm done. White. That's the other thing I needed. Lime dye. Thing sounds quiet to me. Weird. And then I need a cyan dye as well. It means I do need more green dye. Okay. Where are my shears? Oh, I had ink, had ink sacks here the whole time. Hello. Welcome in. I have lost the shears. They're gone. They're somewhere in this chest. I know it. No, they're not. They're gone forever. I'll make... I got plenty of iron. I'm going to make a new one. I might have... Oh, I know what. I got rid of it because I was making... I was cutting leaves for the for the bushes. That's probably where they went. So this is one of the nice things about Create Mod, is I don't have to go find a desert to get green dye, because the green dye comes in the form of ferns. So if I is the crusher green dye, I can put it in. This. The mill. Which is right there. No. 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 Give, give me. I can't stack this. Oh my gosh. Bam. There we go. Okay, cool. Yeah, I thought that might be the case. Okay, cool. Do that. Take these. And yep how. Is it working? I think it's working. Oh, it did that like instantly. Wow. 
Yeah, I was just wanted to place it on a diagonal. I was just hoping it would give me the, the prompt like it does the water wheels. Decided to stay on the camera rather than 16 feet. Ah, okay. Oh, that's you. Okay. I didn't realize they're the same person. All right. Well, welcome in. Yeah, I knew it had to be diagonally. I was just assuming it would auto place diagonally like cogs do together. Okay, we've got lots of green dye now. Now I just need blue. I already had lapis in my inventory. I'm really not that perceptive, aren't I? That's already that's already green dye. Cyan, there we go. Do that. One cyan. I don't think it matters where I put this. Yeah. That's not bad actually. And then three. Three black ink. Is that gonna be too dark? I need an, I need a horse to test it on. Go find a horse. I'm gonna go a direction I haven't gone very much. Um. Also, where's my waypoints? There's supposed to be a few. There's supposed to be one right here, and one at home. Not that button. There was world map. There was mini map. Large waypoint, open waypoint screen, U. That's taken. H, that's not. Where's all my. What? What does that mean? I added. Hold on. H. That sucks. Okay, I'll add a new one. Create waypoint. Boom. Gold. World map global. Now I can see it on the map, but I won't see it in the world. Big brain. I think we're going to go towards this way. Last time I came over here, I looted it and left. I think I might try to find a horse there since it is a plains. There's a lot I want to explore. Maybe that's what we'll do today as well. Looks like just a regular spruce village. A lot of ice. Would like some leather boots, but we'll we'll start by going this way. And also, look at that. That is a lot of furnaces, or a lot of copper, I should say. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Okay, I've got six. I'm gonna put this garbage away. I'm not even gonna bother trying to or trade. Do need the saddle? I don't need the copper. I'll put that in here. Oh geez, I'm running out of space. I don't think I can make andesite blocks, right? I can. Okay. That saves me one slot. I just need a. Yeah, no, it's fine. I'll, okay. Wow, suddenly I have a lot more room. That's crazy. Insane. Okay. And then, you know what? Why not? I'll do redstone as well. Redstone goes here. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. called organization. You wouldn't understand. Beyond your comprehension. We're good. Perfect. Uh-huh. 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 Perfect. Excellent. Look at that. Perfectly sorted as all things should be. All right, let's go on an adventure, shall we? I've got food. Kind of don't want to kill the cows. I'll feed them. Hey, 
Hey guys. Oh, this is the connected fence mod I was talking about, by the way. Allows you to connect them diagonally. It is a very simple and lovely mod. I enjoy it quite a bit. It says I think this name. Um, I haven't seen that movie in so long. Ooh, okay. I will up or uh, I'll look at that next time I am. Uh... Actually, I don't know. Maybe I want to save it. I'm not sure. Okay, let's go. I feel like that green is too dark. It needs more green. Not enough. Not enough. Not green. Twenty-three should be fine, right? Oh, we'll be okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll look at the Tinker Citadel. Um, I kind of want to play them in survival, so I'm not sure. The only thing is, I don't tend to play Forge Packs all that much, and there's no fabric port for that mod, so I'm not sure when that would be. Maybe I'll cave and make a, a, a Forge mod pack soon, and I'll include Alex's mobs and stuff. That's like the main mod I miss, is the Alex's series. Mobs and caves. And Tetra. That's another one. I miss Tetra. I would have added that. Um, but, uh, it was not for fabric. Big sad. Oh. Ooh. Danger. Whoa. Oh. Ho, ho, ho. Hello. Whoa! Oh my gosh! That's crazy! Oh, wow! That is a huge cave. Oh, oh my gosh. That's wild. And it goes on for so long. That's so cool. Maybe I'll do something there at some point. Don't worry about spoilers for the Citadel. Okay, okay. Oh, you're okay. I thought you were talking about the the like the the update for Idas is out, and that you were saying play it at your own convenience, not the pictures. I see. Yeah, that's a that's a deep cave. I understand now, Treas. My computer might not be powerful enough to stream 2K at a at a good frame. Although I say that in a hundred frames, it just does not feel smooth. Though I'm not seeing my GPU go into the reds. That's usually a good sign. Yeah, that is a huge cave. Maybe I'll do something with that. I don't know. I don't want to just do cave projects because I've already got... The mine at home. I've got this mine over here, which I, I think I actually do want to do something on. And then that one, which is by far way bigger, like maybe five, uh, three or four times as large. But at the same time, I don't know. I can't, I can't imagine anything. We'll see. Go for a bit. Okay. Well, thank you for stopping by again. Have fun with whatever you're doing. We'll be here most likely when you get back. <laughs> Unless my Wi-Fi cuts out or something. Which, funny enough, happened right before I left, so I'm I'm slightly worried that it will happen again. Like right as I was about to click a go live, my Wi-Fi turned off for a second. So hopefully that doesn't happen, because I don't want to split this up into two parts. The terrain is just gorgeous. I do wish I could add anti-aliasing though. That's where we're gonna find our horse most out or most likely. Ow. I'm good, thank you though. Hello. What can I do with you? Can I feed you seats? No? 
Okay. All right, Trace. Go get yourself a drink. Orca, maybe, maybe don't do that. I think I've only been here once before. Ooh. Kinda neat. I think that's an orchard? Orchard? Rush land. <gasps> Bangrove! In a jungle! That's pretty nice. That's that's incredibly nice. Now we have red wood. I need that for my, my starter base, so that's actually really nice. I don't have to travel 8,000 blocks like I did for, for Create My The World's Fair. I should have brought a boat. Oops. Alright, cool. There's gotta be horses here, right? Surely. What is that? It's not from Alex's. Not from Wild or Wild. What mod is that from? Is that from Bloom in Nature? No way. I love that they're using the drip leaves here in the mud. It's not just used in the, uh... What's it called? The uh, drip leaf biome in the mango forest. Whoa, are those guys hostile? That's gotta be from Bloom in Nature. Go say hello. If they start charging at me, I will be running for my life. I'm gonna steal your melons. Because I have no other food source. Hello. Are you mean? They sound like they're gonna be mean. I'm gonna stay away. I haven't died yet in this world. I don't want to change that. I think I've been to this village already. Yeah, I, I went to that one. I did bring my bed. That's good. We got termites, it looks like. I kind of want to poke the hive. It's. I'm sure they got it. What in the world? Weird. Okay. I brought my sleeping bag. Which is just a bed. <laughs> hmm. What do these guys do? What is this? Termite mound. So this is termites. But I have seen zero termites. So either they're all dead. Or it's just a block. I'm not sure. I'm going to try to avoid the buffalo. So I feel like that's just a death sentence. Social game or social circle gaming, welcome in. Oh, oh, oh! It's the new flowers or the new the new plants. Look at these! I didn't know they spawn naturally in the world. That's awesome. I have a, a mod called was a verdant verdant vibes, which adds a, a bunch of different plants. Because I was really... Ooh, and tomatoes. That's really nice, too. Um, I felt like the the flora in here is is lacking. So I added, uh, I, think, I think, just that mod for, for new plants. Their village. But no horse. That's another new plant? No, nope, that's part of Bloom in Nature. These guys I know are friendly. They're like pigs. What are you? Oh, I needed one of those for my house. I already grabbed it. Hello, more pig. I 
No cheese. <gasps> I hope we find a mesa. There's a savanna. It's always a desert connected to a savanna. Which means now we have a source of sand. Other than crushing wheels. Ooh, that's spooky. Scary. Almost could have fallen in there if I wasn't just professional parkour person. What do you guys think about this fish, hmm? They move in more fish-like. I got a mob that makes fish more fishy. I'm liking it. It's It literally changes pretty much nothing. But if I ever go looking for a fish, I have to use a fishing rod pretty much. That was one of my big things with fishing rods, is if you want fish, it's just better to kill them with an axe. With that mod, it makes it so they're actually going to swim away from you and it's more difficult to just go kill them with an axe or a sword. So now that that's a thing, it kind of balances fishing rods a little bit more and makes them a, a more useful thing. More tomatoes. A zombie. So cool. Ooh. Termite mound. Surely there's a... That's just more savanna. Brushland. Surely there's a horse in the savanna, right? That's... Horses spawn there. I think I can duplicate these with bone meals, so I'm not even going to bother grabbing them. That scared me, I'm not going to lie. I was like, that's... That's going to break. That's satisfying. <laughs> I enjoy this. Good job, mob, mod creator. Nose is itchy. Oh, it's so pretty. There's got to be more stuff over there. I think the the mangrove forest is one of my favorite biomes in the game. But if they've overhauled the regular jungle no yeah mangrove forest is very close my favorite biome in the game what is that my favorite biome in the game is the jungle's edge which i think is just now called sparse jungle and that is what we are approaching as yes as sweet uh hacker boy what's up man long time no see it's been almost what, seven whole days? Since the last stream? Yeah, mangrove's just really nice. What is these blocks, though? I want to go see what that is. Still no horses. Arena Savannah? We're in the brush line still, okay. Back here. Secret passage. Look at that. Red stone. If only there was a, a, a name for this. Lat Laterate? Illiterate? Be gone! Looks like it has a ribbon, ribbon on it. Well, that's cool. Now I know where to get that stuff. For you. Bottle brushes. Hmm. New flowers to experiment with. Very nice. We'll never complain about new decor. I am already getting tired. It's only been four and a half hours. This isn't even the longest I've streamed. Oh, I love that block. <gasps> we got frogs. Let's go. Are we in the biome now? Yeah, sparse jungle. This is my favorite, my favorite biome. Begone, 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 begone. What is this? A campsite. That is not something I knew could happen. 
Oh, this is oh, this is part of this mod. This is uh, another one of the new plants. That's awesome. Much just been focusing on voicing my latest videos. Took almost six days because I'm sick and voices are. I've been working on a video myself. Funny enough, I also was recovering from a sickness. Whoa. Lag. I was recovering from sickness. I'm I'm back to normal now, but um, for a while there, I was I was first had a sore throat and then was just congested for like two weeks. So now that I'm I'm back to normal, I'm back to making videos. I've got a really big one coming out, hopefully in the next half week, and then a smaller one and then two big ones. So that's fun. Um, I hope you get over your sickness soon. I know that's that's can be nasty, both literally and uh, feeling wise. It can feel nasty, and it is nasty. Being sick isn't fun, so I hope you recover soon. What is that? Ah, <gasps> oh, cat has broken in. Andesite. Andesite doesn't seem to spawn the same way. Oh, frog. This is the saddest block. Uh, I'm going to say Crying Obsidian. Aha, I knew it. Stream is definitely delayed. <laughs> You're going to hear my answer way after... <laughs> way after uh, I, you saw me see it. What is that? Yes, what do you want? Come here to you too. I would I would be more happy to see you, but you never sit with me. You just stand next to me. I'm not gonna grab the I'm not gonna grab the andesite now, but andesite has been a rare thing in my world. So having a large vein of that is awesome. Although we do have a way to automate it. Yeah, I was just, I just could not speak. Like my voice was just dead for a long time. Now it's, now it seems to be back to normal though, which is very nice. I can actually record without uh, feeling like I'm, I'm just sick. Even not sick, it's like, I feel like it's got to be perfect. This is a new wood. I've, I've learned to start settling for less. Not everything has to be perfect. Ebony sapling. What does this look like? Ooh, I like that. I'm going to use that. I got one whole sapling. Chop this. No, you can you can go to bed. <laughs> I would rather you get a good night's rest and continue sleeping at a reasonable time than stay and ruin the sleep schedule again. Yeah, sleep is underrated. I feel like I have an excuse because I work better at night. I'm more productive, I find. Also, when I when I like am locked into something, if I get distracted from it, all the motivation just disappears. Yeah, I would recommend trying to trying to fix your sleep schedule. It is quite nice being able to wake up early. Like even today, I didn't I didn't wake up all that much earlier than I normally do, but I still felt better even even with that slight um, slight difference in wake up time. Pretty nice, being able to get rest and and feel good about waking up in the morning. So yes, get get sleep. Don't don't stay up for a YouTube live stream and ruin your sleep schedule. I was talking to a few people the other day about sleep schedules and 
universally the entire group agreed that once they ruined their sleep schedule, it, it went like the everything just went down from there. So keep your sleep schedule. It is important. That's another new wood, isn't it? Oh no, that's just that's just jungle and birch or jungle and acacia. Yeah. So sleep, get rest. What's this? A sign. This is a sign. Fifteen hundred blocks. We will find something amazing. Onions. We figured it out. Look at that. One step closer to making hamburgers. Very excited to make hamburgers. I might have already had that, but yeah, whatever. I do also want to try working with... Uh, oh, we got blackstone. That's nice. I do want to try working with um, mushroom stem. Because I've worked with mushroom stem in the past, and it is, it is an underrated block. I kind of want to do it again. I like how I said, oh, let's go to the savanna to get a, a horse, and here I am in the jungle. <laughs> There's the savanna. <laughs> let's take a sharp right. It looks like it's just going to keep being jungle, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take a shortcut. We'll do a big U. Hello. Shipwreck, too. I love dynamic sounds. So glad they ported it to fabric. Oh. We have cherry blossom. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Buried treasure map. Easy. Rope. Suspicious stew. I'll just grab the one. Cabbage. I... I can't remember if we have that or not. Let's see what we get. I got nothing? Wow, that's surprising. When does that ever happen? Iron, eh. Go, 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 go. Hey, brain. In the zone, editing a video suddenly gone oh um premiere is just control z and I'll, that'll undo whatever you just did so if you accidentally delete something just push control z and it will be back yeah that, that's something if you ever have a question like that just look it up on google i guarantee you you'll find it in about five seconds yeah just control z it will be all back Hi, Husto. Welcome in. It's only been four hours and 40 minutes and I'm already tired. <laughs> this, uh, this tree is growing on stone. Quite odd, I might say. Still looking for that savanna. This one's also grown on stone. Are they all on stone? No? Hmm. Oh, you don't use Premiere Pro. I would still assume it's Control Z. That's just the universal undo button. Whoa! <sighs> oh, I like this. Okay, I'm gonna add this to the waypoint. We'll call this jungle jungle ha haven jungle haven sure uh enabled oh that's cool you can set it as a destination go to bed then maybe it's because you stay up way too late you said yesterday, I'm about to go to bed. And then you said about means an hour. Which is not about, by the way. That's in a while. Another campsite. I totally strayed from that, uh, that, uh, that sign, but oh well.
This is super cool. Oh, and it's all made of andesite. So I either build something here and it looks really cool, or I destroy the whole thing for resources. Which route do I want to take? On Twitch? Uh, I'm not sure. I haven't uploaded any to Twitch yet. I was trying to upload some to YouTube before the stream started, but I could not... I didn't have enough time. It's fine. I, don't, I didn't want that anyway. Oh, but I could have a globe. I want it back. Take back everything I said. I still love you. This map is going to lead me to treasures beyond human comprehension. You just wait. It'll be magical. Might listen to the stream in the background for watch time and edit my vid. All right. That's fine. Make sure you get some rest, though. I don't... I wouldn't want you to stay up the entire night. That's that's only something I can do. Only I can ruin my sleep schedule. Yes, it's a hypocritical move. But I would rather you guys be healthy. My voice is relaxing. I have voice cracks. That's a weird... Weird... Uh... Observation. Okay, the stream started in the morning for me. Is this from Verdant as well? It's from Blumen, okay. I want to get all the... Although they don't seem that rare, maybe it doesn't matter. Yeah, I, I live on the, the west coast, so it's a little bit easier for me to stream at this time. Some people are like, you're starting at 1 in the morning? I'm like, I don't, I don't live anywhere near where you live. Maybe I'll do a really late night stream one day, but... At least when I start now, I can be consistent and I don't have to be well rested. Or I will be well rested and won't be rushing. Rushland. Okay, I need to go more to the right. Yeah, I live in the west coast of USA. Make sure I don't trip in lava. Nice. I have a few friends that live in Germany. I think I have... I have two friends that live in Germany. But no. He doesn't live in Germany. I have one friend that lives in Germany. But that's very cool. I would like to visit one day. There are some very beautiful places there. It's a very lovely place. I think I was confusing Germany with Belgium. But I know I have one friend from Belgium. Very not very much not the same place, but both places have both places are very pretty. They have late because I don't have a sleep schedule to destroy. Well you see, that's the that's the already destroyed sleep schedule. You can set a schedule whenever you want. Just because you don't hold yourself to it doesn't mean it's not there. Your sleep schedule is just when you go to sleep. I guess it, and a schedule implies that it's consistent, though. You could just have a really bad sleep schedule. I live in New Zealand. It's probably like the first you can get from Europe. New Zealand's also a place... I have so many different places I want to travel to. New Zealand is on the list as well. I've heard good and bad things about New Zealand. But don't bother asking me what good and bad things, because I honestly cannot remember. <laughs> All I remember is that there are good and bad things. But then again, that really goes for any country. Okay. Sheep. Sheep. Thought it was going to be something interesting, but no. Um... This really hasn't been as amazing as I was hoping. I can walk on these? What? I gotta use that for something. America's pretty giant as well. It's like a, a one to two hour drive here is not that far for Americans. Apparently... That is an American thing. 
a one to two hour drive is ridiculous for for a lot of people which i had no idea that was a, a concept yeah that's dang okay we finally reached warmer climate biome That's definitely not true. Your voice doesn't have to be perfect. I str or, uh, I recorded part of Blueprint when I was sick. And I, I knew my voice was not perfect, but I wanted to continue recording. That's a cool shot. The one thing is, you have to be consistent with, uh, with something. So whether that's vocal quality or editing quality, something has to be consistent, because then your viewers will be able to recognize it as content that you make if everything about your videos is different and they can't recognize it from from your other videos to the point where it's like why who am i even watching i don't like this content then that might be a little bit of a issue but if you're if your voice is bad but you can still edit i i don't see why you couldn't take a little bit of time to edit just don't overwork yourself that's fun if I ever need seeds, I know where to go. Oh, that was, that was a good one. It's like breaking a really big piece of ice. Watching a, watching a big rock fall into a river. Eh. I guess it depends on who your audience is. I don't think anybody commented on the fact that I was sick. Or if they did, it was like, get better soon, which was very nice. That's the savannah. That's a weird looking spider jockey. Oh, hello. Bro thought he could sneak up on me. Little did he know, I'm the ninja. They're really quiet. Stars. Oh. Yeah. I don't know. I like the simplistic or simpler measurements. What is that? I don't understand why water shouldn't boil at 100 degrees. That makes way more sense. I would like to switch, but that's kind of hard to do on a national level. Hello. Where? Oh, there. I'm going to play a little game of Will I Die? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna lure him over. There he is. Come on. I'm losing train of thought, or losing, losing focus. Ow. Eyes on the prize. I didn't set my spawn, did I? I did not. I'm gonna get the trident. Ready? 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 Ooh. One more hit. One more hit. One more hit. No, no trident. Lame. Oh yeah, no. There was one short, and I'll never, I'll never forgive this guy. He didn't even do anything that bad. What is this? Oh, <gasps> smithing templates. That's nice. Um, I'll never forgive him for this. I don't remember who it was, but in the in the video, I think it was the first short I made. It was how to make a, an Enderman farm. 
um, I said grab 31 blocks or I know it was 31 blocks. I said all you need is 31. All you need is 31 blocks of endstone. But in the video, I said just under a half stack. And the guy was like, dude, why did you say th just under a half stack? All you had to say was 31. I'm like, it was just a choice of words. What do you mean? Why are you, why are you finding something to complain about? Just accept that I made a, a better enderman farm than you ever could with just under a half stack of endstone. Like, come on, man. Just because I'm the superior enderman endstone farmer <laughs> doesn't mean you you have to get all mad about it. And the guy was like, ah, you're you're so right. I, I didn't reply. But yeah, that is it. Those those comments make me laugh. It's like, why are you getting mad at, about something like that? It's so trivial. It, it brings absolutely nothing to anybody's table. Do you have any video ideas? Mostly my content in Java. I've got lots of video ideas, but they're very like specific to things I do, like being a Minecraft filmmaker that that's I have 11 ex over 11 experience over 11 years of experience. Wow, that took a lot uh, to say that um, in filmmaking. So that's something unless you have 11 years of experience or somewhere some I cannot speak if you have something that you do, whether it be filmmaking or I don't know, gardening, or architecture, anything like that, take your experience that you have doing those things in real life and put that into Minecraft. So that's what I did for me. Is I just I took filmmaking. Whoa. Oh, this is a good one. Yeah, it's a good horse right here. This is a good one right here. It's gonna be at least a 15 stick horse. Wait for it. Wait for it. Stay on target. Guys. That's really mean. Let me tame you. I'll take good care of you. I got cool armor for you and everything. I finally got horses. Yeah. Yay, look at that. Oh, it almost matches. I wonder if I can I can tamper that. Oh, look at how fast. Terrible jumper. <laughs> okay, at least it can jump two blocks. My my last really good horse for speed was just a bad jumper. He could not jump one block. It was ridiculous. Yeah, I won't complain about this. That's not bad. Uh, want to know? Sure. I know a lot of people found me from World's Fair. Grandpa asks how the subathon is going. It is going pretty well. We've we've been going for almost five hours. We've gone from um, from artifact, and now we're in in what is this one called? Blueprint. That's what it's called. So we've we've transitioned from one world to the next, and then eventually we're gonna switch over to uh, either Coldcraft or MCC Island. But it's going quite well. The gravity video that was a fun one. I recorded that back in August, I think, with with Nerz and Crazen. Um, I think I think it was August, something like that. And then I I had it on the had it on the sidelines for a while so I could focus on the other videos because there was so much so much uh, so much footage that's the word there was a lot of footage I think I had like seven hours and no it couldn't have been seven hours it's probably closer to six and a half yeah might watch your mates video soon don't get I think this update is awesome like I talk about in the video they're 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 trying to take elements that have already been in the game and oh I, I put a in the podium um if you had pushed interested in the event it would ping you what is making the game so laggy there's 160 but it does not feel like that i am going the wrong direction um yeah the, i think i think the hype is absolutely there I really like the smaller updates because a lot of people seem to feel entitled to some massive overhaul every year. 
when I don't think that's the case. I think if we got an overhaul every year, the game would be so far gone from the original. At this point, it would just be unrecognizable. And then even more people would complain about how it's too different. There are people who already complain about this. So I think that the smaller, the smaller ones, smaller updates are just way better. We've got some armor trims. We've got new shirts. We've got a new blaze variant. We got trial chambers. What else? I know there's more. We got the new dogs. We got the mace. Like there's a lot of features. There's a lot of elements. It's a sandbox game. They give you tools to, so you can create. That's why I'm so excited for it because they've given us a lot of cool options. Are you going to be mad at me? I think I'm good. Yeah, I'm good. Okay. The mace, the mace is nice. I am. I don't know about the mace. A lot of people told me after I posted that video, you can't up or can't enchant it in in creative mode, or you can enchant it creative, but you can't enchant it in survival. Which I I thought that was the case that you couldn't in survival, but then after trying it, I was like, wait a second, I just did it. So I'm not sure. Um. And then I post the video, and people are like, yeah, you can do it in creative. I don't remember that even being a feature. I thought even in creative mode, if you tried that, it would it would just not work. It would say unavailable or whatever it says. Uh, cannot be enchanted. So that's why I was so confused. I was like, well, maybe I'm wrong then. But I don't know. I still think that the mace is a good tool regardless. It's just a matter of why would people or when would people use it as a primary weapon considering its durability. It doesn't really work because of how little amounts of hits. I guess if you hit the shot, then it, you don't take fall damage, but it still takes durability damage. Don't notice me. Don't notice me. Damn, man. I'm not sure who that is. And dungeon and dogs update. I mean, those are those were pretty expected features, considering people have been wanting both of those things for so long, and they've been adding things like the cave update. They've added new biomes. People have been asking for an upgrade to a jungle and they gave us the mangrove forest, which granted is not the same thing, but still we got a new swamp upgrade. And they've been adding smaller elements to decorative assets. We got the, the decorated pots. We got the hanging signs. We've got armor trims. There's so much new customization and decor that we have available. And I think that's fantastic. I love that. I feel like Mojang is I said bigger. Yeah, I think I think so too. One thing that was uh, pointed out to me is that the meaning um, the the mace head, the thing that you put on it, is the same shape as the the circular mark on the top of reinforced deep slate, and it. It matches the texture fairly well, so people are predicting that there's some connection between that and the, the ancient cities. Which I think would be a really cool way to segue into a, a deep dark uh, dimension or something. Because people are complaining about lack of new dimensions. Even though they've already established that they want to fully flesh out the other three that are already in the game. And then people are complaining that there's no end update. But they've added an end update in 1.9 I think they need to upgrade it again but not like a total overhaul it's supposed to be a barren landscape just what the what a few more features in the end would be nice but yeah that was a that was a long rant that traveled through like eight different topics yeah you're not supposed to be able to enchant it I was only able to enchant it because I was in creative mode when I did it. In the actual, in survival mode, you can't enchant the base. Maybe. If that's the case, that... <gasps> if that's the case, that'd be a really weird and, and kind of neat way to open it. I don't think that's how it will be opened. I'm not sure what it would be. I hope it isn't just light it with a flint and steel or put ender eyes in it. Because we already kind of have that. Um... But I would like to see a new dimension. I just don't know how it would differ enough from how the other two dimensions exist already. Because I don't want just another end or just another um, nether 
with the theme being Skulk, I feel like that's just going to be super underwhelming. If they do a Nether update, but for the end, or a Nether-like biome, the new Nether-like biome for a Skulk, maybe they'd get away with it. I just, I feel like it has to be different enough to separate them. It's like you can find end, or you can find uh, nether stuff in the nether only. You can find, um, you can find end stuff in the end only. You can already find skulk, su skulk stuff in the overworld. So it has to be different enough to actually persuade the player to go and want to explore that new biome. Why am I traveling through a bamboo forest with a horse? What, what did I do this to myself? Yeah. That's one of the things we have in Revolutions. <gasps> Pandas! We have the ability to link minecarts together, which is just awesome. Um, I haven't... I've yet to use it yet, but I would love to find a way to use it in Artifact. Gotta find a way. There we go. Yeah, we can link minecarts in that mod pack. But in, in the base game, either linking them together or finding some way to overhaul them definitely is, is something that would be nice. Or we're about halfway there. I would love to see a minecart overhaul. Whoop. I'm not going to jump that. Yeah. That wasn't going to happen. What was I thinking? I like this song. Is this part of the... It is. Okay, cool. Wanted to make sure it was still safe. Some of the... Sometimes uh, Spotify will just switch my playlist once it runs out of music. A certain snapshot that completely changed minecarts is really good. Uh, I can't remember that at all. What's the idea for Revolutions? I'm not sure. I know Crazen wants to focus on other projects at the moment. He doesn't really want to do survival, I think is what he told me. So I know a lot of the a lot of the members are are busy at the moment. That was why we stopped the server. And I was like one of the few that continually had that free time. So I could have kept going. In fact, that's OK, there goes. I thought the world had froze. Um, I could have kept going. In fact, I was talking to Crazen about possibly playing it single player um, if the server doesn't come back on for a while. And then that way I can have an excuse to continue developing uh, Artifact for a video or even just playing around with the mechanics in survival because that was something I wanted to do was play around with it in a non-creative setting. Being able to use that sugarcane farm that I got to design would be so cool. I think that has so much potential. All of these different mods. Oh, dang. Yeah, three times faster seems... Uh-oh. Yikes, sorry, horse. Three times faster seems a little bit much. Too overpowered. Do you think making hardcore videos would get some views because of a big decision of mine? I don't know. I mean, it, it really depends. Are you going to make just what everybody else does? Or are you going to make hardcore videos that are unique? Because if you're just going to do exactly what everybody else does, you're not going to get anything really. You're going to you probably get like maybe a, a few good video, like good view videos, but it's just going to be people looking for hardcore. You want people that are looking for your videos. That's why I say try to try to find a way to be unique. Because if you find a way to be unique, people stay around. If you just make what everybody else is making, yeah, you might get some views, but the problem with how do you make them stay, how do you get people to to like what you do other than that video? That's the problem. All right, Polyframe. Thank you for for coming by. Have a wonderful day. If you come back later, we'll probably still be here. <laughs> um, I'll see you later. Thank you for for showing up.
Uh, really big update would probably be released in the lowest dip. I don't know about that. I mean, it's gonna. It would, if they were gonna do a big update, they already do a yearly update. I would not be surprised at all if they did one next year. Considering they do yearly updates, pretty much. I can't remember the last time they didn't do one. In fact, I'm fine giving them a year because I know how much effort it takes to make games and to balance it for all types of people to recode everything to make it uh, playable with uh, lower end computers to make it uh, something enjoyable for both beginner and later level people like people who are familiar with the game and people who are brand new how to make a, an element in the game that works for everybody. There are so many different factors that or so many different factors that just get completely overlooked. I see a source of andesite. That's pretty nice. Uh, videos are oversaturated. Yep. I don't like hardcore. I have an idea for a hardcore series that I'm not going to say in case I do do it. But uh, it's it's very different. And I think that would be appreciated because... I, I, I never really got into the hardcore stuff, but watching it, it was just so repetitive. There are only a few people I can name that, that do it well. NC is one of them. He does it he does it in a really unique style, and he's got a storyline to it. It's still hardcore videos, but he does it in a way that's different, and I appreciate that. Girl Z ain't doing it. Try. Are you on a Mac? Try, uh, try uh, whatever the other button is. Uh, command. Command Z. Uh, at the top left, probably, I don't know what device you're using. Oh, hi, Ash. On the top left, I would recommend uh, trying to find file or edit and then looking for an undo button. I am confident an editing software has an undo button. I promise you there's one there. I would look it up if you can't find it. If there's, a, if there's an editing software with no undo button, that is a terrible editing software. Like, even the most basic ones have that. You're in Windows. Okay, maybe maybe there's a keybind confliction, or maybe you don't have it bound at all. I would look it up. Check, uh, check under Edit at the top left and see if there's something there. Assuming there's an Edit tab. You might have to do your own looking around for it. I've never used CapCut. DaVinci Resolve, I know, has a Control-Z button. Otherwise, no one would use it. That's also a really nice free editing software for all you uh, video editors who want to get into it. Or people who want to get into video editing. Probably plan- Oh no, he takes months on his videos. NC takes so long. Because he, he designs the builds himself. He, he builds the story that he's slowly revealing and it's all connecting together. He does these insane visual effects, which I think are a little bit over the top, but people like that. I like the much more chill Let's Plays, so even even with that preference, I still can find the, the spot in my heart to appreciate how much effort goes into that. The effects do look quite cool. This Control Z is also for clipping. Well, that might be why it's not working. You, uh, you might look for another keybind then. Yeah, Incy's pretty crazy. He's, he's an awesome dude. Wonderful, creative, super fun person. I was talking about for for most whoa for most editing softwares, Control Z or Command Z is the option, depending on what platform you use. Yeah, Edit Undo is one of the most common combinations. Want that? I'll take that just for the blanks. We're almost home. We got our horse. Pretty nice. You know, I don't, I don't even. I'm not even too bothered by the difference in color. Came a little bothered. I'll try to try to fix it. What about if I just add blue? Yeah, we gotta breed this guy. Nope, that's too blue. We'll figure it out later. Right now, I just got a horse. 
because I wanted some speed other than my feet. Now we got that. Um, next up, I'm going to use... I'm going to take a break, probably use the bathroom, grab some, grab a snack or two. And then... Hmm, what do we do? I wanted to work on making the elevator a little bit bigger, but I think I... Oops, sorry. I think I will make a, an iron farm. I have iron right now, but I know that's going to go fast, especially with create mods. So I think that's what we're going to do. It's still going. It's just really quiet at the moment. It'll come back. There we go. Okay. I had leads. I swear I did. There it is. Let's get you sorted out. Perfect. Uh, I don't have Hypixel. I was banned from Hypixel for inactivity. No clue why. They didn't give me a reason. And because I was inactive on it, they said I couldn't appeal it because it had been so long since I played on the server. So after buying VIP Plus, they have banned me from Hypixel. No clue why. Um, MCCI, I do play very occasionally. I was in MCC Rising 2. And that was kind of my introduction to MCC Island. So I, I do have access to that. And there are some fun games and a new one I haven't played yet. That was one of the games I put as an option for for a, a game that I play. And uh, Blueprint got voted instead. So at some point, we'll probably end up hopping an MCCI. But um, at the moment, yeah, I did neither. I was so mad. I convinced my dad to, to let me buy VIP plus rank when I was like 13 or 14. And then I played for a while and then stopped playing. Bye for a find. Have a good meal. Yeah, I, I, uh, I stopped playing because I was I was focusing on either not playing Minecraft or I just was playing other things. And I tried to log back on one day and they were like, nope, sorry, you've been banned for inactivity. Which makes zero sense. I don't understand. And I couldn't appeal it. Or it was either I couldn't appeal it, or the effort it would have taken was just unnecessary. So I'm just like, I'm just not gonna play Hypixel. I didn't I don't really enjoy minigame servers all that much. So I'm not I'm not too sad about it. But it does kind of make me upset. It's like why would I've I've done nothing. Or if I did do something, I don't remember. I'm a different person now. <laughs> but I I don't think I did anything. But yeah, I'll probably end up playing in MCCI later. I could play in my second account, but uh, I'm not that motivated to play on on Hypixel. Not sure why I was banned. If it wasn't um, inactivity, they didn't tell me why. What was I doing? I already had onions, okay. I didn't have tomato seeds. I did have cabbage. Okay. Well, I think that means we can make hamburgers now. Why don't I actually do that? Let's do that. Use cap cut, lol. DaVinci is way too bulky for my PC to run. My CPU needs to be fixed soon and replacement will arrive in July, so instantly push up some videos. It's hard to piece. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure then. That's one of the things that's hard for starting is uh as a creator you get you have to be able to run that mm, that could be it then which is weird because i haven't ever been hacked before at least not that i can remember if it if i had been hacked it'd be a long long time ago because i can't recall ever being hacked that's really odd then okay huh weird I'll, uh, I'll look into that at some point then. I'm in no rush to. <laughs> I need another chest. That's free. Yeah, I'm, in, I'm in no rush to do that right now, just because I don't have any super dire wants to play in Hypixel, considering how many things in single player I do. I needed bread. Do that and make more bread. You know what? Just for funsies. There you go. 
me the whole problem is that yeah I, sh I should have started doing things to make people mad i think that was the solution let me try just adding lime that seems too dark what if i add a black as well I feel like I need to add green. Add more green, right? Yeah. Let's add green, black, and blue. Just add all of them. Try that. Still not the right color. Or green! about two green. More blue! Color theory is, is difficult. <laughs> That's not green enough. More green! More green! That's not good. That's too, too pale. That's worse. Oh no. More green. What? I messed the color up. I gotta start over. <laughs> this mod pack makes uh makes them really expensive. Okay, we'll try. I go up. Let's try one cyan, one lime, one black. You're addicted to your printer? That's a weird thing to be addicted to. Never heard of that before. Alright, more sheer action. Oh, I had a pair of shoes. I knew it was in there. Lime and black dye a little blue. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. This, uh, I got a website that is supposed to help you get the, the perfect colors. And you, you pick your hue and then it tells you what to get. And it tries to make it as, as close as possible. So black, cyan, lime. Let's try that. At like 80 views in six days that's not bad at all the algorithm cut the flow of views and yeah that's one of the things about content creating is sometimes things fall out of style sometimes people click on it less and less that's that that happens to all channels though it happens to my videos it happens to pewdiepie markiplier big names as well the thing is it usually lasts longer for them before um before those views start drip dripping dribbling I can't think of the word. They start uh, getting less on their videos. So it is a hard thing to to balance is how do you make something that continually is something people want to watch. That's something I still I'm still trying to figure out. But um, eventually I honestly and I keep saying this and I don't think people understand how important it is. Stop caring about views. It doesn't matter. Make something that you're proud of and people will start watching that. Sometimes it's just a matter of finding your audience. It really does not make a difference. It does not make a difference. If you get 1 million views on your first video because it's something people click on, cool, that works for one video. You might get 100 followers from that. I've seen channels with 100 subscribers that have video a video that has 300,000 views. It does not matter if you make one banger video. If you don't have a group of people that like what you like, it's it is difficult. Yes, it is exact. It is incredibly difficult, and it takes a lot of time building a community, finding people that have similar likes. That takes time, but it is something that is so rewarding to pull off. I would recommend going for the long game. You're gonna find it so much more entertaining for yourself. 
than just trying to appeal to the algorithm. My videos are things that I want to make. They're things that I am proud of. One minute. Pretty much, yeah. That, um, the MCC... Let me see, what was it? The MCC application video that I did. We had two days to do that from start to finish, from planning to filming to editing. Um, I pretty much wrote that whole thing, recorded the whole thing, and edited the whole thing in two days because it was something that I was passionate about. I didn't want to make something with views. I wanted to make something that I was genuinely passionate about. I made that seven months ago. That's still one of my favorite projects to date because it was something that I was like, can I do this? Is this something I can pull off? And it was something I pulled off and I was so happy. Sure, there are things I would change about it now, but it was something that it spoke to me from a filmmaking perspective. I, I was able to write a story and convey that story in a very uh, a very well paced manner. It um, it also was a great application overall because it was immersive within the world building that we made for it. In a matter of three minutes and forty eight seconds, we were able to do that. The video I made yesterday, or was it yesterday? Yeah, yesterday with the or two days ago with the maces, that took about forty five minutes to record and like four to six hours of editing. And then again, it took maybe an hour or two just to make the thumbnail. Focus on quality over quantity. Make things you want to make, make things you're proud of. I will never stop saying that because it is so important for longevity. Do I have... I do have... Save my stream. All right, for real this time, let's make this armor. Black ink. Bam. Leather horse armor. Bam. Lime dye. Cyan dye. Bam. This is the combo. It's close enough. You know what? Whatever. I probably should have... Uh, here, let me try... Got lots of... Gosh, it's so expensive in this version. Let's see. I'm going to try it. Gonna take me one day per scene? Sure. That's fine. It You think I started doing it really fast? No, it was really slow. Ooh, that might be the combo. You know what? That's pretty darn close. I'll take it. We match. Okay, I'm going to put the buried treasure map away. Yeah, I think that's everything. That goes there. That goes there. That's pretty much full. Yes. We're good. Okay, cool. Can't find the application. It's called Purple Prisoners. Who had low attention spans. You have to keep them. That's honestly, that is a load of baloney. That's not true at all. People have low attention spans for things they don't want to watch. You guys watch my videos. I would argue those are not they're not, um, they're not fast. They're slow paced. They're 20 minute videos. They don't have insane cuts. They're not constantly adding visuals to the screen. But the reason they work is because the pacing is done well. I am so incredibly conscious of when audio starts playing, of when the cuts are, of when you're seeing things. Most of my videos is just cutting. There are almost no visuals. That video that I posted yesterday about the maces has 2,700 views. It has three sound effects the entire video, not counting music. That is it. It is all about pacing. It is all about presenting your viewers with information they want to intake. It is all about presenting your viewers with entertaining content. And that is done through personality in combination with editing. Some things can be made funnier with editing. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to break the immersion a little bit here. When I do my videos, there are times when I say things wrong or I say things um, with just a slight error in timing and I might take an audio segment from from later on in the video where I said I was like mining or something and I was like, oh, diamonds. And I might cut out that O, which is a genuine O, 
and put that somewhere else where I said, oh, oh, or like I had a voice crack and I just moved that O oh, because it will make it something a little bit better. That was a terrible example. I've literally never done that exactly, but <laughs> but like if something maybe somebody's talking over me, I have my audio tracks separated, so I just mute them for like half a second so you can hear my voice. That kind of thing is so underutilized. You don't want to overwhelm your viewers with visuals. You don't want to overwhelm them with with audio. Instead of making your content so fast, it's hard to understand. Make it something that resonates with them. Make it something they have to think about because it's something they're interested in. That's how you do content well. Thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah, that was I, I had no sleep that night because we had to get it before the deadline. And if I had slept, we would not have been in MCCR. <laughs> We would have we would have uh, missed the application deadline, and that would not have been. I'm in uh, MC Live, like, I'm in Minecraft Live. I'm in the pre-show for like five frames. That wouldn't have happened if I had had gone to sleep that night. So that is what exception to getting a good night's rest is, getting into an event like that. <laughs> but for the most part, get good sleep. It's nice. It's good for you. That's right, I have to put this differently. I love the colored books. That looks so cool. Pacing is a hard thing to get used to. That was something I struggled with. And you can actually tell in my previous videos, it has gone through changes. Like uh, even just my how to be a filmmaker video, I've slowed down. You'll notice if you watch my videos now compared to th back then, even just a few months. Um, all right, Alexander, even in just a few months, the difference in pacing for my videos has changed so exponentially. And it's it's such a minor detail that you might not even notice, but it it's something that people un what's the word? It's people that it's something that people notice without noticing it. Yeah, maybe it's because you you haven't actually fixed your sleep schedule and you're actually incredibly tired. Maybe go to bed. What was I doing? Oh yeah, I want to cook this. Um, I've got lots of coal. I can I can sacrifice some of it on minced beef. That, put that, put that, put that. I say go to bed. If you're tired, get some sleep. The stream will probably be here when you wake up. M maybe I don't know how long you sleep. I don't know why you're staying up. There's no reason to. I just want to make sure I didn't miss anything. I know stream elements is not have my back. All right, we're good. Cool. You guys should both go to bed then. I don't want to have to feel like I, I have to parent you, but getting sleep is good. It makes you feel like a big, strong, big, strong uh, individual. You will you will wake up rested and, and have lots of, of energy to do what you want to do. The only reason you can really like f eating, exercising, drinking water, getting good night's sleep. Those are all elements of becoming a more positive person, becoming a more energetic person. And it's it's something that is that often goes just really un un what's the word? unattended. It's something that just goes over people's heads. People forget that taking care of your health is something that's important to do. Hey, if you want to I don't know why I went into a really terrible Russian accent. I don't know where that came from. But yeah, it's it is a really important thing. Where is my backpack? What? If already I already had that advancement, excuse me. That was weird. Hmm. Backflip. Oh, the backflips don't work. Just sitting. If I'm your role model, 
then get some sleep, because I get sleep. Okay, you know what? If you if you guys want to have a terrible sleep schedule, be my guest. I I promise you it's it's better to have a good sleep schedule, but do whatever your heart desires. I like the I like the gray bed more. Okay, what do I need to do? I need to use the bathroom. That's what I need to do. I'll be right back. Get some water. Stretch your legs. I'll pause the timer. Here we go. Woke up at 5 a.m. You're getting sleep now. Go to sleep now. I get up at 11 because I go to bed late because I'm editing all day. It works for me and I still get a good amount of sleep. <sighs> hmm. All right. Fine. Be a rebel. Okay. What, uh, what, uh, what, uh, what, uh, what do I do? Hmm. That was what I was going to do. I was going to plant. I was going to plant onions, and I was going to plant cabbage, and I was going to plant tomato. That's it. Isn't it better to, like, alternate between the different crop variants or something? I'll try that. That is tomato, right? That's cabbages. And the onion goes in the third one. Look at that. Shush, crows. Ah, uh, what should we do? Hmm. I feel like there was something else I was going to do that I'm forgetting. I'll do make a hamburger. Yep, okay. I was right then. Do I have bone meal? Iron farm. That's what I was going to do. What do I do for iron farm? Maybe... No, I'm not going to design train. I need both monitors for that. Hmm. It's 
Okay, okay, okay. Let's work on this. So one thing I wanted to do, I said this in the video, I want to make this wider. I love the way this looks right now. But I'm not a fan of how it looks down there. So there's two options. One, I could start over, get rid of all the foliage, and then dig the whole thing way deeper. Or two, which is actually the thing I'm thinking I'll do, is I'll expand it downwards. So I'll keep this top section, have it like close in a bit, and then expand it out. So that way it's just enough that it's not touching the edge here, and it's not connecting to the pillars, but then the rest of it will be deeper. You like the audio? Oh, this is with a... Yeah, I do use OBS. I use OBS for streaming and I use it for recording. And I can do both at once if I really wanted to. But this is uh, an application called Snip. It connects to my Spotify or Apple iTunes. I don't think it does anything else. I'm not sure. I use, I use it for Spotify. And then I uh, will take that and... I think uh, there's a there's a text application that it hooks up to. You double click on the application, it opens up, it connects to your Spotify, and then it will constantly be updating that text application with the name of the song and the the, the name of the song and the artist. So after it does that, you can take that text file and then put it in OBS, and then it will constantly be displaying. So I just have it. I have two of those. One of them is the white, and then there is a 50% transparency version that is dark gray right underneath it to give it a shadow. So yeah, that's how you do that. And it's the same font I'm using for down here in the timer as well for Doka 1. Okay, we don't, there's no way we have, these are gurus, right? Jeez, those are, it's actually more andesite alloy. So I need to go mining for andesite. If only there was some place I knew that had a lot of andesite. I wish it told me what block I was looking at. Um, I think it was this way. Where was it? Because we came from the top. That's andesite. This whole thing is andesite. Or this, this section at least. That's andesite. Okay, that's where we're going. I'm going to cut over the mountain and then go to the rocky jungle. And we're just going to get mm, too many stacks of stuff. These are empty. Perfect. Let's go. The bottom left thingy. So I bought a long time ago a theme for streams. But this is... Wanted to make sure this is officially Minecraft licensed audio. It's last time some random dude copyright striked me and said that this is my music, even though it was it was not. Um, but YouTube doesn't care, and they will hold you accountable anyway for music that you have full right to. So I just wanted to make sure it was it was Minecraft's official music. But um, at the bottom left, and the the border around my camera and the notification pop-ups, those are all from a website called Nerd or Die. I just, I bought a stream theme, which I think coincidentally, and I didn't know this when I bought it, is the same theme that Solidarity uses, which is, is kind of funny. I didn't, I did not realize that when I was, when I bought it. Um, but he uses the light, the orange version. I use the blue version. It comes with two different colors. Um, but that, yeah, it's from a website called Nerd or Die, and they, they sell different stream themes. I bought that like <laughs> like six years ago at this point. Um, but it hooks up to stream elements and stream elements uh, keeps track of donations. It keeps track of subscriptions. It keeps track of memberships, all that stuff. And then I can tell it, hey, here's all of the ow, ow, ow. Here's all of the different information. Uh, use the code that the stream theme provided and make it a goal yeah yeah so that all of those things work together how did i make the yeah it's from auto hud i can actually turn it off with a button i can't remember i set Ooh. <laughs> this button 
Why is my armor back? Get that out of here. Auto HUD. Maybe I'd have the... Here it is. Oh, I have it turned off. Okay. Yeah, I have it. So I have it con configured. Radoka one is what I use. I'm going to do keybind or a mouse keypad for um, dynamic surroundings, exposure, entity cooling. I'll answer the question again in a second. Let me skin toggle mod. I'll do this F5. Why is it? Okay, that's cool. Um, what in the world? <laughs> Thank you. Oh my gosh, that's hot. Can you put the napkin underneath it? Yeah. Thanks. Oh, I appreciate that. <laughs> it's just a canned chili. Awesome. Thank you. Oh man. Huh? Okay. Bye bye. Have have a good time at dinner. Okay, so, uh, yeah, so I got auto HUD for hiding the hunger, for hiding the hearts, and I can set it so each individual thing will will turn on or off. So in Coldcraft, I have all of it turns off. My HUD, my experience bar, or not my HUD, my, my hot bar, my experience bar, my hearts, my hunger, and they only show up when they're less than max. In here, I have the the block overlays, but in cold craft, I do not. Um, the armor is the same thing. See, I can, I can toggle it back on and off with the button. So it is there. It's just, I have it hidden. And then same thing with the armor. I have it disabled. So you can see my lovely skin, which my, one of my good friends made for me. I'm just going to copyright. Yeah, I don't think so. It's it, that was, that was under fair rights or fair use. So I think I'm good there. That's kind of neat. But we arrived at our destination. This is yeah. This is where I want to be. Um, someone's gonna yeah. I don't think it's gonna happen. No one's gonna copyright me for that. If they do, they're not winning that. Use auto HUD. But I didn't know you could choose what I. Yeah, yeah. If you have the configs, uh, or like. Mod menu and cloth config, I think, is what I use. You can customize. That's really loud, isn't it? Let me know if that's too loud. I'll turn it down. But you can customize what elements do and don't get hid. You can customize um, how long they're they're able to be seen for. You can customize the animation. There's a whole lot of things, and it allows you to just create the perfect HUD. It's so nice. The only the only thing that I don't like about it is the fact that um, when you have not if you have the experience bar hidden, for example, the hearts still show up in the same place they normally do. They don't scoot down, so it looks weird. That's why I still have the experience bar, even though I don't really need it. I have the hot bar because um, because I'm playing create mod, I felt like having the hot hot bar was more important. But in other mod packs, I might hide that if it's if it's not as relevant. Studio blocks and cold craft are two good examples of that. The whole the whole HUD is hidden. Uh, the new mace update. So basically, in the new snapshot, in trial chambers, there is a small chance you can get a mace head. And they've replaced the wind charges that you would originally get originally get from the breezes. Now you instead get breeze rods, which can be converted to um, they can be converted to wind charges, or you can turn that into a mace using the wind breeze rod, using the breeze rod as a handle, and then using the the mace head from the loot um, as the the head of it. So it's a, a new weapon. The longer you fall, the more damage it does on impact, and it doesn't deal any damage or fall damage to you if you land the hit. It's a super cool feature. But uh, I, I can't really see it being a good primary weapon. That was my only only concern about it. For some reason, one of my most poppin' streams got copyrighted. Oh, it's gone.
Yeah, sometimes people will just copyright it for no reason. That's YouTube for you. They're not really great about doing that. YouTube is not a great platform for smaller creators. If you want to get into it long term. Because they, uh, they like money. That's, uh, that's Google for you. Google's nice, though. They got you YouTube. They got you Google search engine. They got you, uh, Gmail. And Google Docs and all that stuff. So there's some good things about Google, but they do like money. Had anything, because they use first-person perspective as well. And it looks better for more cinematic shows. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, I have an F1 for that. And I should probably set a keybind. Oh, I don't think I can have multiple profiles, but... Um, you, you'd think that you could have one, one profile that just has the hearts missing, and then one profile that has everything. I wish I could just keybind that. But I don't think that's possible. But, uh, yeah. Your old computer can't handle the new features. Yeah, and that's something they're trying to address as well. If you own the base game, Bedrock Edition might be a better option for you, because it's it's more lightweight. But uh, it, it does not behave the same. The only thing about Bedrock that I, I really enjoy being different is the watercolor. You can tell the, the water is much more blue, and that's because I have a mod that takes the watercolors from Bedrock and and makes it available for Java users. But yeah, uh, Bedrock might be a little bit better for performance. It's just you're playing on the Windows version rather than the official Java version. But hey, if you can play the game, it that, that's pretty nice. <laughs> it's better than not being able to. You can also get a bunch of performance mods. Like my game would not be running as smoothly as it does if I if not for sodium or leaf cooling. Or less leaf cooling. I do not watch Doctor Who now. I haven't watched that since like 2011. Long time ago. I don't remember like anything about it other than that David Tennant's in it. So that's pretty cool. I like him. He's the doctor. My aunt is a big fan of, of Doctor. I agree. I think that um, Java is more polished as a finished product. Bedrock is on its way, but frankly, I don't know if they'll ever get to the same level that Java will ever be. Um... One of my best streams got copyrighted for no reason. Never really gotten anything copyrighted before. Set it to private. Where do you appeal it? I think, and honestly, I I think you can't appeal it until you've reached affiliate. I'm not sure if I'm a, that's true or not, but I think that's the case. Where you just, it, they won't let you appeal it unless you have enough subscribers, have enough watch time. Which is dumb. But until you start making money from it, Copyright doesn't matter. Because the whole thing is the revenue from that video goes to the the music author. But if you're not making any money from it, then it doesn't really matter. You can't control the advertisements. So if YouTube steals or puts ads on your videos, which they're not supposed to, but if they put ads on your videos and you don't get any money from it, it doesn't matter really who it goes to. Once you start making money on the platform, then it becomes an issue because then they're stealing your money. The profit that would go to you goes to these people who pretend that the music you are using is theirs. Can you code your stream overlay with HTML? I think so. I, I don't know HTML, but I, I think that's I think that's a possible thing. David. If you've appealed it before you had affiliate, then there's probably a way, I just don't know. I've only had to appeal it two times now. First on the Studio Blocks one, and then also on the the, the seven hour stream. Which I, I did not appeal because the music I did end up using was actually not something I had fair right to use. But it was like a 30 second segment. They said the stream is too long to edit out that 30 second segment, so you're kind of screwed. I was like, well, that's not convenient at all. Thank you so much, YouTube, for that information. 
But the the one that I got copyrighted for in Studio Blocks, that one I was completely unfair, right? It was literally a music disc for Minecraft. And they were like, no, that's my video. I made that. You're not C418. You didn't make it. And uh, it is still in review. Still waiting on that. Until that gets processed, I am being withheld a whole 45 cents. I'm so sad. I know I got a new PC and I'm going ham on the MC mods. I just found a channel. MC Minecraft mods just, they're so nice. Whether they're client side or something that changes something huge about the game, there's something that pretty much anybody can can enjoy, which is just wonderful. Minecraft thi thrives. Minecraft thrives on its community, and mods are a huge part of that. I'm glad you got to experience it. Uh, no, it was Chirp. Chirp was the music disc, one of the the old ones. It wasn't C418. It was some random. Um, some random country, uh, some random company, not country, some random company flagged the video as theirs, even though it was not. That is even in one of, Minecraft has a Spotify playlist of music that is safe to be used by creators. Chirp is in that playlist, so I have hard evidence that I can use that video, or use that music. Granted, I was using other C418 music, which I was less confident I was able to use, but I didn't get flagged for that. I have never been flagged for that, and I've been using that since the very beginning of my streaming. So it's just some company trying to take advantage of YouTube's very poor copyright system. It's just dumb. Interesting, all the ones that aren't C418 had copyright. Really interesting. Uh, I need andesite for create mod machines, so I'm just, I'm just, you know, the usual, um, really taking care of the environment, conservation and whatnot. I forget this is, this is Minecraft music. They did those lo-fi remixes, and it threw me off because I'm like, that doesn't sound like Minecraft. I should probably eat this chili. Though I doubt it will get cold anytime soon, it's chili. My brother brought up oven mitt to even hand it to me. That hot, it's going to be a problem. I'm really hoping we don't get to the hot sauce. Um, which, by the way, that's what the da bomb is in the description. Da bomb is a really hot hot sauce. I was really hoping that I won't have to eat that because I am not a fan of hot sauce and I don't think I could tolerate that heat. But I, uh, I think we're good. My dad was like, if, if you get to that many subscribers, I will give you a half gallon of milk to drink. <laughs> I was like, you know what? Sure. That owns wood. He owns the rights to wood. All wood. Well, I'll never build with wood again since your dad has the rights to it. Oh, that's right. I can sit on slabs. I think that's probably enough andesite for now until I run out, which with the rate that I use andesite will be very soon. This is not going to last me very long. This is this is a few stacks of andesite alloy at best. Why is the swap mouse 27? Oh, it's because for some reason um, stream elements decided that numbers don't start from zero. They start from three. So I had to make do and instead switch the goal 
from 10 to 13 or something like that something yeah and then i switched it to 14 out of 27 because treyas upgraded his membership from magma to gilded and stream elements did not recognize that as an upgrade so they didn't upgrade the thing so i did it manually and i can't add the first number on my own so what i had to do was upgrade the upgrade i had to raise the the goal or lower the goal one so it should have said 26 or something it was supposed to be for i think 25 subs yeah 25 it was a, it was it was just a really obscure way to fix the problem i have found no great tools for doing subathons this was the best i could find normal to gilded oh you went from normal to gilded so okay I don't think that makes a difference. It still it still should have recognized it, but it is odd that it didn't. I thought you went for magma cuz it I think I was thinking of the the gifted cuz those are magma. Yeah. Magma, magma. It doesn't even read it on the activity feed, so I guess it just doesn't know what to do with upgrades. Why am I still mining? I'm on the horse. Go home. Ow. Now I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna eat some chili. Mmm. Food. I didn't want you to drink, but I'm too broke. Yeah, I don't expect anybody to drop uh, that many subs. I mostly did it just in case. Because I know crazy things will happen in subathons, but I honestly did not expect anybody to, <laughs> to get to that number. I was surprised to even get the five gifted from, from Drew. I was not expecting that at all. Don't have... Yeah, that's supposed to automatically be updated as well. I'll, I'll, have, to, I'll have to try to figure that out later. It's supposed to update on its own, because that's... Ooh. That's um, that's automatically applied to by YouTube, not by me. Paladin is a rule I made. The, the the other rules, the different levels of eggs are granted from YouTube, so it automatically detects if you have it. So either it takes time, or you might need to disconnect and reconnect, or I'm I'm really not sure. It's really odd that that's even an issue, but I'll I'll look into it later. I don't think you're missing out on anything other than a, a colored name at this point. And obviously the, the early access video stuff, but there's no videos in early access at the moment. No, you don't need to buy me memberships. It's a subathon, but honestly, I was I was totally fine if I got zero subs. That was oh. I was totally okay with that. I know they're a lot of fun because people are are looking forward to long streams and granted I keep saying granted i like doing long streams because it means i get to have extended conversations and drift off topic a lot if i have like an hour to do a stream then i feel like every conversation i have is rushed and when the stream is 12 hours there's no fear of that yeah paladin i gave you myself the the gilded egg should have applied, but I guess it's not. Really odd. I yeah, I can't I can't manually give you the other rolls. So either the only thing I can think of at this current moment, and I'll look into it later, is disconnect and reconnect your disconnect and reconnect your YouTube from your Discord. And if that doesn't work then I guess I'll contact YouTube. I don't really know. Hmm. I bet you, because it was an upgrade, it's still registering as the basic tier. Like, like in their system. So while you do have Gilded tier, it recognizes that you have the basic tier. That's my guess. 
So theoretically, you actually do have Gilded, but it's only it's only cosmetically showing up as the basic tier. So I'm assuming at the end of the month, it will automatically switch if you still pay for the, the Gilded one. All right, let me eat some chili. I mean, I'm going to eat some chili. I set a keybind for this, right? He didn't bring me a napkin. I got tissues. That'll, that'll be fine. And the napkin from earlier, so okay. Probably be smelting something right now. What could be doing? Ah, I know what it could be doing. Grab all that and some more, and we'll have those smashing. Wonderful. Should we research or search? <clears throat> Let me see what it needs for the starter base. Maybe I can start working on this. How do I get score yet? I think I need soul sand for that. Soul sand. Okay. We're gonna need to take a trip to the nether soon then. Fortunately, I know where a patch of scoria is. That shouldn't be too hard. I was muted. I was saying I was going to make some chests and work on the, the ingredients. Labs. And we got burger. Uh, what was the other thing? That's pretty awesome. All right, cool. All right, I think I wanted to make sure nothing was not working. For those of you who enjoy chili, do you eat your chili with or without beans? I'm curious. I don't know. Let me let me actually read on my uh, on my end what it has you as. If it has you as a basic tier. Yeah, it does have you as a basic tier. Let me refresh the page. Okay, now it has you as gilded. Okay. Huh. That is that is very odd. Without it, you dislike beans. That's fair. I prefer chili without beans, but I like it with beans too. Yeah, so here it says you're gilded. Uh, most recent changes, members often rejoin, blah, 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 blah. 
Hmm. Maybe it just takes a little bit. I don't know why it would take time, but that could be the case. I'm not sure. I don't know if contacting YouTube is the is the next step. Because, uh... Yeah, there's... <laughs> that might be a disconnect from, from stream elements, not from... Or no, because it's through YouTube. But then, yeah, it would, it would not be stream elements. And I, I, I really don't know. With? Is it even chilly without? I can see it with and without. I like, uh... I like a lot of different types of chili. I like the more liquidy chilies, but then I also like the chunky chili. I think both of them are good. Yeah, give it a little bit. Maybe, uh, maybe give it like 24 hours and see if it fixes itself. I promise you're not losing anything in those 24 hours. The only thing that you're missing is member only live streams and in 24 hours i will not be doing another stream and not definitely not a member only one so for now yeah just just give it some time and hopefully that will fix i don't know why it would do that that's that's really odd I need to get a source of bone meal. What can we do for bone meal? Crushing bones, makes sense. Calcite. Not craft calcite, okay. I would rather use that for building. I don't know of any skeleton spawners nearby. In fact, I don't know of any skeleton spawners at all. Hmm. That looks like it's the only recipe, and I can't craft bones. I'm not sure. Is this from the same playlist? It is. Okay, cool. Dude, member on the stream. No, the normal tier, the normal tier, I don't believe, gets you that. You get member only live chats. So you can talk in member only mode. I can set my chat so that people with memberships can talk. That you can talk in. But streams that are exclusive to members, you can only get from the Gilded tier. I have yet to do one of those because there aren't very many people with that tier. But now that there's, I think, four or three, I'll probably end up doing one fairly soon. Those will probably be shorter and in the middle of the week. Just so that way it, it, it benefits those people. And the more people that get that tier, the more worth it will be. Maybe those will be longer. Because streaming to three people who might not even be there seems kind of, kind of not great. However, it does open up the VOD... I'm used to streaming to no people, so that's I'm no stranger to that. Um, which is totally fine. It's just like one really long video. But at that point, when people get the Gilded tier, they now have access to all of those extra bonus episodes, which will just be VODs from, from private streams. Oh, I don't know if that picked up. Excuse me. I could compost. Mm, I'm just save it. I'm gonna save it for now. What is the potato wire? I can cook those. Let's make one. 
I don't have sand, do I? No. What do I need for crushing wheels? For crushing wheels, I need these thingies. So I need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I need seven brass casings. Three, four. And then a bunch of andesite alloy. With the member stuff on Discord only updates every month. No, I don't think it updates every month because otherwise all the people who got the memberships would only get it at the start of the month. Unless you're, unless, I guess unless it's start, a month starting from when they first got it. That seems like a really not great system. But it's Discord, so who knows. Discord has its quirks. My guess is that it will probably be updated within 24 hours. Because that, that makes the most sense. I don't know why that wouldn't be the case. Okay. Crafters. Need two pieces of wood. One log. Need a single piece of st Oh, I already had stone. I had a wasted coal. That's fine. And then a bunch of endosite alloy. Which I have zinc for. And I can make zinc nuggets. And I can make endosite alloy. Look at that. So much alloy. Yeah, we'll have to wait and see. Not quite sure what their system is. I need mechanical crafters, electron tube. So I need one, two, three, five, six, seven electron tubes, which means I need seven rose quartz. That means I need seven these and then a crap ton of redstone. That much should be fine. Some extra. I have sandpaper, but it's not going to be enough. Only has eight durability. That's fine. Ah, oh, it's one off. That's mean. All right, we're going to go on a trip then. I cannot believe we've been going for six hours. It does not feel... I've been recording. Whoopsie-daisy. It does not feel like we've been going for six hours. That's crazy. Yeah, now I've got sand, so I can make sandpaper. And then I can turn on... Turn these into electron tubes. The nice thing about the automated crafters, too, is I can use any recipe on them. Meaning, once we get a certain amount of complexity with our structures, then we can basically automate everything. Because we don't have auto crafters like we do in vanilla Minecraft. So I will have to use the, the auto crafters here. Pancake is so good. I love that song. Let's do that. Electron tubes. I'm missing seven crafting tables. Actually, let's get rid of the larch. I don't like larch. Here we go. And boom. That's the wrong number. Psych. 
What am I missing? I need brass casings. I need one, two, three, four. That's what I was missing. Um, get four more of these. Oh, I don't think it works with large wood. First time I heard in Stronghold. <laughs> yeah, that was fun. There we go. 21 mechanical crafters. How can I do this with the utmost efficiency? Aw oh, man. I do that. Ah, it works. Three. Really? All right, I'll add some more. Need more water wheels. The Sombrebros. I love that, that bit. That was so good. I had a lot of fun with Crazen. Sugar cane. That was one of my favorite streams. That might that might have been my favorite stream. That was a ton of fun. I love dungeons and ex like exploring dungeon games. RPGs are very fun for me. So I, I enjoyed that quite a bit. Both from a aesthetic standpoint and from a player standpoint. That was a ton of fun. I was limited by time that day as I was going out right after stream. And so I had to make sure that I had enough time to do everything I wanted to do. So we were like trying to rush all the dungeons, which kind of sucked a little bit, but I think I'm going to try to play it slower next time I play with that mod. Because I, I did not see all the dungeons and I didn't really get a chance to properly explore it. Especially if I play it in a long term survival world on or off camera. Being able to build up to the level where I feel like I'm actually ready to take on those dungeons. Because obviously I can I can cheese the whole thing, just dig right to the end. No one is going to stop me. But I like playing through it. And I feel like sections of it, we kind of, we not cheated, but we, we cheesed it by blocking the fans or um, by going around certain sections. I didn't get to fully explore the castle at the end. Which, by the way... The castle is in this mod pack now. That's one of the new things I added. Um, so somewhere in this world, there's going to be a giant create mod castle I get to explore. Which I've already seen some of it, but I didn't get to explore the whole thing. I'm excited for that. And maybe I'll get some of those variations Crazen was talking about. What was I doing? Yeah, big, big water wheels. Okay, easy, easy. Okay. I'll just make, I'll make five. Ooh, I'll make, I'll make five. I'm assuming I can use these to craft. I'd hope so. That's five. Five again. Man.
do that. Possibly. Yeah, that could be fun. The only problem is that I have to set up a server for that. And then also moderating it. And there's there's so many things that I have to keep in mind. I'm not sure. That's that's one thing that I'm I'm worried about is having the time or the patience to be able to moderate something super uh, community oriented. I would love to do something like that. I just I don't know if I have the resources to. Because I need to I need to have a server for it. I need to make sure everybody's not ruining the experience. There's there's a whole bunch of factors. At some point, maybe I'll do a server, like a survival server, not one for making content on. But for now, yeah, practically. Depends on how many people are playing. If it was like five or six people, that wouldn't be terrible, especially if they were people I know would not break the rules, but then there's still the, the issue of, of setting it up and um, paying for the server and all that stuff. But at some point, I might do something like that. That does sound fun. Okay, what was the other thing? I need cobblestone. That's too loud, let me know. Okay. Cobblestone, my favorite block. There it is. Hmm. Sounds like the Sombra Bros theme song to me. I'm liking the song. Um, not a whole lot. I got a horse. I got chili. My brother brought me chili. What else did we do? We found a really big cave. I can't remember if you were here for that or not. Look at this. Let's fly over there. Right here. Found a massive cave. Might might have to do something here. Insane. Just, just massive. Um, yeah. I can't remember if you were here for that or not. Now I'm working on getting an auto crafter. So I gotta get a bunch of water. Uh oh. Yep, yep. We're good. Yeah. Other than that, I don't think so. I have. I have drank water. I should probably drink more though. Been a bit. Here's the horse. Mm-hmm. That's true. That's not a bad idea. This is Blueprint, yes. Oh my, that's right, you haven't been here for a while, while. Um, yeah, this is Blueprint. We did another poll, and of Coldcraft, MCCI, and um, Blueprint, Blueprint has won. We'll probably end up switching again in the next hour or something. The five hours... So while they're switching five hours, or sorry, not five hours. While they're switching, oh hello. While they're switch in an hour, or we'll keep playing this for a while longer, and then we'll switch over to that that special project I was talking about at the beginning of the stream. What else? Uh, I need water. That's what I came over here for. Do I have a spare bucket? I can't wait to start work on the next Blueprint episode. I'm so- I'm having so much fun with this series. I'm gonna get more. One, two, three, four. Okay, that should handle the stress for a bit. I love that my cat just pushes open the door. 
We just pause it open. So that is the membership goal. When we have a total... I mean, what specifically what that goal is? Or are you talking about just what is 40 memberships? Yeah, I think you're talking about what that goal is. Um, that is for 20 minutes, maybe longer. I haven't decided yet. 20 minutes just sounded doable to me. I'm going to put a poll in the chat with a bunch of different characters that I can do voices for. And I'm going to try and play the game in, in character. I was thinking about getting costumes, but I realized it was already like 2 in the morning when I decided that would be fun. And also I don't have costumes for all those people. So I thought I would just do the voices. Um, but I've got as options Peter Griffin, Lego Batman, King Julian, Carl Weezer, Professor Snape, Terminator, or Kermit the Frog. So you guys will, will vote if we get there and I'll, I'll do that character. I'll probably do it for longer than 20 minutes. That 20 minutes doesn't seem like that much. Considering it's already been six and a half hours, it's crazy. Golem, that's another one. I, I'm going to add that to the list, actually. That'll be another option on there. I was trying to remember all the, all the voices I can do, and I, I couldn't remember them all. <laughs> yeah, I have... Um, I have quite a few, quite a few voices I can do. I can, oh, ooh, these are almost done. Or someone. You ready? You're ready, right? Yeah. Age seven, I think, is when the uh, onions are ripe. This is done. That's nice because we were we were low on cabbage seeds anyway. Ta-da! Yeah, Kermit, that's that's only if we've reached the goal, though. There's no way I'm going to be able to endure... Sorry, Cow. No way I'm going to be able to endure that much voice acting. And that kind of defeats the purpose of it being a goal. But Kermit is an option. Well, you're done, too. Look at that, we've got... Okay, maybe not that much. I can make eight hamburgers. Wowee. Look at that. So cool. Love hamburger. Hamburgers. Bread, tomato, beef patty, onion. It's like a Mr. Crab burger. Or a Krabby Patty. Don't worry about it. I don't want anybody to have to spend money. Or I don't want to pressure anybody into spending money, I mean. It's an option, it's it's definitely not mandatory. Therese calls that the Lance verse. Column Lance, Lance Griffin, Frog Lance, Professor Severus Lance. Yep. Those are additions. Does every car- oh, that doesn't have water. Oh, that's right. Does every voice I do have to ha be part of the Lanceverse? I can take rid of this, but yeah. I can get rid of this one as well. And I can get rid of this one as well. Clean. Hehehe. <laughs> All right, cool. Nope, that one has to be there. Is it getting? Is it getting under? It's not. I'm losing put potential uh, potential velocity. That's what I'm missing. Uh oh. Where'd it go? There it is. There, that's better. 
Much better. That's faster. And it's got more stress. Thanks. Yay! Science. Relic is one of my favorites. Never heard Broken Shadows before. That must be from Legends or something. Yeah, Relic is, is one of the best. I I think Relic is my number one. I think it's Relic, then Other Side, then Stall. My combo. Stall was always going to be up there for me. And other, other Side is also quite good. Yeah, that would be weird. <laughs> Alright, have a wonderful night. Sleep well. Thank you for stopping by, Alex. Or Alexander, I should probably say your full name. I don't know if you go by Alex. But have a good night. Thank you for staying. <laughs> I mean, they're Greek. That was that was like a, a, a common thing, if I'm not mistaken. Can I run... Can I run this now? Man! I added five, and it's still not enough. What if I turn down the speed? 56 works. Yay. Okay. That was why I needed the, the light, the, the larch wood. Bye bye. It's gotta be mellow high relics install. That's a good. That's a good trio. Am a fan. Not a huge fan of mellow high, but it's not the worst. I've reserved that for eleven. Okay. We've got crushing wheels. How much? Still high stress. Hmm. What do I need? I'll try just the regular wheels and see if that's enough. I'm gonna need some lore for Void Lance. Suddenly. <laughs> Go for it. I was trying to figure out how to add your emojis too, Therese, and I, I need to I need to look harder into that because I couldn't find it before I started the stream. Let's see, can I quickly make a water wheel? I can make it smaller than it used to be because of the new update. I do this. And I do that. And then I do this. That works. And then I do that. And then I do this. And then I do... Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. And then I do that. I call that a big, big, big brain moment. Ta-da! Oh, 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 I need a trap or table, uh, uh, trap door. What about a scaffold, actually? Easy. I would rather have a trap door, honestly. I mean, so, um, I don't think that changed anything. Yeah, the YouTube emojis are pretty funny. I like those a lot. Uh, copycat panel. Cycle again. When right clicked.
Place them, click again to cycle the orientation or powered state. Oh, that works. This is pretty simple, Therese. All that's happening is I have a water source here and a water source here. So this is flowing this way, this is flowing this way, and they're both going down and to the side. That is spinning this water wheel, and that is spinning... When this spins, so does this shaft here. That shaft comes through on both sides, and I just added these crushing wheels, which are facing towards each other. So that way, when I throw something inside, it will start to crush it, and it will turn it into gravel. This is a pretty simple mechanism. Of the things that Create can do, this is, this is one of the simplest. We have three ways of saying rice. Huh. We've got one. <laughs> the thing that... The thing that... thing your sis said. Huh? I don't have a sister. Unless you're not talking to me, then I'm confused. Wait, did I miss him? I must have missed something. That doesn't make any sense to me. Okay. That back. Yeah, okay. Oh, okay, okay. Alright, what did I want to do with the... What, a crushing wheel? I forgot. I can crush calcite and crush bones. I guess we need to start working on the house. Scoria. So we need to go to the nether. And hopefully not die. We just have different variations of the word rice. We're not very unique over here. That part. Okay. That's a sign that you watch too much Minecraft. You know what? This will not stand. Will not tolerate one uh, staircases that I bump my head on. Okay. There's Scoria right there. I don't have to go very far. I might have to, I might have to get an achievement right now. We'll see. Do it. Do it. Fine, I'll turn my back. That's terrifying. This is also... Oh, yay. Come on. Attack me. I'm scared if I start reading chat, I'm just going to get bombarded. Okay. To be honest, never say that. I think you're eating raw rice. Thomas, touch grass. You need to touch touch grass and get sleep. Both of those are very important. This grass feels nice. Like, why wouldn't you want to touch grass? Especially on like a warm summer day. It sounds wonderful. Take pictures of grass. Shoot shoot a movie in grass. Outside is awesome. Yeah, we're still playing Blueprint. I feel like we haven't really done all that much because we've just done exploring. 
So I've been trying to do some actually productive things other than walk around. I've been grabbing scoria. We made a, a crushing wheel and uh, the big crafting machines. So now I can automate crafting if I really wanted to. That's true. Grass is, grass is it's the it's the type of grass you gotta get the you gotta find the right type. Do it. Want the achievement? Do it. Alright, fine. I didn't want to fight anyway. Mm. Those sounds are horrifying. Not sure if I'll need soul sand, but you know what? I'll take it. I always end up needing materials I don't think I'll use, so might as well. Wish I could have been there for exploring. It wasn't a. It was mostly. <laughs> excuse me. It was mostly just talking. We walked around and found some cool things. There was a really big cave. I think you were here for that. I can't remember. Um. But other than that. We found a horse. That was the main reason we went out. Enough work for the center. I've got some interiors done. Nice. <laughs> I'm glad to glad to have you. The Citadel, from last I saw, looks awesome. I'll do that just in case. Might as well start a protective barrier. Watch this guy blow it up. We good. Never fall again. Gone. Never. Never again. No more nether. <laughs> Speaking of grass, the song title fits perfectly. Uh oh. Alright, we're good. Another shot of the us. Oh, of the of the thingy. the Cynodel. Yes, that would be awesome. We're also working on the starter base materials. So I need cuts. Forty-five cut scoria. That's it. Okay. And I know I needed some smooth stone. 32. Oh, I needed more than I smelted. Oh, wait, more. Yeah, I need more. That's okay. More where that came from. I'm just going to finish this chili so I can put the bowl off to the side. I don't care if it's not homemade. Chili is so good. Food. Whoever made food, best invention ever. Yeah, look at we almost matched the horse. That's uh that was like the big thing. I wanted to get a horse and then I wanted to match with it. So we spent a while trying to find the perfect color combo. Nice. I've got a I've got a deck of solitaire cards, but I know that's not the same. But the the, the designs on them are quite cool. I have to I'll have to find those. Chili is quite good. Um, I know it's not for everybody, but it's it's basically meat. I think ours was turkey, but I think sometimes it's beef. A lot of people have beef chili. Um, and then 
yeah, beef. Some people put beans in it. There's often a variety of different vegetables, bell pepper, onion. Uh, sometimes people put chili in it, like actual chili peppers. We'll name the horse Cogsworth. How about that? After the robo, robo assistant from Fallout 4. And also Cogs wheels. Or cog wheels. This is Cogsworth. I think that's a good name. I don't have uh oh I do have a name tag. I don't want to rename the stone. Cogsworth. Chili is so good. Yeah, that's Cogsworth. I love horses. <laughs> Nico with meat is already good food. Agreed. No, I'm taking off the glasses. I don't need them right now. Wow. Feels weird not having glasses on. I can still see. Oh, are you kidding me? You know what? Nope, the glasses are going back on. My eyes have not yet adjusted. I can usually get away with taking them off if I'm stepping away because the distance of things I'm looking at have changed, but I've been looking at the same screen. Which, speaking of, I need to get my stand up in about two minutes. Um, the distance hasn't changed because I'm just looking at the same thing. I do have to stretch, yeah. My watch is going to remind me to do that in two minutes. All right, this is done. I can come over here. That. 32. A lot of Cogsworth. It's 30, 30, 32, right? It's 32 per step. Perfect. I can speak. Uh, Carved stripped oak. I need 102. Which actually, hold up. 64 plus 38. 64. 38. So many logs. Okay. Now to turn these all into the whatever the other variant was called. That's all of them. <laughs> My axe is going to run out of durability before I get mending on it. That's okay. I did a lot of diamond mining, so I'm, I'm not short on diamonds anymore. Twelve, twelve and twelve blocks and six. I can just craft another one. dark oak. We turn that into carved strip dark oak. I need a woodworker's bench or something.
carpenter's table. Um, three logs. Crafting table. One, one individual blank. And then a piece of iron. Want to draw a lot, but I gotta memorize the law and preambles. I don't, I don't even want to be there. That sucks. For a while, I wanted to be a lawyer, but I decided, never mind, that requires brain power that I do not have. Have to be a stripped fairy? No? Oh, I didn't make the axe. You know what? I use those three extra planks to make the axe. I gotta go bam. Boom, bop, boop, bah. No. Won't let me use this wood. That's mean. Let me use the wood. It lets me use the planks, though, which is weird. Carpenter's table. Yep, that's right. Okay, the newest outside view of the Citadel has been posted. Awesome, I'll take a look at that momentarily. Let's see. Oh, that looks so good. That's gonna look so cool in the world. I love those interiors too. The pipes going everywhere are really cool. That looks awesome. I am definitely getting tired. We've got six hours to go. We're not even halfway there yet. Uh, this That's what I wanted. I love this new UI. It looks so good. Carved. I think this is what we're looking for. Yes. Carved strip dark oak, 102, perfect. That fish and I decided added some. I think did it auto. I think it automatically corrected catfish or crazy into catfish. New crazy variant unlocked. Yeah, the windmills are cool. I like that. Reinforced strip lock. Ah, didn't look very far ahead. 58. Oh, and I don't even have enough. Okay, I gotta go find some more. Description, tell your other solutions that you just carried time. Oh, Lance has the card. <laughs> yeah, I uh, I didn't know that either. It's news to me. All right, let's go to the dark oak forest. At least it's I know where that one is. You can probably tell. If you were here the whole time, my energy has dropped significantly. I can only stream for so long without getting tired, and I've hit the I've hit the point in the day where I want to take a nap. I'm not going to. I gotta I gotta go all the way through, but definitely definitely feeling it. Oh, okay. Ah, all right. I thought it was just a, a typo for Crazen. Because you, you talked about building with Crazen earlier. And here's that cave I was mining in when I was sick. Hello, Dark Oak Forest. Does that make you less tired? I didn't get my stand up. Hmm. 
That's independent. Okay. Ooh. Turn around just in case creepers are coming. I gotta get to stand up. Catfish creation. There's a crazy verse. If only, if only that's who he was talking about. My cat has escorted himself from now. So I'm the only person in this house. I can say whatever I want. Barnacles. Ooh, walking around feels nice. My legs have been tired since weightlifting. They did a bunch of leg workouts. I'm back. Let's do this. Tree chopping time. I love this tree chopping mod. HT's tree chop is so nice. Beautiful. Uh, I'm not going to take the dark oak. I don't need that. Turn these into blanks. But we're good. Walking, yeah. I mean, if you like walking, then maybe you, you enjoy it, but... I don't know many people who enjoy walking up hills. <laughs> of all the things I could have said... That's probably the most inappropriate thing I could have possibly said. My parents would have been so mad if they heard me use Spongebob talk in the house. <laughs> Hi, Naifu! It's a chicken. I was, so, I was so confused what that was. You've joined at just the right time. I'm exhausted. <laughs> We've got six hours and 18 minutes left to go. Beep. I'm always conscious of powdered snow. Excuse me, what? what? Oh, okay. I just made a cobblestone. I can't tell if you're running up a hill, Dipper. Or if you're just laughing so hard you're wheezing. So you're like... <laughs> Can't laugh out loud because everyone's sleeping. <laughs> I'll try to be less... I'll try to be less funny, but... No promises. I'm just a silly little guy. It's in my nature. Alright, what was the other thing I needed? 58? Steampunk lands head cannon. He doesn't understand how chickens... I couldn't see because the horse was in the way. It took me a second because I didn't recognize it doing the animation. 54, okay. Was it 54 or 58? It's 54. Don't forget to stretch your hands. That's a lot of gaming. That's very fair. Should crack all my knuckles. All, all two of them. Thank you for that. You're finally awake. I didn't stretch my hands, though. You're right. That was the one thing I didn't stretch. I stretched my teeth. I stretched all of my limbs. I stretched my eyeballs. I stretched... Uh, stretched my hair. Yeah, that's, that's something else that makes total sense. Yep. I've got a creeper plushie in the background. Ash is online again. Hello, Ash again. And everything? That's everything. Don't forget your brain. Oh yeah, I stretched my brain. I forgot about that one. I did that. Uh, I did that when working on the revolutions, uh, the building thing. Who's Ash? 
Ashes is one of my good friends. He's a great builder. Ashes Den. I played with him in uh, Tall World. I don't know why you're typing in caps. Calm down. No need for yelling here. What? 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 54 reinforced strip dark oak log. Reinforced. 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 Ta da! Should make a barn. Perhaps. I think I'll make a barn for Cogsworth over here, but uh, I'm getting resources for my house first. Because I, I need a place to put stuff. Because this is not cutting it. I'll make a storage barn. My house that I'm about to build has like no storage too, which is the most ironic part. All of the resources that are going into the house is where I'm storing it. <laughs> the world may never know. Uh, at the same time, he kind of still needs to know if a lot of peeps are going to buy the plushie. I mean, that plushie I probably got from Target or something. Wait, hold on. Once Lance... Oh, I didn't read the first comment. Once Lance has sufficient subscriber count, you should make a... Work with a makeshift to bring out... Maybe... That could be cool. I can't do that yet. You've been here for five minutes. Calm down, nephew. What's next? What's next? What's next? Pistons. Uh, man. 27 pistons, which means I need 27 pieces of redstone. 27 of those. 27 of those. Perfect. And then log. What's that for? That was that was just to put in here, right? Funny stream man, do the funny. Do the do the funny. Get the roar. Twelve you've been here twelve hours minus whatever the timer says. You've been here approximately seven hours. Seven hours and four minutes. Seven hours and five minutes. Are we lagging? There's Therese lagging. What if the Endager has an Endager verse as well? The Enderverse? Sure. The Endager is kind of your creation since you you built the creature. So if you want it, if you want there to be an Enderverse, you can do that. Hope I can use large logs for this. How am I already out of dark oak? Uh, pistons, that's right. 26 and 27. There we go. Reinforced scoria. 26 item shelves. Can do. I say that like I didn't make the blueprint. The 26? I have such a bad memory. 26. Item shelves. Not that one. This one. 26. So I need... 3 for 2. So I need... That's too much... Too much thinking. Oh, there's my other logs. Okay, take your time to Reese. Oh, that was pretty close. 26. Alright. 
week. The windmill on the top left of the Citadel is held up by a very questionable construction. I am talking breaking the laws of physics. Breaking the laws of physics levels of questionable. I didn't even know this. Yep, no, that is that is definitely breaking the laws of physics. In no way does that make any sense whatsoever. That is impressively uh impressively law breaking. I keep forgetting every few seconds what I'm supposed to be doing. And strip strips log, I need 25. And of course I need it stripped. I think that's what I, I first read that too, when I first saw that name. Oh, my crops are already sweet. People back already? Hold on. Maybe. Perhaps. Oh, that's a rope. Yeah, that. That makes sense. <laughs> there we go. Piston... 25 tops. Twenty-five layered tough. Named as he doesn't even have anything. I thought not. Uh, it's in it's in Treus's, um it's in Doctor Treoris's share your content page. Guys, it wasn't that it was Treos the entire time. What are you doing, sir? What are you? What do you? Who do you think you are? What do you? What do you think you're doing? delay you might refresh the page that might help you guys are responding to things that I like you're like giving me responses like facts and okay and I have no idea what you're talking about because my memory is so short I have no idea yeah this is I think from um, the new Minecraft game what is it legends not new at this point but yeah I'm confusing watchers of Dantidium series since I made my Minecraft account. Hmm. Hello everyone, Dan here from the Diamond Minecart. Welcome back to another video where today we are playing Blueprint. Wait, was it Spruce? I think it was Spruce. Yes, 21 Spruce. Just planks, awesome. Oh, they give you six? Oh, that's awesome. Okay. Now, finish the first scrolls worth of items. 21 stacked oak planks. 21, that should be 24, 21 stacked oaked points. There we go. Lance TDM. I mean, I was Lan Rocket Lance the Emerald Minecart way back when. Windmills are in this. Yeah, it's fine. It's Minecraft. Oh, it's cool. It saved my my scroll. Sweet. 19 strip spruce wood. Yeah, that's expensive. I gotta go find spruce trees. Cogsworth to the rescue. Let's go. Yeah, my memory's not great. 
for multiple reasons. ADHD and probably, uh, probably am EP and needy to sleepy. But I've got six hours left to, to stream, so I'm gonna be a while. I was up too late trying to figure out what the rewards for the for the sub goals were, and so I I was up way too late trying to figure out because originally I was gonna go up to a hundred, just in case. I didn't think it was. Oh yeah, here this is this is super cool. Yeah, originally I was gonna go up to a hundred just just in case, and I thought a hundred sounds like a good number to stop at, but I'm now realizing there's no reason I should ever need that high. Like high ahead. Steam denied your request? That's fine. Spend that money on satisfactory. Rain doesn't remember stuff, doesn't really... Yep, pretty much. I'll be doing something and then seconds later forget it. Village attack. I'll forget it like moments after I've started doing it. Like I'll... You, you watched me, I was like... All right, I need 21 oak logs, and then I close the inventory. How many oak logs did I need? That's how bad my memory is. It's absurdly terrible. I don't really think there's a, a fix for that. I just have to hope I memorize it. I have this weird thing, too, where I'll be doing something, and then I'll forget about it, and then start doing something else, but my brain remembers I'm forgetting something, so I feel off, like there's something I'm forgetting, but I can't put my finger on what. I have it, my PC cannot run, that's why I'm trying to sell it. Well, I, again, you can, you can save it until your PC can run it. Get it on sale instead of at full price later. There's really no downside to it. I mess up doing stuff without knowing what I'm doing. Yeah, sometimes I do that too. I'll just start walking around. Welcome back, Therese. Checking your time on your phone, putting it back. I am guilty of that so often. Sometimes I'll just check my watch for no reason to. Usually in a social setting, I just like, I don't have anything to do. I'll just check my watch for fun. But then I'll forget, and then somebody will ask me, and then I'm like, oh yeah, let me check. And then like, you just looked at your watch, and I'm like, yeah, I didn't, I forgot. <laughs> Which sounds like just the most baloney sentence ever, but it's it's legitimately true. I, I have such a bad memory. You'll ask, this is why if uh, somebody's like, did you notice my haircut? I'm like, no, I don't notice, I don't notice anything. My, my mind is so lost, and it's its own mind. Oh yeah, you missed the you missed the Dan TDM impression I did. Lance the the emerald minecart. I forgot to read the time. Currently six fifteen. I mean, I wasn't looking for the time. I was just glancing at my my watch for the bit. As he. Need to make a proper pathway up here. Welcome back, Ash. Long time no see. I mean, a lost mine is something I can very much relate to. Yeah. That's the neurodivergent in us. Oops, sorry, horse. Oops, sorry, horse. I take good care of my animals. No. Oh. <gasps> oh! That was close. I need to patch that up. I wish I could see how much health it had. I wonder if I can turn off wakes, if that will help. I 
I'll have to... I'll have to try later. I'll just turn it off next time I reboot the mod pack. Because Wakes is having a glitch where I can see them through the water, or through the ground, and I don't know how to fix it. There's no updates for it. Not a clue. Village attack? Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm enjoying it. I don't think I've ever listened to this soundtrack. Okay. Onions go in the third row. Then we got cabbage. My cabbages! There's probably too many seeds. Yeah, that's fine. And then onions. We me. Perfect. Cabbage. Oh, that's warm out. 72. That's probably wrong. My watch is never accurate, but still. I feel like I need shorts. Don't litter. I don't need cabbage seeds anymore. New ropes have the tomatoes grow two bucks tall, the leftover seed. You could always make a few ropes and have the tomatoes grow two blocks tall. You can do that? Well, too late now. How do I make a rope? Forget. That's right. The song is awesome. Let's see. Like this? Make a few ropes and have the tomatoes grow two blocks tall with the leftover seeds. I'm not quite sure what you mean, Trace. Place the Farmer's Delight ropes over the tomatoes. Okay. I swear I have one right here. There it is. Oh my gosh, that's a thing. What? I do need the roof though, okay. That's cool. Why is it not working? Oh well. That's so neat. I didn't know that was a thing. Phew. Well, thank you for letting me know. That's sick. Alright, I got lots of wood now. Never running out again until later. Eighteen lecterns. That's gonna be expensive. If only I had some source leather. They're tough, we got that. Stacked planks. 19 strip spruce loop. Boom. Sometimes it takes a few tries. Okay. Might work the other rogues. Takes a minute to grow. Okay. Next time I'll, I'll try that then. 
I'll make I really like that for like as a design thing. I wonder if it would grow in the first layer too, because it would look better if it was on both. I like that you can walk through it as well. Nineteen, perfect. Fourteen, cut deep slate. I do think I need the deep, yeah, this variant. Oh, I was wrong. Fourteen cut deep slip. Yay, that's awesome. Okay, that'll make for a great decorative acid. I'm gonna use that. Spruce seat, sixteen spruce seat. Weird looking pumpkin. Very tired. But I am strong. I can push through this difficult task. Those are gates. Those are fences. So how many did I need? 21. 16. Welcome back, Ash, again. Um, labs. There we go. Bruce points 14. Here we go. Less than six hours, you can do it more than half the time. I can do it. I've been here longer than because we had the, the 10 minutes and then also the, the 20 minutes I was paused too. But we've been here for seven and a half hours. See, once we hit the four hour mark, we'll switch to we'll switch to the, the, the big project, the one that I haven't spoken about yet. That's gonna be a whole lot of fun. Oh, fun fact, you can do this. Pretty cool. Bellows, 12 bellows. Oh, these are expensive. Why did I choose these for pillars? Oh, it's not that bad. Okay. Where's my leather? There it is. Oh, it's slabs. I do like NF, yes. Fancy. Hmm. Well, right, I think. Yay, I remembered a number! 12 jungle logs. I don't have jungle logs. Here for the big project, it's already 2 a.m. Yeah. That's one thing I, I am kind of sad about is the fact that 11 a.m. works really well for me, but for a ton of people it doesn't. Like I was saying, it'll be 11 PDT, and there are people saying, yeah, that's like right when I, that's 1 in the morning. I was like, well, that sucks. We're going for a long trek. All the way over there. Not too bad. I'll just cut around to the, to the right. Wow. Here. 
You can tell I'm tired if I start making car noises when riding a horse. The stream was 19. Quick convenient. Well, that's good. I'm glad it wasn't all inconvenient. Everybody's all over the place with my, my community. Welcome back again, Ash. I wonder what he's working on. He keeps closing and reopening the game. <sighs> back to the dark oak forest. Seven PM. Yeah, it's just nineteen minus uh minus seven. Or so not nineteen, it's nineteen minus twelve. Don't go wood. We have returned once again. Oh, I guess my armor hides when I take damage. Not the kind of music I was hoping. Is this all I've got? There we go. This is a ambient track, so it's quite long. Um. Eh. Kind of creepy. All right. Well, whatever. I guess I can't control the fact if it shows or not. Oh, uh -huh. That's true. That was one thing I was, I was aware of. I just know that it won't be always available for every person. Cool. Sorry, horse. You back where I had you before was all the way up top. You should make a pancake for the jukebox. I think I'll do that. Maybe I'd do that in a video. I'm not sure. I have to go make pancakes. I forget how to make this. Is it flax? Missing wheat and some. Wheat and egg and sugar and milk. That makes sense. I left my bed. Oh, I'm dead. I was way too confident about- Are you kidding me?! My knife is gone. There it is. There we go. A little bit. Just a bit. Thank you. Alright, we're fine. I can't go to sleep, can I? No, we're good. Alright. Let's go walk back. Number... Two. Oh, I have died twice. Okay. I'm not too sad then. I thought that was the first time I had died. What should I take? I'll drink this potion of regen. At least I went to bed after. Fucking a you dibber. 
I'm not even gonna bring tools, that's how confident I am. I thought I had my water bucket on my hotbar, so I was prepared to water bucket clutch, but I had nothing, and there were leaves below me anyway. So, even if I did have it, I, uh, I probably wouldn't have survived. I was, I was like one block away too from, from surviving that. It was a very slim place. Yeah, there's a difference between being in bed and being asleep. It's 6.30 in the afternoon for me. You can't, you can't try to, you can't try to do that. Nice try. Yeah, if I had, um, if I had my horse, it would be a, a little bit faster, but, uh, at least I didn't jump off with the horse and then kill the horse. I would have survived, but I'm glad it was me and not the horse, because the horse doesn't respawn. <laughs> As Count Dooku once said, twice the pride, double the fall. I'm proud I haven't died for... It, it, I hadn't died in like four real life days. Like, uh, what is that? 48... Uh, 96 hours? I hadn't died in 96 in-game hours, which is very, very good. I mean, I haven't exactly been playing it safe. I could have made a di diamond armor long ago. 8 p.m. Uh, yeah, but you said you were you said you were sleepy and falling asleep. It's two hours earlier for me. And by, <laughs> by the time that you've been going to bed, this should be your bedtime. At least you don't have school. I guess you're homeschooled anyway. Hmm. Welcome back, Ash. That's the second time we've been right here and he's gone online. Count Dooku. Kill him. Kill him now. Cute. And then bright side, this food source glows. I can see in the dark oak forest. I don't know how that's a dark or a bright side. I just realized my stuff's also just going to be everywhere. What pings me every time he opens up the game and has essential installed. So technically, yeah, he can see where I am, but I can also see where he is. Ash and I are good friends. He can know where I am. Plus, it's, you know, live on YouTube. It's not exactly a secret. Thank you. Do it. Do it now. That's a fun, fun character to impersonate. Have you seen the video where somebody edited Palpatine uh, shooting the lightning at... Oh, uh, not Obi-Wan. At, uh... At Yoda, and he's like, ka chow! He's like, ka chow, wow. Oh, I'm in Star Wars, wow. I'm a talking car. Wow. Oh, it just drops, that's cool, I didn't know it did that. Wow. Chow. I don't know where all my stuff is. There's my water bucket. There goes all my levels. Mumbo moment. Actually, it's probably closer to a scar moment. That's a great video. If I find it, I'll I'll put it on um, put it in in general or off topic. As a fantastic video. Okay. There we go. Ooh. Now, we came here for jungle wood. Oh my gosh, my helmet is so far away. I need to go on land too. And uh, make sure I haven't forgotten anything.
Yep, I got it all. We're good. Those are those are two good ones. The search is is one I've listened to a few quite a few times. Um, change is another one I like a lot. I like those kind of rap songs. They're very fast paced, but they're also just like very passionate. Oh, a cave to explore. I like when artists talk about, specifically musical artists, talk about um, their lives and they incorporate it. They don't just say words, they actually tell stories. And I feel like he does that well. Those were like the two I started out with. I don't listen to NF very much, but those two songs specifically I have in playlists, so I hear those frequently. Or at least more than the others. I have so many different varieties of music that I listen to, though. Okay. Um. Hmm. Here's and I had so many callback moments to the Stronghold stream. <laughs> That's awesome. Swamp. Swamp. And more andesite. That's a good one. I'm just looking for change. It's by no means my favorite song. I love the particles. So cool. It's not by no means my favorite song, but it's uh it's one I enjoy. Okay. We got the goods. Time to evacuate. Huzzah. Yep. Pretty much. I'm not a big fan of hard rock. We're not. I guess I, I guess I don't really know what I would define as hard rock. I'm not a huge fan of metal. There are, there are obviously some exceptions, but mostly my tastes drift toward at least right now uh, very funky music. Um, big band is another one. I like um, ambient for working or for sleeping. That's a good. Those are good genres. Um, but yeah, typically very funky music is what I've been leaning towards recently. Like pep pep band, specifically. March fourth, marching band. Uh, gospel is a really nice one. I heard it in a meme, and I was like, man, that slaps. I'm adding it to my playlist. I'm not forgetting about the horse, by the way. I'm coming back for it. Hogsworth will not be left alone. Nightwish is pretty good. I will check that out. I'm not going to make this same, the same mistake I did last time and, and listen to it on stream, though. If I was on Twitch, I could probably get away with it, but YouTube is a little bit more strict with that stuff. Gosh, I need to walk, watch where I'm writing. Yeah, I've got I've got playlists for pretty much every mood I can think of. Very very specific moods too. Like uh, there are some playlists in there that just have like two songs, and it's just like they evoke this very specific feeling, and I'm like I want to listen to that right now. Typically, it's hard to find music that so perfectly fits that very specific atmosphere, but I always have those two to come back to. <laughs> yeah. Let's go down. I, I start to re I've been starting to regret not going to band because I've been watching um I've been watching those the videos of bands doing like marching stuff and it looks just like so much fun. Sorry, horse. <laughs> no. Fortunately, the horse is okay. 
No horses were harmed in the filming of the stream. Wish I could put uh, leather boots on this horse. at your destination. Take the next left. Oops. Hey, right, the horse wheel. You're fine, right? You're fine? You're good? Okay, he's good. Bro is okay. You know what? I kind of like these flowers. I'm gonna keep it. Just just one though, or two. I know where to get more. I gotta stop listening. To two big scenes. Two big scenes. I haven't listened to this this album. Yeah, change is good. I like that one. I'm gonna add this stuff to my my playlist. Twelve, all that for twelve logs. Oh wait, I needed that 19. I forget what for, but I know I needed it. And I'm gonna need to get a new X soon too. Opening cinematic is really good. We've got a while it looks like before we get there. Yep, we got a we got a long while. Okay, what are we looking for? I forget already. I know what it looks like. I forgot what it's called. Layered, and then we need eleven andesite wall. Andesite wall. And a site wall. And a site wall. Layered. There we go. That's fair. I don't really resonate with any of the lyrics in songs. Why am I going to controls? Um, I mostly like the way the music makes me feel. Just with the beats, because sound is such an important thing to me. Like, good bass, good drums, good rhythm, that kind of stuff. That last, I last, I latch onto that. That's good. Yeah, I'll go back through cinematic. There we go. Okay, jungle, we need 11 regular stripped ones. Maybe I didn't need... Slug. I thought I was saying the Arch Elder one. There's a while before we get there. Yeah. Ten Larch Wood. Ten and a sight ladder. How do you make that? Oh, that's not good. Just five and a sight alloy. 
My neck is broken. What? Am I blind? It's right there. I am blind. Yeah, yeah. It was 10 large, right? And 10, 10 polish cut. Sleep. And vertical framed glass. Vertical framed glass. Framed glass. Glass. Oh, and on an adventure. Let's go, horse. Where are we going? Oh, we can go here. Oh, Loud car. Got the three point. Where, where go? Where go sand? Sand go, sand go here? Sand go... We try, we try here. Blue, blue. We go blue. Blue. We go! Huzzah! I liked the opening cinematic quite a bit. It reminded me of Zelda. More crop? More crop. Me make, uh, me make more rope. Me get knife. Huzzah. Yeah, I like it. I am enjoying this music so far, from the two tracks I have listened to. Which is not many, but still good. That's probably fine. I am in. I am so tired, Trazen. Please send help. <laughs> I've been making car noises. <laughs> yeah, I'm. What are we at now? Almost eight hours. I think I have. I have surpassed my my last longest stream. So tired. <laughs> Uh, my watch is telling me it's time to stand, too. Don't you know I'm tired? I can't do that right now. Maybe that'll wake me up a little bit. How are you, Crazen? I heard you got some, uh, some interiors done. Looked quite cool. Perfect. Even. Oh my gosh, Spider's here, too. Hi, Spider! Current, yeah, I was, <laughs> I was going around chopping straw, and I was like, <laughs> yeah. I stayed up to try and figure out what I was gonna do for the stream, like the sub goals and stuff, and I was up way later, way later than I thought I was going to be, and so I am, I'm quite tired. Yeah, I was making, I was making car noises while riding a, a, a horse as well. <laughs> Okay, let's let's break these. What I need to do is I need to get a bunch of uh hold on, let me get my stand up. This is gonna this is gonna give me a ton of energy. You just wait. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna we're gonna first we're gonna get some bone meal, you see. Get some bone meal. And then we're gonna bone meal the tomatoes. And then we're gonna get a bunch of seeds. And then we're gonna put the rope on the tomato. And then we're gonna grow a ton of tomato. You see, this is this is big brain thinking. We're gonna get so many hamburgers, it's gonna be awesome. I'm doing this these motions so my watch will recognize that I'm I'm not sitting anymore. I guess I could do really good. Nothing yet. Raisin! Thank you, buddy. Oh, 
Oh, I gotta add the, the time to the timer because the thing doesn't do it. Did even play a sound? Oh no. I thought I had that all figured out. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Crazy. Welcome aboard. It should automatically give you the tier in the... Uh... Oh, here it goes. Yay! <laughs> Dude, look at that. It should automatically give you the... The thingy, what's it? Uh, the rank in Discord. Oh, what's up, Icy? How's it going, bud? You rule out the tomato world. Yes. No one is going to... To jeopardize my tomato growing prowess. I'm just, I'm just too good at growing tomatoes. Let's see, can I grow tomato? Can, does this work? I need, can't grow tomato. This is very sad. You don't have to get the membership. <laughs> Save your money. Bone meal. Where, where get bone? Bone? Oh, that's right. I can do this now. If I can get calcite, I know where calcite is. I'm just going to go steal some calcite from a very specific location. Let's see. Well, we got five and a half hours. So in, in about one and a half hours, we're going to start that that secret project. And it's going to be the most amazing thing ever. And you guys who have been here. Oh, hello. More? Really? Okay. You guys who are here have been here for the very beginning will will be very glad that you stayed. Or I guess whoever's there when it happens will be very happy. Had an entire greenhouse specifically for tomatoes. I'm so impressed. That's awesome. Tomatoes for life. Is that all calcite? It's snow. That's a different sound. Okay. Oh, it's Instamine too. I love that. Okay. So I... How much bone meal does this give me? A 75% chance of one. Seems better than nothing. Where can I steal it from? I don't want to ruin the terrain, so I'm like looking for spots that won't miss it. Sure, right here. There we go. That's probably enough bone meal, right? Entire greenhouse for every farmer's delight plant in the world. Yeah, I need to do that. That's something I've been... It's on my to-do list for farmers. Um, but yeah, I need to add Crazen's time. Fortunately, it hasn't been too busy, so even though it's not doing it automatically, it hasn't been too much of a hassle because there isn't enough at a consistent rate where it's not. It's just because I have to do it manually and reset the timer each time. Let me do this. Pause. Zero, zero, five, two, four... Save. Hey. Ta-da! Um, selling Satisfactory and Symmetica would like to buy when we can get them to get them. <laughs> Icy says you're crushing- Please stop selling your games in my chat rooms. <laughs> Icy says you're crushing it. Thank your love the thumbnails for your snapshot. Thank you. I appreciate that. Not to I know what it's for. Just, you don't need to do that. I appreciate that, Icy. I've been learning Minimator, and I've been using it more and more, and it's just it's just been so much fun. Getting getting used to the program has not even been that difficult, and it was completely free. Wow, that was a voice crack. It's completely free. Um, but I think the coolest part is building the poses and like trying to imagine in your head what what the character should look like and then trying to make that he can he can be here or they, they can be here whatever they they feel like they don't have to leave they don't have to stay it's up to them victorian green Ooh, victorian is nice 
10 with anything oxidized copper, warped wood, and green glass. That is nice. I like that. I like the Victorian style. Thank you, horse, for your services. Now we crush rock. Huzzah! Look at that. We're going to be here a while. Maybe I should grab some pistachios. It sounds yummy. It scares me too. You get used to it. Isn't it? It's so gorgeous. Oh, it's so nice. The terrain, the, this entire seed has just been gorgeous. I really want to do something over here yet, but I haven't decided. In fact, I'm kind of regretting not starting in this section because I've discovered right underneath it is this massive cave. Just absolutely giant. I could have made my mine here. That would have been so much better. You know what? Maybe I maybe I do. Hmm. I could have a town here and a town here. How far down does that go? So if this if this so theoretically, yeah, I could. Okay, here's an idea. This is this is my idea. So what if that spot where I am right now, that's like my base, my regular town. I already had plans for it, that's fine. Then I can build over here. I'll get I'll tear down all these trees and then dig a big hole right in the middle, and this will be this will be the quarry area. That would mean I get rid of this quarry. Because this is a nice spot too, but this is way bigger. And if I tear a really big hole right here... And just, just like get rid of all the trees and where the trees were, put a giant hole. And then that just goes straight down and I can have another elevator. Oh, this isn't even hollow. I would have to... Oh, that would be so much. I would need like a ton of TNT. Or I could hand mine it all. Yeah. This cave is this cave is wild. It's not even generating the whole thing. I'm I'm too far away. But this cave is just crazy. Loving this. This is a cave where we keep the Batgar and and Robin. <laughs> I will look at the screenshot. I make you sad. I'm sorry to disappoint you. Let's see. Three hills. Ooh, I love that. Oh, those colors work so well. I love the curves, too. That's very nice. The warped in the the, the warped wart on the floor looks really good. That's really neat. I like that a lot. Okay. Five hours left. Yep. Five hours, 20 minutes left. So close. Only an hour past halfway. Why are there so many? This is the third one we've seen in like the last half an hour. Yeah, I, I can imagine that the uh, roof looks really good. If I just leave them alone, they'll walk right past me and there will be no issues. They're not even going to know I'm here. Except for when they fall into this hole and then get stuck there. Oh great, they're coming this way. Where are you going? Where where are you going? You better have stayed for something good. Uh Oh yeah, it's so close. Woohoo! Only five, almost five and a half hours. <laughs> Once we hit the four hour mark, 
then that's when we'll start. I think that'll be enough time to do the project, so... That's probably when we'll do it. Raisin, I think you're gonna you're gonna like what I have in mind. Burger. Wait, I already chopped burger. Burger in here. Oh, those are already cooked. Onion, tomato, beef patty. What am I missing? Uh, lettuce. Tomato. Next stream, twenty-four hours lands. Oh no. I don't I don't know about that. Just barbecue on the stick. A hamburger. I don't know if I could do twenty-four hours. Not without an absurd amount of caffeine. No, caffeine doesn't work for me. Caffeine does the opposite effect. It acts as a a de a press a de is it a stimulant? It does like the opposite effect for ADHD people. So for me it would do the, it would not make me it would just make me more tired. That's what my medication does. ADHD brains are weird. You better give me a description of the project. Physically, and stay for it. That's okay. Um, I don't want to spoil. <gasps> I don't want to spoil it yet, so I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say. But it is. Um, it's quite cool. That's that's totally fine. I don't know, cause I don't want to spoil it yet. Cause that's kind of the. Do I dare? Okay, fine. What we are going to be doing is at the four hour mark, I'm going to stop the game and we are going to work together as as a group of writers and write a skit. And then we're going to film the skit and I'm going to post the skit on the channel after we're done. So I'm going to write with you guys a story and then we're going to I'm going to film it and then I'm going to edit it on camera and then we're going to we're going to release it on the channel. Oh. <laughs> Too late. <laughs> That's fine. I don't think it's that big of a spoiler. I mean, it's... It, I, now you know what you'd be sticking around for, I guess. But that, that's the plan. We're going we're gonna to write a story and then we're going to edit it and publish it on the channel. That was the idea. I came up with that last night. I almost made it the 100 tier, 100 subscriber tier, and I thought, no, I think it'd be cooler just do that regardless. Same effect from caffeine from autism. Yeah. I don't know what it is about caffeine. Caffeine's weird for us. Sometimes case wakes you up, sometimes puts me to sleep. I also just don't like coffee, so a lot of caffeine beverages I just don't enjoy drinking anyway. Covered your ears don't work. <laughs> okay. Sure. I'll have to re-explain it anyway. Uh, masterpiece similar to- Yes! That's a great one. We're not gonna- I don't have balls to, to roll around with because it's Minecraft, but I'll, I'll do like the block or something instead. That's such an obscure reference, too. <laughs> that was my first ever live-action skit. It's called The Balls, and it was about sentient... Um, sentient rubber balls that attacked me. Really weird. <laughs> I don't know what prompted me to come up with that idea. Can I make more burger? I want more burger. Give me a rope. It does look like just automatically grows, which is nice. I can just do that. Need to bone meal, I'm assuming. Oh, I used all my bone meal, didn't I? I think so, maybe, I don't know. I got more of this, I gotta just use that. Yeah. It was, um, I made that, that skit like 12 years ago, or maybe not 12, maybe eight years ago. Terrible dirt water trash. Wow, what a fitting name. I don't know. <gasps> oh, it's close. I almost trampled that crop. That would have been terrible. I don't... I don't... I like frappuccinos. Frappuccinos are okay. But straight up coffee? I can't get used to that. That's not something I particularly enjoy. It'll probably be something 
like a villager goes on a spy mission or something and I don't know it won't be terribly long I want it to be fairly short Because I'm already losing brain cells, having been live for eight hours. <laughs> I can't be up for too much longer doing that. Wow, those grew fast. Okay. This, I thought that was going to be much slower. Bro! There we go. Only reason I know that skill exists is because it was mentioned during the Stronghold stream. Yep. Yeah, that was a uh, that was a banger skit. That was that was my introduction. Well, technically that wasn't my introduction to filmmaking, but that was a uh, that was the start of when I really got into filmmaking. So you can thank that skit for being why I still do YouTube. It gave me an entry point. Prior to that, I had only one, uh, one film in my my filmography. I think that's the right word, and that was uh, the boy who lost his shoes. Very old. That one was made before I even moved moved to Washington. So it's been. Oh, what was it? I want to say. Let's see, actually, I'm curious. Oh, new green episode. Nice. I will watch that tomorrow. That was made 12 years ago. But then when was my channel made? My channel was made in 2013. Why did I check my watch for the year? <laughs> 11 years ago. Thank you, the balls. Yes. Go to sleep. I keep telling you to go to bed. I forgot what I was doing again. This goes, this goes in here. Um, ah, yes, resources house. Hi, Lenny, welcome back. Vertical frame glass. That's what I was going after. I went for I went for glass and then didn't. Forgot why. Now we're going for glass. We're gonna go. Yeah, this way. Sure, why not? I mean, they're here, so I'd, I'd assume they're up. Oh, that's right, we have the trail ruin to explore, too. I'm going to do that on, on camera. Because I mentioned it in the first episode. Going to sleep. Let's be doing it. It's 3.30. Yeah, very fair. Have a wonderful night, Treyas. Thank you so much for, for upgrading your membership. It has been an absolute pleasure. Have a wonderful night. I said that twice, but it better be a wonderful night. If not, I'll, I'll make sure it is. I make myself laugh. Have a good night. Alright. Where are we getting sand? For you keen viewers out there, you might recognize this spot. From the intro of the first episode of Blueprint. Huzzah! Around the corner, and here we are. I haven't actually looked down here. Nope, I'm looking for glass. I cannot do that. Ooh, there's another cave. Nope, we're looking for glass. Are pumpkins for hat? Who knows? Maybe. Maybe I make it. Good night, Trace. I kind of want some kind of sugar. Maybe that'll... That'll wake me up. Hmm. Hello, skeleton. Goodbye, skeleton. I think pumpkin pie? Possibly? Maybe, maybe vanilla ice cream on top of that? 
Perhaps? I think that could be quite yummy. Hmm. Do I dare inquire about the pie of the pumpkin variety? Look at that. Oh, look at that cool tropical fish. I love this mod. This is, I think, where I dug a giant tunnel for the, for the, yeah, I dug a horse tunnel, or a cow tunnel, and then that's when I realized there were just cows at home. I was like, Mom, can we have cow? She was like, yes, we have cow at home. And then I was like, whoa, we have cow at home? And then was promptly grumpy for about 15 minutes before uh, I decided not to be anymore. The end. Thank you so much. I'll be here all week. Wolves. Cannot wait for those guys to be... have variation. That's gonna be fun. People are gonna inevitably try to get all... In fact, they probably already have. Try to get all the different variations of, of dog. Yoink. Me up. I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? I? Need to be going straight that way. Wow. Gotta go down to go up. There we go. Well, pie and ice cream is for, for good boys who go to sleep. Um, so unfortunately, you will not be getting any. Very sorry. Ooh, village. Oh, I took the- I remember this village. I'm stealing your stuff! Yeah. <laughs> Mine now. I'm back for five minutes, I'm fully ready for- oh, okay. <laughs> we're just, uh, we're going and stealing from villagers and then looking for sand, so. Nothing super exciting. Come along, Cogsworth! Huzzah! Is there more dirt to steal? That's a small village. Just three, four structures? The whole thing? Teeny tiny. Wanderlust. I like this one. Look at that. New plants. Oh, I'm excited to play with that stuff. Ow. That view, though. Look at that. Will I be getting a pie and ice cream? Absolutely. Might go to sleep to the stream. Okay. I know that's not gonna happen, but okay. Yeah, you can you can get some pie and ice cream trays since since you're going to sleep. He's actually going or they're actually going to bed. There's a difference between actively trying to go to sleep and listening to the, or watching a stream until you can't stay awake no more. I don't want to have to be a parent. But then you keep saying, oh, I'm so tired. I'm like, well, I don't know what to do. You have the power to go to sleep. That is that is all you. Bird songs. Yeah, yeah, those are in game. That's part of dynamic, uh, dynamic surroundings, which is one of the new additions to the mod pack. I think I'm going to start playing the survival or, uh, with in video with this mod. So you'll hear stuff like waterfalls and rivers, which I just, that just makes me so happy and ice cracking which is just sound, and I would not fall through because it would not do that to me. That's mean. That's a view right there. Yeah. All right, I got sand. Time to go home. And birds. Ah! You're also going to sleep as soon as I'm in. Very good. Very good. Get your rest. It is very nice to have lots of, of awesome sleep. Sleep is great. 
Trust me, I would know. I've been to sleep before. Ooh! I like these leaves. I use that for some. Help! Down on the tree! Help! 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 Oh, oh. Oh. There we go. Alright. Welcome back. What the what? What is that? Oh my god. What is- Oh, no way! <laughs> you want this now? Um... Is it still warm? Yeah. I'll take it now. I'll, I'll take it now. Thank you. My servant has brought me poutine! Thank you, Cooper. Yes! <laughs> Aha. <laughs> How do we get up? For those of you who do not know what poutine is, it is french fries with gravy and cheese curds. And it is delectable and delicious. It's a Canadian specialty. Uh, what's the word? Novelty? Canadian original? It's Canadian. And it's so good. In fact, I was just talking to Etho and Gemini Tay the other day. We were talking about how much we love poutine. <laughs> because they're so Canadian, that's that's all we really talk about. I'm basically Canadian, eh? <laughs> because of all the, put all, all the poutine I eat. Poutine's really good. It's it's just it's just so good. It has no right being as good as it is. I don't know what that means. Oh hello. I like how my response to falling off a cliff was just say hello and look straight down. <laughs> I'm lucky there was water. I actually... Hold on, let's bring this horse. Did I... Did I install the fun, nice, cool mod? Let's see. I love not having to wait for trees to fall over. I'm not sure if I installed this or not, so we'll see. Horse? What in the what? What mod is doing that? That looks really cool. Horse, I present to you boat. No, I didn't install it. I wonder if it wasn't available. It was either not available or I forgot to add it. Let me see. This mod is called... Uh-oh. No load. First Forge, no load. Hold on. Delicacy, that's the word I was thinking of. Uh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Mmm. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna gain, like, 50 pounds. Yup. That's good stuff. I'm looking through my mod list. Hold on. There it goes. Okay. Horse. Not seeing it. Boat. Not available on Curse Forge. Horse. Boot. Ah, it's not available. Got poutine on my arm. Don't have to buy it.
<laughs> Don't worry. I'll be in your dreams instead. Have a good night. <laughs> Sleep well. Thank you for uh, for stopping by. That's a cool sound. Oh, I, I should make sub sounds that sound like experience. That would be cool. Ooh. Run away. Good night. Go, go, go. Person coming. It makes you go faster, I swear. And I fell. What, what? Look at that. See, I got like a big hunk of cheese. Hmm. And green olive? You weren't going to sleep either way. And what, why? What made you change your mind all of a sudden? Oh geez, we're gonna have to go the long way. Yo, horsey, yo. Yay. Meow. And something about the velocity of the way that I'm going that just it speeds up the horse. Oh, I was talking specifically to Treus. I'll be I'll be fending fending off uh his dreams from the dream demons or something. I don't know. Spirit dream dwellers they're just like little gnomes um and they they just like i don't know what do they do they i'm gonna say they'll just they're just like litter in your mind just random thoughts and i'll i'll just like kind of boo and then i'll be like oh run away so i'm basically i'm just I'm, i just save i just save him in his dreams he can he can have sweet dreams while i'm Defeating gnomes in his mind. This is a weird. This is a weird conversation I'm having. Uh, this is Terralith and Bloom and Nature together, I believe. Although people have said that when using the seed I provided, and then also, oh, I'm gonna sneeze. When using the seed I provided and those two mods together, it didn't work. So I'm not quite sure. Either the mods just generate differently every time and seeds don't matter. Or there's a mod I'm missing. But I went through my entire mod pack and wrote down all the mods. So there shouldn't be anything. I didn't I didn't find any. Yeah, they're just, you know, s sleep gnomes. It's um Well see the thing is I can only protect one person a night, so I, I have to go pretty much everybody gets one night and I, I just go around the entire world. And uh, so this is your one night of good sleep, Treyas. <laughs> you better, you better savor it. <laughs> good night, good night. All right, we got sand. I think I'm gonna smelt it all. Oh my gosh, that was a waste of time. I didn't have to do that. If only there was some better way I could be getting, be getting sand. Up, oh, cat has returned. Hmm. I could have just crushed up gravel and we would have sand. Whoopsie daisy. Hmm. Hi. How you doing? You're very orange. How does it feel? He wants butt scratches. Oh, great. Yes, hello. 
You're very cute. See, we could have just gotten sand from here. I didn't have to go all the way over. And I got more than double. And I got other garbage. We're going to make like a proper sand and clay factory soon, too. Soon. In a while, probably. Okay. Um, I think the best way to make this grow. There we go. I thought I had six pieces. Hmm. I will never not love poutine. That's probably my favorite food. It's so unhealthy, but it's so good. Okay. Glass. What did I need? Vertical glass. Vertical glass. How much did I need? 12. N. So I will get 6, and then I will make that, and then I'll... That, and then boom. All that for 10 pieces of glass. Welcome to Minecraft. Ta -da. I love the expanding the sugarcane farm. I'm not sure. Excuse me. I'm not sure if this actually does anything. I think they grow at the same speed regardless. I don't think it affects sugarcane. But for our crops, it makes them grow faster. I'll have to do some experimenting, see how long it takes on average. Fluid pipes, seven. Copper. So I need four. Convenient. One, two, three, four. The same about pizza. Never not want to eat it, even though it's probably not the best. Pizza is like, when is there never, when is there ever not a time to eat pizza? It's always pizza time. Just as Peter Parker said that one time. Oh, interesting. It is, it is always pizza time. He didn't say that last part, but um, it was implied that it's always pizza time. Pizza's just so good. Like, how could you just not? I know there's people who don't like pizza. That's fine. But how could you just not like pizza? It's crazy. It's literally carbs and dairy and sometimes meat. Like, hello, it's delicious. Now I know there's pizza who can't eat it too. Your brain, bro I broke your brain. Stacked jungle planks. Wait, why did I... Right, I can craft these. Silly me. Stacked. There we go. Hmm... It's just delicious. I don't... I don't know what else to say. 10 out of 10. Gearbox. How many? 7? Seven? 7 gearbox. Lots of gear. Lots of lots of gear. <sighs> no, just, I'll just... But just do that. Yeah, just do this and then that and then that. Three, eight, nine, ten, twelve, twenty. That should be five. All that for five. Give me more wood. 
Azar would acquired. And hard to wait for it. Like all the food groups. Pretty much. It's so healthy because it's the diversity of foods you're eating. Yes, and it's not processed because it's cooked in a wood fire oven and somehow that's not processing. I know the difference. I'm just playing. Trying is so hard to wait for it. Yeah, we're going for 50 more minutes or 48 more minutes. We're going to be here for a while. Oh. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Hmm. 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 Give. Yippee! Around the world, around the world. Thank you, sir. Di Dino? Dino? Cool name. I like your leads. Look away, children. <laughs> I'll 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 let him live. I need to focus on my my cogwheel craft crafting. Okay. I'm just gonna I just need more wood. Give me that. What do I need? I forget what you need for cogwheels. Oh, and a site like casing, that's right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Put my eyelids. Yeah, I I vote um get some sleep. You keep complaining and I, I can't I can't help you. What am I missing? Missing a cog. Need more of these. Cog. There. Mm hmm. I love food. Canvas rug. I need my knife for that. We need to go lawn mowing. Frozen pizza. Well, I mean, frozen pizza is not exactly healthy either. But if it's so good, why can't I eat it? Like I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat cardboard pizza if it's available because it's just yummy. Even if it's like half your daily am recommended amount of calories <laughs> in in three slices. It's just a recommendation. <laughs> well, that's good. Once you start sleeping at a regular time on a daily schedule or daily basis, you are going to feel infinitely better. Trust me. As an experienced sleeper, I can I can assure you that the quality of sleep based on consistency has just it's just, it's just good. It's such a goaded method of sleeping. One might even say, uh, 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 what, what one, what one might, what would one might say? They would say, cracked on the, or goaded on the sticks. They would say, pog champ. What else? Uh, What's another? What's another thing you you nip, yipper steppers say? Um, it's 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 it's. No, I can't think of anything else. <laughs> That's all I've got. I wish there was a better way to get straw. There probably is, right? Rice. That's what I need. To, I need to set up a rice farm. I'm going to just have a factory building or a few factory buildings that just have all of the different crops and then I'll just be able to automate everything. And then I can make whatever food I can uh, 
get as much straw as I need and whatever else I need to uh, that I can get through food. Hmm. That is... Oh, okay. That was much less expensive than I thought it was going to be. It's just five, right? Five. Yep. And then we need flower boxes. Five flower boxes, I think. Flower boxes. Dirt slabs. Easy. Do I still have the dirt over here? It has despawned. Oh well. If only there was somewhere we could find dirt. Hmm. Perfect. No one will ever know. How many is this make? Make two. I actually think I need one more. Because I need five, right? I need five. Eight hours and 40 minutes. That is crazy. Okay. Oh, I already had planks. No perceptive. There is six, but one back. Oak cabinets, how do you make that? Trap doors, okay, can do. Can, oh, can do. I thought I had no good. Need how many of those? Five, again? Five, okay. These only make one, I'm assuming. Yeah. So that's six. Oh. Wait, hold on. I'll make? Oh, those are slabs. That's okay, I need to make more of these anyway. If they're at that see five two bam okay this is for the starter base um I didn't I I totally missed your uh missed your question Rob Roba yeah, we're doing the starter base after the first episode, after the first project. But uh, I couldn't, I wanted to get somewhere to get materials before I started actually building. So I'm, I was focusing on that first. Okay, five polished deep slate can do. Easy peasy. There we go. What else we got? Where I think we're, a, no, we are not approaching the end. Okay, here we are, right here. Five spruce stairs. There's a lot of five things. Four. Five. What else? What else we need five of? Uh, five stripped large logs. Here we go. And then I need... Tiled stain... Tiled glass panes. Make six of those. That. And then it was five, right? Not four. It was five. Look at that. So 
So many five things. Five wooden cage lanterns. Wooden cage lanterns. Okay, so I just need five regular lanterns, I'm assuming. go. Nope. Wait, that's not the right one. Can I use this? I can't. What do I do this in? A tinkering table. I've got to make tea and tea. Do have that. Still got sand. Tea and tea. Just in case. I need a piston and a redstone torch. Redstone torch. A four cobblestone. And there we go. For now, I'm just going to put them by side by side. I want to have a building for each of the different professions. I think that could be really cool. Here we go. Wooden cage lamps. Look at that. Perfect. Okay. Brass catwalk railing. I forgot how to make catwalks. Oh, this is going to be expensive. <laughs> oh, no, I have lots of brass. Six brass. Three. There we go. Perfect. Oh no. Oh, come on. That sucks. I'll find a I'll find a place to use this. I like the look of it. That was the wrong one though. Whoopsies. That should be correct. Nope, not that. That should be correct. There we go. Five? Four? Four? Four. That was my impression of Peter Parker when his back hurts. In, in Spider-Man. Hmm. Hello. Welcome in. You've caught me while I'm eating. We've been live for almost nine hours now, so I'm I was a little hungry. Welcome in. What are we doing? Um chisel bookshelf. That's pretty cheap, I think. I think I can do that with just some inventory actually. Yay, okay. For some reason I was remembering it to be even more expensive. I need four. Okay. Perfect. Yeah, no, it's um definitely I'm gonna need that. 
We've been going for a while, and I've been tired for a while. This is a celebration, but... Oh man, it's exhausting. I'm having fun, though. We're getting a lot done. I've gotten most of the materials for a base. Base, I say it like that. The base done. Um, but so far... We really haven't done much other than gather resources. What I should do is start another poll. See, we're at 4.30. I guess in half an hour we'll start the project. What did I just... I just turned tough into tough. That was weird. <laughs> uh, cut tough stairs, that's what I want. At some point you give up talking. Yeah. Well, this the whole point of this was supposed to be a celebration for 100 Discord members and 7,000 subscribers. So I thought it would be fitting to celebrate that with them. Um, in half an hour, we're starting a project that will require uh, community collaboration. We're writing a, a script and then we're going to film a short film in, in and edit it in, uh, in stream. So... Eventually, if we don't get any more memberships... Actually, no, that doesn't matter. I'll, I'll do it then. Yeah, in, in 32 minutes, we'll, we'll start that project. But until then, I've just been gathering materials. That way, the, the next Blueprint episode, I can already have that ready. Spruce, cap, spruce, spruce cabinets this time. But yeah, no, talking to, to someone on a call is not a bad idea. If I ever do a... If I ever do a stream anywhere near this long again. No, that's totally fine. I don't I don't expect everybody to be available. I know it's I know it's quite late for some people. Almost 8 p.m. here, that's crazy. Uh cabinets, that's what I was looking for. Where where cabinet at? There cabinet at. Oh jeez, uh that's expensive. Everything's expensive. Four. One, two, three, four. I'm gonna be out of. Oh, and I got spruce. We're good. We're good. Okay. Four. Perfect. This is a spooky song. I'm gonna skip this one. That's a bit better. What if I got the one for ship that had six? Oh, jeez. At this point, I beg you not. <laughs> I thought it would be like, oh, that'd be a wonderful idea, because it'd be like, you're you're supporting me so much. I'm I'm. I don't expect anybody to get that. Go like, oh, you. You uh, support me so much, I'm going to go on so much longer, but it hasn't even, it's like, it hasn't even been the regular scheduled time and I'm already exhausted. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's late. I've never streamed quite this long before. And I've already forgotten what I was, that's how bad my memory is. Okay, three, I need mechanical belt that requires kelp. I'm just going to spell this whole thing, that's fine. I gotta give my stand up again. It's the 50 minute mark on my watch. So, stretch your legs, get some water. Do, uh, do a quick jog in place, I don't know. At this point, I've lost all motivation to even stand, but I gotta do it so I don't lose my daily streak. Out of water. Quick, to the backup. Yeah, a little bit. Fun fact it was originally going to be. Um, what's the head? Oh, the sticker of the water bottles. Desk. Awesome. Great. But yeah, originally it was going to be an eight hour stream. And then I realized I misspoke in my my video that i just posted announcing this stream and 
so I was like, you know what, I don't feel like re-recording that whole segment. It was pretty much perfect on the first time. So I decided, you know what, it's going to be 12 hours. <laughs> on the bright side, I've had a lot of time. We, we worked on a dungeon in another world. That's going very well. We started working on the actual like cosmetic portion of it so that's that's going that's going nicely um we've gotten a, a lot done as far as materials go i got a horse i've even dyed it a similar color to my outfit and almost matched hello what's up cat uh take your phone take a screenshot that is a actually really good idea and stop you could always add time to your next stream yeah but that that defeats the purpose of a subathon so I don't think I'm going to do that. I get hamburgers now. I'm going to eat a piece of cheese. Yeah, that helps. That helped things. Mm-hmm. That made everything better. Cheese is always the solution. Unless you're lactose intolerant. Then, then maybe it's not. Okay, here we go. Bam. And then I'll just put that on my phone stand. Looking for mechanical, mechanical belts. Do I see mechanical belts? One more. You have for all your schematic list. Save me about an hour. Yeah, I, I, I should. I wish there was a key bind. That's just like takes you to your most recently visited. That would be so much nicer. I know there's the overlay, but because I don't have the... Actually, hold on. Wait a minute. I just had an idea. Uh, clear... Uh, wait, hold on. Info HUD. Hide available. Oh, it doesn't show up? It's supposed to. Ah, oh, I guess it doesn't work. That sucks. Oh, wait, I know why it's not working. No, wait, maybe not. I thought that was going to be the case. Oh, well. Well, it's supposed to be a visual thing that tells you about the materials, but it's not showing up. Uh, I need to build a massive build. I kind of want to do it as a YouTube series. Yeah, it is hard. There's, It's such a saturated... Uh, market. There's so many different people who are starting series and stuff. I, I know that that difficulty. But honestly, if you're just doing it for yourself, why does it matter? Make something you want to make. This is something I probably said five times today on the stream. If you're making something you want to make, that is the best case scenario because then you might it might be slower than appealing to the algorithm, but as a result, you're you're uh, accumulating a, a a viewer base that is as committed to your projects as you are. Instead of just making a hardcore video because that's what um, I don't know Legundo does he make her? I forget. No, Legundo doesn't make her. Yeah, he does. That's how I found him. Um, if you're just making hardcore videos like everybody else is, and you're not introducing something new to the genre, then it's really hard to do that. Lego channel double. That's true. That would. That's uh. That's definitely a. A consideration factor. The three oak blanks. <laughs> yeah, that would help. Or just going out and I don't know, doing photography, going on walks, exploring, finding cool things in your neighborhood, anything like that. I do photography. Um, I do photography sometimes. The polished cut. Oh yeah, I have to. Th I don't need to. St I need to stop looking at it. I have it right here. Polished cuff. Pol it. Yeah. One fell asleep. There we go. Polished cut tough wall. Three. 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 Polished cut tough wall. There we go. <laughs> I 
I basically said you could also just go out and do photography, explore the area, do all that stuff. You don't need another person to to go outside. I've been doing photography. That's my that's my personal outing. Could you guys could you not? Thank you. Let's do jungle log. I got more jungle log. Two and a sight key sink. We're getting close. We're running out. We're running out. We're uh, we're getting close to the end of the list. Andesite catwalk stairs. That's not too hard. I might actually already have that. Nope. How much? How cheap? I'll make this. Get that. I need two. Oh, I might have the perfect number. Hold on. Do I need andesite sheets? What do I need? Yeah, sheet alloy. Yeah. Fresh animations is nice. <laughs> like I said in my video, and villagers can even riz you up. I can't believe I just said that. Oh, did I not? I do have the perfect amount. Oh, I made extra. Okay, we're good. Wait, that's not the right thing. That's the right thing. There we go. Photography's fun. Use Lego in a very good... Nice. Very. It's very small on my screen, so I'll, I'll look at it in a second. Gotta load all of the comments. I haven't clicked on this tab in a while. Well, this is uh, this is quite slow. Waiting for it. Yeah, autocorrect is kind of annoying sometimes. It's it's. I wish I could just re refresh the chat. I just click on your profile picture here. Nope. Okay. These dot dot dots don't do anything. That's so cool. We're we're just now talking about poutine. Oh, here we go. I've caught up. Uh, wow, and I can't even click on your... That's great. Hold on. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's sick! I love Legos, and I love specifically Lego model cities. There is a, a channel. I'm not sure if you know of them. I forget... I unsubscribed from them for a while because I stopped watching. You you literally follow them, Brick Crafts. Yeah, that guy that guy's cool. I like their projects. I used to watch Brick Crafts. Welcome back, Nitro. The only reason I keep autocorrect on is because there are words that I just for some reason cannot. I cannot spell. Like, appreciate? I have such a problem with that for some reason. I need two candle holders, two baobab leaves. That's so specific. Why did I... Why? Where would I find baobab? I'm guessing the... the savannah? Guess we're going on a journey again. It has to be baobab, I guess. Actually, you know what? Let's go to the creative... No, 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 no. That's too much. That's... Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. To avoid spoilers, you don't get to see. Ooh, ha, ha. I need to set up my lights again. It's too dark. Okay. 
Um, where are the Baobab leaves? Is it this? It is that. Leaves. What was those nice leaves I found? Which was that? That's Baobab. Was it fur? It might have been fur. Fur. Ah, uh, they only come with snow on them. Oh, okay. No, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Yeah. <gasps> it generates particles. That's good to know. Okay. 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 You guys have no idea what I'm talking about. <laughs> we could just go for the aspen since that's the type of leaves we're living around. Hmm. What about mangrove? I think that's also that's azalea up there. Okay, we're going for we're going for a mangrove. That's uh, that's looking nice. Blueprint. There we go. Yeah. No, that, he's he's really cool. I really like trains and seeing the Lego train station or the Lego train system go through the town. It was so cool. <laughs> okay. We're going to the mangrove forest. I haven't actually been here yet. Probably should have grabbed some shears, but you know, it's fine. That is seamless loading screen. I talked about that one in my my last mods video. That's a wonderful mod. Yeah, seamless loading screen. I have it on Fabric 1.20, but it might be available for some other versions, I'm not sure. Yeah, it takes a, it takes a screenshot right before you disconnect and then uh, uses that as your loading screen when loading into a new world. Or into a world in general. It doesn't have to be new. But yeah, it's a, it's a pretty nice one. It's very simple, but it adds a lot of life. And that's the kind of stuff I like. That's pretty much what all my mod videos are about. Just little things. Where was that mangrove forest? There it is. Nope, that's the rocky jungle. That's the mangrove forest, okay. No, mangrove swamp. I'm trying to... Yeah, uh, this, the whole mod pack, I don't have a mod, like a video on all the mods. Um, Blueprint is the name of this mod pack. The last video over six minutes is Blueprint. In my Discord, I have a full mod list of everything I use. As of that video, I actually did add some since then. So it's slightly outdated, but like 99% of the mods are in there. It's supposed to be around the create mod. So that's like kind of the thing I built off of was elements of the create mod. Um, but there's some other stuff too. A lot of decor, a lot of... Uh, Smaller features like supplementaries and Farmer's Delight have. Advance my horse! I have stuff that lets horses not sink in water. It's amazing. But the generation mods, to my knowledge, are Bloomin' Nature and Terralith. Some people said that the the seed I provided was not giving out the same generation. So I don't know if I'm just missing one. I just some I skimmed over it or what. But I don't remember adding anything other than those two. Using some for my friends. Nice. Nice. Mm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, all of these are for Fabric 
I pretty much only build mod packs in Fabric. And it's going to be a while before I move to 1.21. Uh, just because so many of my mods are in 1.20 right now. My quote-unquote vanilla mod pack has 156 mods or something. This one has 188. We're almost there. All this for two leaves. I see it. Our prized, uh, tri uh, prized treasure. <laughs> Fabric just runs way better. You have the options of sodium, and there are so many mods that just are exclusive to Fabric, like better clouds. Just, oh, so beautiful. I love it. I've got one you'll see when it's nighttime that changes how stars generate. And it's just, it's such a small feature. It just adds so much. Yeah, all, all of my mods videos that I've made so far are on Fabric 1.20.1. Yeah, that's, that is, I think, the greatest version. Not just of modern Minecraft, but also, I think, of modded Minecraft as well. Like, you have all of the features of almost the newest version. Ow. But then also, people started picking up modding, and I feel like now that Fabric exists, or ever since Fabric has existed, people have been more inclined to make smaller mods that just make the game feel better quality of life stuff cosmetic mods whereas forge is more like let's make a medieval mod pack or let's make a let's make a gun mod and you just you don't get that i mean there are some people who have ported it over to fabric but i feel like a lot of people focus on the visual elements with fabric rather than the mechanical ones of, of forge Hey Brian, what's up? We've been live for nine hours. It sounds like the Halo theme. Oh. Howdy, partner. Yeehaw. We're out here in the Wild West. Looking for cattle. Seems today that we're running low in water again, and the rain hasn't been too kind to us outsiders. We've had our hats open, hoping that one day we would get some water. But it looks like it will be another dry day. Um, tire. It's been going well, though. We're just about to start the collaborative storytelling project that I, I talked about earlier. So if you stay for another 11 minutes, uh, you can you can pitch in if you'd like. There's so much stuff. Thank you very much. I kind of want to do a Western skit sometime. That's one thing. Uh, I love doing themed mod packs. So I've been wanting to do a, a zombie apocalypse one. I've been wanting to do the Western one. I've been wanting to do... What was the other one? I made one that was supposed to emulate Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. But uh, I have I have put that project on a pause um, since I stopped playing COD. <laughs> what else? I forget. There was a bunch of other themed. I'm working on a horror one, but it's been a while since I've touched that. A horror one is really hard to pull off, though, I found. Down to record Portal 2 or Sky Noon. Um, I feel like I said yes to something on Sunday, but I can't remember what it was. This week, though, probably yes. I I, for, I read weekend. Yeah, this this week I could probably do that. I can't really do a Russian accent, but I can try. It's not great. You know what it reminds me of? Is uh, I can't. I don't even know what does it remind. I can't really do an accent. Not like that. There's a character I'm trying to think of when I do the voice, but I can't figure out who it is. No, no, no. I'm. I'm. 
I don't think we will do that day. Yeah. Um, if I'm not absolutely exhausted tomorrow, I could probably do that later in the day. I would love to record Sky Noon. It's a wonderful game. And coincidentally, it's themed after the Wild West. So why, how could I say no? I think I need myself a cowboy hat to match this revolver. I do sound like Dracula. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> Welcome back. Man, everybody's popping in right now. Yeah, I saw you were here earlier. Welcome back. How was your sleep? Oh, wait, no, you said this morning. How was your day? Ah. Where am I? There we go. And Cooper got me poutine. So I'm I've been I've been eaten. This dog like the count. Ah ah ah. It is raining. Oh no. That's good. I'm glad. Thank you very much. I set my... I set the, the subscriber goal. Not subscriber. The membership goal. For if we reached... I think I said... Is it the 40 one? 40 subs. If we hit 40 subs for 20 or 30 minutes, I would do a voice that you guys voted on. And... Uh, you guys could have picked from... Let me turn down the music. You guys could have picked from Peter Griffin, Lego Batman, King Julian, Carl Weezer, Snape, Terminator, Kermit the Frog, or Golem. And for half an hour or so, I would have done the voice and, and played the game in character. I'll, if that doesn't get pick it, or taken, I'll have to... Um, I'll have to I'll have to save that for whenever another subathon happens. Yar. We be finding treasure. What are these themed songs? I've never heard these before. We be looking for gold. Finding riches and, and booty across the lands. I actually have a pirate skin. Somewhere. I don't know. I like cheese. Cheese is good. Poutine. Spectacular meal. I wonder if I can... I'm gonna tear off the lid. I don't think it's gonna happen. That's annoying. Oh well, that's fine, I'll deal with it. Ah, <sighs> okay. What did I come back from doing? Ah yes, the two mangrove leaves. Perfect. Next we are looking for candle holders. Which I think I'm gonna have to go out and find beehives for. Oh wait, we stole candles, didn't we? I swear we did. Cody! Welcome, welcome. Thank you. It should pop up in a second. There it goes. Thank you for becoming a member. My man. Uh, in the Discord, it should automatically give you the role. Thank you, dude. I appreciate that. Oh, I need two carpenter's tables? Whoopsies. I appreciate that, man. Thank you. I've already lost my train of thought. <laughs> um, candle holders, that's right. How do you make these? Candle. That makes sense. Didn't I steal candles? Oh my gosh, Cody, you shouldn't have. No way. Thank you, dude.
I was waiting for it. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. Are we out of music? Oh, it's still going. It's just quiet. Oh my gosh. Well, wazaza, if you're here, make sure to give for a of thanks. I really want to kill this guy, but I, I'm feeling nice. He's doing it to himself. Oh my gosh. Okay, um, what was I, uh, um, uh, uh, candle? Yeah. I swear I stole candles. No. I did not steal candle, we're going to steal candles. I swear I stole can- I stole candles. Don't tell me I didn't steal candles, I stole candles. Ah, candles, I knew it. I knew it. Just regular candle holders, right? Hey! Hey! Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh! Music is just quiet and kind of creepy. I like this one. Bossa Nova Minecraft. Okay, we need two chests, two carpenter tables, two candle holders. They're back! I'm prepared for this time. Come at me, you fools! Man. I want to crush it. Go. Go. No. You suck. Thank you very much. I can't see the arrows. It's scary. This guy. Yay! My hero. You're dead. You're okay. I've saved you. You should give me all this stuff for free. I saved your life. Don't blink at me. Oh, look what time it is. Three hours, 59 minutes. That's spooky. Okay. So, I'm going to put my poutine to the side. Here's what's going to happen. I am going to write down some stuff. 
Here we go. Perfect. I'll just use this, this Google Doc. We are going to write a story. We're going to write about anything. So maybe we first pick a theme. What, what genre do we want to go for? Um, we, Therese, I just saw the message. Uh, we've been gathering materials for the starter base, and now we're going to be writing a script together, and then I'm going to film that script by the end of the stream. So by the end of the stream, hopefully, we'll have a video that will get posted on the YouTube. Hopefully. Four hours should be enough time. Probably. Probably should be enough time. Yeah. Okay. So what should the genre be? <laughs> Excuse me. What about adventure? So something like Indiana Jones or what what exactly are we going for adventure? Fantasy? High fantasy. Horror. These are all very different. We could probably combine all three of those, honestly. Horror is really hard to pull off with such short planning. So that one's that one's probably a bit difficult. Loud. Horror adventure. Hmm. Fantasy I could probably pull off. Adventure I could definitely pull off. Horror I might be able to do. We have to figure out how to make something actually unsettling. Cuz the hardest thing about horror is how do you create tension? Because uh, if you have a scary moment, how do you define what makes it scary? That you don't really have to do as much because you're not trying to um, inject a certain mood into fantasy or adventure as much. You're kind of just ingesting it. Whereas horror, you're trying to inflict a certain emotion on your enemy. Your enemy. Your, your, your audience. <laughs> Thank you, Hyper. We're, uh, we're almost there. We got four hours left. Fantasy adventure. I think... I think that's what we might go for. Because that I could probably pull off. So we're going to start with a fantasy adventure. I gotta look up what that is. You guys keep saying this word. I don't think I know what it means, but you think it means. High fantasy. Ah, okay. Hmm. So keep in mind, we have the tools, I guess. I mean, we have the tools available to us. Let's try to let's try to do this as vanilla as possible. Using just the vanilla mod pack or van yeah, my vanilla mod pack. What do we what do we have? Because that's like my ideal filming mod pack. So we've got shaders, we've got all the vanilla mobs. What can we do? What can we do? Different types of fantasy. That is true. I could theoretically I could theoretically add the morph mod. Different types of fantasy. Yeah, I, I just looked it up. There and back again. So like a story, like a story that starts and ends in the same way, but something has changed about the around the main character. That's not a bad idea. I don't, I don't dislike that. How would we do that in a fantasy setting? Hmm. Oh, you know what I just forgot to do? I forgot to add time to the timer for the two subs we just got. Let me do that as soon as the game loads. Totally forgot to do that. 
I don't want to crash it, so I'm 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 not gonna touch it. Maybe it's fine. Yeah, it's fine. Okay. Here we go. There's Minecraft. Zero three. So that's let's see, that's uh six minutes from the magma and two minutes, so it's eight minutes. Oh man. Math. I hate math. Fifty-four plus that's the times button. Wow, I've already messed up. Plus eight. Sixty-two. So that would be zero four zero two fourteen. Ta-da! And we're back up to over four hours. Okay. Let's let's just create a new world. Let's start from scratch. Let's tell a story. Yeah. It'll it'll pick up the screen here in a second. Wow, it really is. Oh, uh, this sticker was probably supposed to be removed. Seems. Give it a second. There it goes. It's loading. There it is. We're back. Yeah, this is the, the mod pack we'll be using. Just vanilla stuff, but we do have shaders. If we really need it, I can add the morph mod. So we're going to do something fantasy, adventure, and a there and back kind of adventure. So if that means what I think it means, we have to figure out something where this adventurer goes on this grand quest. It can't be too long. I, I don't. I we only got four hours. It's this stuff takes longer than you'd expect. I head to bed soon. About ten thirty here. Okay. Thank you for stopping by. Kitchen in. Let me get this off the bottom. Have a wonderful night. like it's gonna explode oh that's good got a dent in it morph mod updated to the most recent version i think so at least 1.20 it's called something else though it's called identity i think not morph mod we have that on studio blocks um is it okay I'll unpause it. And I can get the sticker. Kind of satisfying. Yeah, Mmm, <sighs> water. For now, we'll just turn on anti aliasing. Okay. This is possibly the worst biome we could have started in. There you go, much better. Okay, got it. Timer's going now, cool, awesome, perfect. So fantasy adventure. And then we'll go... Uh, there and back story. The something where the main character starts, they do something, and then maybe there's this fight or something like that. And then at the end of it, they're back to where they were at the beginning, but maybe something's changed. So perhaps there is this warrior in a in a house. Um and he comes out and he's chopping logs and for his for his, his big fire. And then some 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 bad guys attack, some pillagers start shooting at him. And then he decides, oh no, I gotta fight these guys. And so he, he gets he, he defeats all of them except for one who runs away. And then uh, he leads them back to the pillager outpost. And now he has to take on an army. And then what happens next? Uh, 
Then he has to fight a Ravager. Uh, and it's a really, uh, really f hard battle. And he's like, he's running through the tree line. Here, imagine this. I'll, I'll try to, I'll try to visualize this. Okay, okay, okay. It's gonna be really cool. Watch this. So here's here's one shot I was thinking of. So we have we have whoever this warrior is running through from his, from the ravager, and the ravager is chasing behind. And as he's chasing, he's knocking out all the leaves to catch up to him. So he just clears the way as as the warrior is trying to trying to escape. What are we thinking? What are you thinking? Yes or no? Thinking thinking it's an idea. What's uh? What should the setting be? Could go desert themed. More make more sense if we were in a forest for that. The trees, that's what they're called. Hmm. That was satisfying. I enjoyed watching that. Hi Spider, welcome back. I like the color of the sky in the desert. Watch this. This is pretty cool. We've got desert sandstorm. I love this. All right. So what's the setting going to be? Do we want to do... I think a forest might make the most sense. This is a desert one. Could also do a western. We didn't want to do fantasy. I guess... I was just trying to think of things. Where could we do a fantasy? That could work. Forest, I think the forest is just the best. Maybe a dark oak forest. Villager outpost has something in the main main character wants, like a loved one or an item of power. Info in the big bad. Sounds good. Perhaps burst through a wall of leaves. That's not bad. I was thinking maybe um, maybe the character like hides behind a wall and he thinks he's safe, and then boom, he just bursts through the wall. And we could actually we can actually mess around with this idea. Um, for example this let me get a uh, weather clear time is set noon game rule do daylight cycle false they uh, do or cycle false so this is this is an idea I could retexture the sand theoretically to make it stone or something. And then we could have the main character. Maybe the main character runs around this. No, we'll do this. We'll do this. The main character thinks thinks they're safe. Because they they went through this door and they're like, ah, they're safe. Whew. So close. And then just for the sake of... You'll have to use your imagination. Imagine both the sand and the obsidian are stone. Okay. So the main character runs through, and then he's like, oh, I'm safe. Well, that did not work the way I thought it was going to. Hmm. I think it has to be falling to do the effect I wanted it to. I was thinking it would blow the sand outwards. It just, it just blew up the sand. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think that's going to work. Unless it's like permanently falling. That doesn't work. Okay. But yeah, definitely bursting through a wall of leaves could be doable. And especially if we have the, uh, the... In... In... Identity mod. Then that way we can control the Ravager. I've got my second account 
I can I can work with as well and then theoretically record two characters at once. I've done that before. So let's say, yeah, we'll say main character, we'll call him call him we'll call him Lance. Real original here. We need some kind of outfit, perhaps a warrior of some sort. Perhaps some kind of warrior. I, I'm working with what I have at the moment. Um, yes, I am. So we'll say Lance starts at home. Chopping bracale, chopping bracala, chopping, chopping logs. Or a fire. This is just a random world. We're doing a project now where you guys are coming up with a story and I'm working with you guys to write that story and then we're going to film that story, edit it, and then I'm going to post it. So you guys are, are here. That is essential. Chopping logs for fire. And then... <sighs> I lost my train of thought. This is going great. Everyone chopping legs for a fire. Then it's attacked by villagers. He defeats. What, where, what? What, what, what? Uh -huh. Oh, I'm, I'm just writing it on a Google Doc and I'm asking you guys questions. You're giving me suggestions and then we're mishmashing them together. I'm writing it on a Google Doc and then we're going to record it. Um, in this world, and then I'm going to edit it together in in live stream, and then we're going to post it, hopefully by the end of the stream. So I give myself four hours to do this, so we'll we'll see. He defeats all but one pillager who manages to escape. Lance tracks. The, vi the villager, the pill pillager. Um, he gets away, but fortunately leaves footsteps or something. Tracks the pillager through the forest. It's the pillagers gets overwhelmed by a vindicator that storms out. So the the thing that we've so far uh, discovered or uh, decided on is that it's a fantasy adventure. It's a there and back story. So it starts at one location, something happens, some event, some some confliction. Uh, maybe there's a big fight, maybe he falls in love, but then at the end of the story, he goes back to where he started. So yeah, that could be, that could work. Um, we talked about having a squad of pillagers, all but one escape, or one escapes out of, and the other are defeated. Uh, Lance follows them back to the pillager outpost where he defeats a bunch of pillagers, but then there's a Ravager, and the Ravager, he's been then being chased by the Ravager and has to find some way to defeat the Ravager. Has it? Wow. Welcome back. You're just in time for the story of the century. This is going to get an, an Oscar award nomination. Um, Where'd it go? I lost it. Ah, there it is. Yeah. So tracks the pillager through the forest. Maybe I I hit him or something. He starts bleeding. I gotta. I have to have some way to to um to find to find and track this pillager. Just your massive building your server. Sure. Yeah, I'll, I'll check it out. Let me see for your builds. Whoa, that's awesome. Oh, I love the copper and the deep slater one. Possibly both. That's really cool. I love that garden too. Dang. That's really cool. Huh. There's a lot of detail in that. I love the roof details. That looks awesome. Way to go.
That's so cool. I am so jealous. Or not jealous. Envious? Impressed. That's the word. I'm so impressed with the ability that builders have for detail and structures. I admire that immensely. Okay. So how do I track this pillager? What do I what do I use? Yeah, on the Discord. Um maybe maybe it drops its bow. Maybe Maybe it it leaves a blood trail. Maybe they came in on horses and I find some horses. Oh my gosh. 13 by 27. That is crazy. You're crazy. That's that's crazy. A bell? Maybe. Well, I want it to be some distance. Right now, I just have the Minecraft Creator Safe playlist on, so this is just Minecraft music. This isn't specific to anything, it's just what happens to be on. We've gotten through all of the Minecraft music already, so now we're on Legends, I think. 5.7 million carpets. Oh, jeez. You're on, you're on your own, unless you have some kind of wool farm or string farm. String farm is actually not a bad idea. Um... The problem is I am limited to what I can do in Minecraft, so dragging an axe on the ground, I can't really do that. But, is there a way I can emulate it? I'd have to be able to show it. Hi, Casey. Can I turn darkness mode on? Or stark mode, I know it's here. Watch this, my face is going to go dark all of a sudden. If I can even find it. Here it is. Oh, it's beautiful. Trail of destruction. But I, I want to leave the, the last pillager wounded. That's why he's retreating back to the... Back to the... To the, to the, to the, to the outpost, that's what it's called. Did you use the mace in the video? Yeah. The problem is, I can get tools and stuff, but having it drag on the ground, that's the problem. Of course, maybe. But again, like, I could... <laughs> I could have the, the pillager walking with a trail of coarse dirt made, made... Like, being made behind him. But then it just looked like he's pooping. And I don't want that. <laughs> There's no way for me to, like, make it look like he's dragging the axe on the ground. That's the problem. So how could I... It's gotta be like he's tracking it with some clues. Thank you. And thanks for, for showing off that build. That was really cool. Redstone is blood. That was that was one good idea. Redstone, we could do like he left a horse. We could do uh, maybe drop the bow because he's like wounded. So he dropped the weapon. Not sure. Arrows falling out of his quiver. That could be cool. That's not bad. I could put it in an item frame to make it look like it's on the ground. Let's trek the pillager through the forest. Um, following clues that were left behind. A, an arrow dropped on the ground. Uh, a donkey left behind. A trail of blood. Maybe not that one, because that would be have to be consistent. I'm going to head to bed now. Good night, Lainey. Thank you for popping in. Sleep well. Thank you very much. Use dogs? That's not a bad idea.
Dog number seven helps track the enemy. An arrow dropped in the ground. A donkey left behind. Um, how many subscribers have a game? Subscribers? I'm not sure, actually. Viewer activity. Can I check that? Subscribers? I'm not sure. Members? I can see. Um, one, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I think ten in total so far. Armor stand following the pillager aligned to show the axe dragon. I don't know how to do that. Snip. Mate, oh, you know what? I have a better idea. It's not a dog that's helping me track. It's a sniffer. The sniffer is sniffing. That's what. We'll, oh, that's. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, that's what's gonna be. Sniffer, I get because that makes sense for kind of the theme. It could be his dog, yeah. A donkey left behind. Uh, a dog tied up. Um, unleashed to unleashed leads Lance back to the villager outpost or pillager outpost. I like that. That's good. There we go. See, that makes sense. And not only that, I don't even have to like add sniffing sound effects because the sniffer sniff. So it works out perfectly. Okay, that works. That works well. I like that. That's uh, that's good. Um, maybe there's a cliff or something that has ropes coming down or something. I don't know. Maybe I should install a world gen mod for this. That might not be a bad idea. That way we can get more of a fantasy vibe. That might do that. Hi, Penny. What the what what? Coffee junkie, thank you for upgrading. I need to manually do it because it doesn't detect upgrades, so I have to I have to do it on my own. That's uh that's the sound that would have played. <laughs> thank you so much. Is it really not show? Man, that sucks. But thank you for that. Oh my gosh. I don't ever know how to react. <laughs> I really appreciate that, thank you. 25 minutes. Okay, we're adding 25 minutes to the counter here. And I gotta stand up. So, zero, zero, three. No. Hold on, hold on. Math, math, math. I just got the notification. Yeah, we've been live for uh, for almost 10 hours now. Um, so it's 42 plus 25. That'll be four hours. We're back up to four hours. And seven minutes, 19 seconds. There we go. I'm kind of disappointed it doesn't automatically do this. It's connected too, it's weird. Hmm. Very odd. But thank you for that. Uh, we are now back up to, to four hours again, so that's fun. Okay. If he... I think it automatically... We've discovered that it it's not instant that it upgrades the role in the Discord, so it might be a little bit delayed. We're not sure exactly how much how much time needs to pass before it figures it out. Oh yeah, no, this is a subathon. I probably should have... I thought I had mentioned... I mentioned that at the beginning. I didn't really put it in the title. I did put it in the description, though. No, I didn't. I'm going to put it in description. I'll just put 7,000 subscriber subathon. Ta-da! Yay. All right, there we go. Now it's updated. 
Cool. Don't need that tab anymore. Awesome. Okay. Yes, it is a it is a subathon. Prove you sleeping. Oh, <laughs> I'll be fine. I have stayed up much longer. It sh it shouldn't be that that bad. The ten hours where I'll be, I think I'll be going to bed at midnight is not bad. We've got plenty of time to make this work too. Hard cap on time? Not really, no. I mean, I'd ideally not like to make it a 24-hour stream, but if it happens, it happens. I'll do it. I set the times. That's on me if I messed it up. I am willing to. I am willing to endure that. I've got lots of stuff I can do. Okay. Unleash the lead. Unleashed. Leads the lands back to the pillager outpost. Um... Can you tie a sniffer to a lead? You can. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to... That's that's scene one, basically. No, scene one is the chopping logs. It starts at home. Hey, Polly. Welcome back. Lance starts at home, chopping logs for a fire. Cooks a hearty breakfast. When suddenly, the wall explodes. No, even better. I have an idea. Suddenly, an arrow flies through the window and hits a column just barely missing Lance. Perfect. And then Lance looks over out the window to see <laughs> You see two pillagers. Just saw something. I don't know what that was. See two pillagers. Um, one hits the other. Or misfiring. Because they were supposed to be sneaky. So he's like, dude, why'd you fire, you idiot? You bumbling buffoon. And missing. Lance grabs his sword, which I can use the armor statues to make it look like it's propped up. Grabs his sword, busts down the front, or busts open, not down. Busts open the front door. You got visitors gonna leave. Okay. All good. Thank you for popping by. Have fun. Front door charges the two villagers. It's gotta be something maybe No, it's gotta be while he's chopping logs. No no hearty breakfast. He's gotta be outside. I wonder if we could use the animation mod too. That would make this look a lot more cinematic. Grabs a sword, bust doesn't bust open the front door. Unsheaths. Unsheath. Unsheaths sword. That's not how you spell that. Unsheath his sword. Busts and no, he doesn't bust open the door. He's outside. And charges. He unsheaths the sword. And charges the two. Villagers. Yes. This music is very fitting. Okay. Um, so we could even possibly use Epic Fight Mod for this. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to duplicate this mod pack. Duplicate. 
And then I'm going to add all those other mods. You say you had a 10 membership. Yeah, I played... I played... Um, what did I play? I played Radioactive. I played... Smoke on the Water, I think, is what it's called. Blank, 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 blank. I played a little song on my guitar. Or should I say, I played a song on my little guitar. <laughs> so, yeah, I um, I played some songs on the world's smallest acoustic guitar. And it was wonderful. People were saying it was so accurate I was going to get DMCA striked for all the copyright that was going on. Um, oh, did it not work? Oh, it worked. Okay, cool. So I'm going to add... Is Epic Fight available? Epic Knights. Epic Knights and Mages. Epic Samurai. That's kind of cool. I actually do have a... I forget what, how you pronounce it. Where is it? Uh, kimono. I have a kimono skin. So I could be... We could go kind of more more Japanese with it. Maybe? What are we thinking? Do we want to stick to fantasy medieval or do we want to go to to something like samurai? Like a ninja, ninja warrior. I don't know. I'll leave that up to you. I thought Epic Fight was available. Epic Knights. Epic Knight's add-on. Epic Knight's Slavic Armory. Welcome back, Dishope. A weird sentence to say. <laughs> Epic Fight. Is it available for fabric? It is not. So we could... Okay. Epic Weapons. Basically building it. What is this by my name? Oh, you got gifted a you got gifted a membership. Barkin supplementaries for adding mods. That's true. Uh, Quark is oh yeah, that's right. It is available now. I forgot about that. Mm -hmm. But it's not available for for or fabric because I'm building this in fabric. I've already got the base mod pack I'm working on. That's why. But I can do supplementaries. That I do know is available. You got back at one of the most perfect times. We are writing a story, and then we're gonna film a short film, and then we're gonna we're gonna post the short film. So together we're gonna work on this amazing story. Thank you very much, Benja. So we got supplementaries. I appreciate that. Thank you. Um. Probably should do a world gen mod, right? It did happen. We have we have surpassed it. We actually hit 7k like three times today. But I think this time we actually are gonna we're gonna stay hitting it. <laughs> I know there's an animation mod, which what is it called? Things better animation. Get that one. Not that one. Kelvin's. Kelvins we could do, which both that one and serious player animations are somebody taking somebody else's mod and then re and retitling it and reposting it because he said he, he gave up on it. Okay, so we got animations for both the player and for um, and for all the mobs. Would like one. If we're gonna do medieval, we need some weapons. We need some swords. I want to do weapon master. I think that would be good. YDM's weapon master. That's good. What about castles? Lost castle. That could be good. No pictures. What? That's fine. Okay. 
So we got we got a castle. We need something for swords. Simply swords, perhaps. These are 3D, aren't they? Oh, they're not. Let's do that one. Let me close this. I'm assuming we're just gonna stick with medieval. So I'll do I'll just do that skin. Close that. What else? We need world gen. Um I want identity. Do that. We want world gen. I can filter this, right? Filter here, categories, world gen, there we go. Towns and towers, better combat, that's not bad. I was thinking an epic fight, let's see. Better combat. Yeah, we'll do that one. I do wonder if these are compatible. I'll try it. I'll add better combat. I do hope this stuff does record in a replay mod, because that's going to be... I do have Simply Swords, yeah. If this doesn't record in replay mod, then it's not going to work. But I'm assuming it I'm assuming it does. Okay, world gen, we're going to go something more fantasy, so maybe... Um, not enough... What is it called? I haven't used them in so long. Biomes of Plenty. Um... Something more. Let me just type in fantasy and see what pops up. Nope. Yeah, these are these are not gonna work. Glass world. Okay. What's the other one? Uh, there's biomes of plenty, and then there's another one that's very popular. That is. Gen. Bigs, Structory, Structory, Terralith we could try, I mean that's pretty much used that in every one. Regions Unexplored might be the, might be the go. I don't feel like that's really fantasy enough. I need something with like big rolling hills. When dungeons arise, that's not a bad idea. Eldritch End. Hmm. And now we need something that's supposed to be like... Hmm. What is going to be like the big, the big, what's the, what's the climax of the story? Is it defeating the Ravager? Is it collecting something? Collecting something might be a little underwhelming. I think it might be defeating the Ravager. Maybe with an anvil or something. Tectonic. That might be what we do. That's what we're going to do. Flutter. Good. We already have supplementaries. All right, I think that's our mod pack. We've got everything I think we need. But let me boot this up, and hopefully it will not crash. It's always fun making a new mod pack. You never know which mods are going to work. Let's see. All right. Here we go. You guys ready for a story? Uh, supplementaries requires version of Moonlight. The only version present is the wrong version. 2.9.99. Moonlight Library. 2. Point, I gotta go back in supplementaries, I think. 
Supplementaries. Where are you at? Supplementaries has always been a problem. Like, literally always. Yay, story. Integrated structures... Integrated structures is great, but the only problem is it's for Forge. We're on fabric. You know, I'm just gonna see what... I'm gonna see what Blueprint is running. Blueprint is running. Moonlight 2.9.16. For Moonlight. 2. 2.9.16. And then the version of where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh. Supplementaries is two point seven point three six. Two point seven point three six. There it is. 2.7.36 Hopefully that should do it. Now I have the same versions on Coldcraft or on this mod pack that I do on on Blueprint. So hopefully there should no longer be any contradictions. This is always the worst part. Literally always. There's never not a part where this sucks. And we have to wait. Again. What does what does F10 do? It's the B right back screen. F11. Nope. We're doing this. There we go. Now there's something to look at other than a black screen. Void Lance no longer. Oh, the game is it's it's gray. That's a step up from from what it was before. Alright, step in the right direction. Yay! Working. Cool. Alright, now let's generate a story and find something way more interesting. For real, let's tell a story. We're gonna we're gonna make something cool here. Just you wait. Three hours and 48 minutes. We're close. We're not, but we're close. Okay. New terrain. Look at the sky. Wow. Oh yeah. This is this is infinitely more interesting as a as a uh, as a world to explore, just the wrong biome. Look at how tall this mountain is. Hole. Oh. Encoding overloaded. <laughs> Too much cool stuff. Okay. This might be too. We gotta locate the stronghold. Ancient city. Supplementaries. Lost Castle. Lost Castle. Let's see, where does this take us? Aha! So this will be our, our final area. The, the climax, the boss fight, this is where it will take place. Our evil pillager fortress. And fortunately... It's already equipped with pillagers inside. So that makes it convenient. Unfortunately, it's a really bland environment. Wish it was a cooler forest, but yeah, we got her. Thank you. Oh, thanks. We gotta fix this up too. Should 
Do we see what we're working with? Okay. Let's get some stairs. No, slabs. It's gotta be it's gotta be gradual. Yeah, it's so smooth. It's we're gonna put so much effort and detail into this. It's not gonna take any time at all. Your sound effects. Okay. For now, this will be fine. We'll come back to this later. Right now, let's focus on just making the house, I guess. We don't even really need an interior. We just need an exterior. That will speed up a lot more time. Here's our big, bad castle. One bad guy in it. Okay. We'll come back to this later. We need a spot that's plains biome. Maybe there's a shot where it's like this village is on fire and then it slowly pans over to the castle or something. I don't know. Oh, I am I am exhausted. I am I am so tired. <laughs> I don't know what button did I set it? There we go. No, I'm I'm quite tired. I've been we've been live for ten hours now. This is what I was looking for. All oh, these rolling hills, much cleaner or uh, much cooler. When I load new generation, it's gonna lag me out. So give me a second. Ooh. Okay. Very cool. I'm liking this. This might be a good spot. This really cool mountain. Hmm. Okay. Maybe this. This might be where we go. Because I love this. This is great. I wish it sloped a little bit more, but that's fine. I do wish this village wasn't here. But this, uh, this is very cool. I want something a bit more scenic. That's that's a cool shot. Okay. I think right. Are there two villages? Are you kidding? Okay. That's actually cool the way that generated though. It makes no sense, but it looks cool. We'll we'll build this in the in this village here. So this is our villager spot. Josh birds. Okay. My encoder was getting overloaded, but I think it's good now. Oh, wait, I forgot to also move the sub goal forward. Hold on, I gotta do that. So, the goal, because it didn't, it didn't, uh, count the, didn't count the, the upgrade, I have to manually move it back by one. So now, yeah, now we get 18 of 26. Okay, so we're going to build the house right here, I think. I think in, I think in this.
Yep, this is going to look cool. Wish it was a modded forest, but yeah. It's fine. Going in survival with shears is actually faster than breaking it all in creative mode. Okay. Whoa. Banner. Shield. What? What button did I press? Oh, V. We gotta configure this. Drop selected item. Favorite item. Auto clicker, we don't need these. Auto HUD, we don't need those. Actually, I kind of want to do this one. Do that. Thank you, Doge. I appreciate that. Turn this off. Dynamic surroundings. Yeah. I'm hoping we get some cool shots. Identity. I don't need... I kind of want to do a skulk part, but I feel like I can't put that much in here. That would that would just be too long. Oh, we have the quiver. That's right. Okay, let's try. I don't need a quiver. I just I could just use it for decoration. The so one thing I discovered is why. Map, Sumify. I would like to have a section. Where is this? Where? Turned it off, okay. A uh, section where we... I forgot. Oh yeah, first person. So we have the we have this mod. Allows us to do the, the fancy animations. Having a, a section that has the HUD hidden. Oh, we should also get camera overhaul so the screen shakes. This looks cool. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I think that's going to look cool. That's from Better Combat, I think. Hold to attack, yeah, mine with weapons. I like crosshair. Show arms. Yes, this I, this is what I want to change. I think that will that will look good. And then we can have a spot I can turn off with dynamic crosshair. And turn off holding tool. Holding a ranged weapon. Holding block. Holding usable item. I can configure this later. Yeah, isn't it? I've never used this mod before. I just figured it would probably have this. It does. Uh, what's the other one? Uh, uh, the one we were just looking at. Dynamic Crosser. Holding tool disable. Looking at entity. Looking at block. Tool overrides entity. Holding a ranged weapon. How do we turn it off? I just want to... Oh, it's off. Okay, there we go. And then I can do accessibility settings. Turn off the... Is it video settings, maybe? Sprint, hold, text, background, subtitles. How do I do the cooldown thing? Where is that? I forget. What are you using for the walking animation? That is... Is that Kelvin's animations? Is that what I added? Graph 3... I believe it's Kelvin. And music... J, K, L... What 
did I use? Serious player animations. That's what's in here. This one is serious player animation. I'm not sure if this running animation is even from that, though. This might be from Better Combat. What do you mean so close to three hours? We got 40 minutes. What do you mean? <laughs> okay. Hear me out. We've got, like... Like the pillager mod and stuff. What does the shield look like, actually? Okay, that just looks regular. And then having a section... I was holding the shield. Having a section where it's like first person in the middle of the fighting. <laughs> sure, whatever you want to believe. I think that could be cool. Whee! That's kind of funny. And then maybe a quiver. Maybe maybe an archer as well. And what I can do with supplementaries is I can actually change where the stand speaker box general. Two tips. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Tweaks. This is it, right? Here's items. This is it. Quiver. Here we go. Die hidden back. That's what I want. So now my quiver is animated on my back instead of on my hip or my, my thigh. <laughs> and that way I could load a crossbow and now it makes sense I mean I got an arrow on my knee but I, it makes sense because I've got a, a quiver on my back that looks so good I missed but that's the that's the idea what about an axe what does the axe look like it's cool so if I were just to chop at a log what does this look like and I could also use a mini block. If I take a stone cutter, I believe it's in this mod pack. Yep, we got mini blocks. So I could pretend to split logs with this. And then maybe have a campfire. Has been shoveled. Let's see. For now. I'll set that manually. So it's like I have some spare wood. I know there's something else I'm forgetting that would also look like that. So that could be like that. And then maybe I'm in adventure mode. It's like I'm chopping chopping wood. You know, because you're like, whoa! Whoa! And then I can do some sound effects. <laughs> See? It's all coming together. So was it V? I changed it's I. It's U. It's it's Y. There it is. How do I turn this off? I just want I guess I don't need the shovel. So I could have the axe. So what do we do for swords? I want something that looks vanilla. That seems... that seems too much. Like, 16 by 16. Whoa. What do they even do? That's pretty cool. If I have one in each hand. Me. Uh... It's Raph. I'm Raphael from the Ninja Turtles. Aww. That's really cool. I love that. We have a boomerang. I kind of want a boomerang. Pretty neat. No boomerangs, though? I'm very disappointed. Eh. 
one bee is gonna attack the other bee. Oh, we like ate him. Attack my bee, my bee minion. You have a lot of health. That's the idea. This. It is. Okay. Ooh. I'm getting so distracted with all these swords. Oh! <laughs> That's cool. Like a, it's like an almost boomerang. That that animation is so good. Scythe. These are so cool. I wish it dragged on the floor. Oh, that's got to be like a finishing blow. So maybe I have... Oh, this sword is too big. Is the bottom of my neck... Oh, okay. But the bottom of my neck was... Uh... Do the stab. Oh. We better rip here. Not that one. Katana, perhaps? That almost... I mean, that looks really cool just running. You subbed. Thank you for subbing. Welcome in. I'm thinking... Chopping. Oh, I got rid of it. Down, down cutter. There we go. So katana's not bad. What about what about what about what about that? Do a big slash. That's kind of cool. Uh, Albert. Do a big big smash. Fine. Yeah. Okay, so so far I'm liking the way that the that the is it the long sword? Which one does the big? Okay, so there's no special attack. I like the way the katana runs, and I like the way that the the claymore slashes on the third attack. Fourth. So what we're doing right now is we've been live for ten and a half hours and I said at the last four hours, so the thing that we've been working on for almost 40 minutes now, um, is together with the chat we're going to write a story and then and then I will uh, make a skit and then we'll post the skit on the channel when it's done. So, so far the story is a, is a fantasy adventure. Um, it's a there and back story. So we start out doing something, something happens, and then we come back at the end of the story, we're back where we started. So it's like, um, so far the story is, I start at home, chopping logs for a fire, suddenly an arrow flies through the win- not window, we're not gonna do that. Flies... past me... and it hits a column, or something. It's a- it's a log. Just barely missing me. Lance looks over, over to see two pillagers. One hits the other, like, dude, you missed. Like, you're not, you're just not supposed to miss. You're supposed to hit. And so I unsheath my sword and charge the two villager. I defeat one of the pillager, but the other gets away. And so I start tracking the pillager, following clues that were left behind. We got a sniffer to help sniff around, because my uh, my companion is a sniffer, and so he's gonna help me track the bad guy. And then I, I find an arrow on the ground. I find a donkey that was left behind by the pillager. There's a dog tied up that when I unleash leads back to the pillager outpost, which over here we have this massive castle that will be our pillager outpost. And so the final battle is going to be over here and we're going to be destroying a ravager. So right now we're, we're putting together the components to make this story work. And we're, we're trying to find all of the tools that we have available and figure out what we want to do 
as far as with the tools because if there's say something that we find that just needs to happen this is the time to find it because that way we can write it that's pretty cool on right click preemptively shatter the ice okay so i guess that's only if i hit twisted blade Okay. These are really cool. So I need like a, just a regular weapon. I'm thinking, I think I'll just go for the classic sword. Or maybe the katana. We need the axe for the chopping of the logs. I think uh, I might do the katana. I might make a texture pack. Could I even do that so fast? I want to make a texture pack that changes the swords to all look the same. So that way I can run like this, but then switch to this sword. And then I can do the big slash. wonder how quickly I could do that. I'm not experienced with texture pack stuff. Uh, what about a cutlass? Pretty simple, okay. No clue what that does. Okay. Or maybe I just have two swords. What are you thinking? Are we thinking katana? Are we thinking... Claymore? Repair? It only got two attacks. I think I might go with the katana just because of the the running animation. Or what about the long sword? Pretty good. The great sword. I'm assuming you mean the the claymore. The long sword or. Like, these are the three I'm thinking about. Try jumping with the weapons when I hit. I don't think it makes a difference. If I get a soldier, for example. Yeah, it doesn't. Like, that one does it either way. I don't have to be jumping for it. So I'm thinking... thinking a crossbow. That way the quiver makes sense. Because I can put the quiver and that will be on my back. And then... the katana. And then... I mean, I could use the claymore for action shots, so like something you'd, you'd hardly see, like a final blow. You see, like, the Ravager peeking its head around the corner, and then... And then it cuts or something. It's... it's... It finds the big one. Hmm... I feel like it would make more sense if it was consistent. Maybe... Maybe I do this. So I have the katana as my weapon. Where should I put the crossbow? Or where's the sword, actually? I don't know how this system works. Oh, that should go... Oh, I see. Oh. Wait, is it based on what slot the items are in? It is! Okay. So depending on where I have it... That's probably where I want it, right? No, no, no. I want that. Not there. Not there. Not there. Not there. Not there. That's decent. Okay, that's where I want it. The handle looks so small. 
That looks even worse. What about just the, the iron longsword? Oh, that is the iron longsword. That's too long. I'm so picky about this. That looks weird. That just looks like a regular sword. Why did I say it like that? That's so small. It's like a dagger. Katana might be the way to go. I like that it also has the... Never mind. I thought it had like the swinging effect, but it doesn't. Okay. So we'll have the axe. The axe will be like our our beginning shot. Chopping logs. And then boom. Time to go to the axe. And I think we just turn this off. That way it doesn't show our axe once we switch it. It's chopping, and then the arrow will fly back onto something. And then when I switch to my sword, you can't see the axe anywhere. Also adjust the position. That's true. Right, let me do that. Um, I want to adjust the Y. Can I adjust the scale? Can't adjust the scale. I wish I could adjust the scale. That's that's fine. All I can do is rotation. <laughs> oh jeez. That's not bad. Yeah, that's that's much better, I think. Okay. I think that's the go. This is the combo we'll go with. Yeah. You do a big chop? Big chop? Nope. Damn. Chopping wood. We're chopping wood. <laughs> chopping wood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Have a good night, spider. Okay, I think that's the plan. So now we need to build ourselves a little hut. Do I have something preemptively I could use? There's no schematics. Okay. You should get people on the morph mod. You should get people with the morph mod to join you on a server. I don't have a server is the problem. I could do essential, but I don't know. That I, I don't I don't know if I want to do that. I'll just put this stuff over here for now. Okay. Let's make ourselves a hut, shall we? I could use this in the video. This is copyright free. I've got the entirety of Epidemic Sound, so I'm not hurting for, for music, but still. We're gonna make something very simple. Nothing too spectacular. Something something kind of small. There's Blanks. I want to kind of have this overarch a little bit, so I might actually bring this up one. Because what I want to do is have, like, um, I'm kind of using God of War as inspiration for this house. Um, I'm going to have this come out a little bit. Like that. And then we'll have fences here. Then we'll just do... This. That. 
shields to... Yeah, that's better. That looks more, more complete, I think. Change these over to full planks. That. And then this could just be very simple. Actually, no. Can't use the same block. Something like this. We have supplementaries. What do supplementaries have to, to offer me? Any new bricks? Ash bricks. That's not bad. Then. There we go. It's looking good enough. So now, this is where I'll be chopping. And then I can put this here. Perfect. Okay. Do that. Put this in. It sticks. There's our epic window. is fun. I'm liking this song. Man, we'll use thatch, I think. That's a block. What's the what's the supplementaries one? Fodder. Would you say I'm an introvert or an extrovert? I'm probably an, an omnivert, if that's the word. I'm like kind of in between. Maybe I'm an maybe I'm an extrovert with just ADHD. Because there are a lot of times where I'm like, I don't want to be around people, but I also really like to interact with people. So I'm, I'm not too sure what it would be called. Um, I feel like an omnivore is probably the closest you can really get to an exact definition. Yeah, now you got 15 minutes to wait. Let's go for... This really does not matter at all. Oh, I bet you it's, it's from... Um, not even from this mod, it's from farmers. Yeah, gravel will do, right? Gravel gravel works fine. Hmm. There's our, our stump. We'll do something darker for the interior. Not that you'll really see it. I'm not going to decorate the inside. Just the exterior. And then we'll do a door. Let's do a netherite door. There we go. Very nice. Is there, can we do a banner or something? Hi. Do a banner and just have these kind of hang off, I guess. And then over here, I can just, I just put a banner on my head. That's funny. I can have a team based thing if I wanted to. And then over here, we want a shovel. Just any shovel. Yes, I see you. Hello. Hi. Let's do it this way. There we go. Here we go. Look at all this, this wood I've chopped, guys. Wow. Aren't I so awesome? Getting ready to, to warm up the campfire. 
I wish I had one that was sideways, but that's fine. What's something else I could really use? That's nice. Let me go for this for the walls instead. That might be too bright. That's definitely too bright. Bricks makes more sense. You want the ash bricks. There they are. Do this. And then also give it some windows. Yeah. And then just behind it, we'll give it... Just so it doesn't look too weird. That looks weirder. <laughs> Maybe have like a chimney out here. Do a banner. Like a dark gray banner. There we go. That looks okay, I guess. I don't feel like it has enough texture, but that's fine. Um, what else should there be? I think we need some pathing, so let's get some coarse dirt. This is probably the most boring part, is building sets. Ten minutes left, yes. You're very excited for it to be ten minutes left. some ferns and maybe some grass. We don't really have any new flowers, do we? No, not really. This will kind of hide the house a little bit, too. Like, oh, it's overgrown. The person living here was more focused on maintaining the house itself rather than the surrounding area. Yeah, that looks good. I like that. Till three hours. <laughs> There's nothing going on at three hours. At least nothing that I know of. I don't know what's gonna happen in at three hours. I don't. <laughs> I don't know. I'm assuming you were waiting for the thing we're already doing. That's my guess. Well, we're doing it.
that helps a lot. It's very subtle, but it definitely adds to it. Feels much more, much more enclosed. I feel like for some reason there should be a waterfall too, or a river. This is the path that will the villagers will come from. Like this is the entrance to the home. I'm gonna clear out this tree. And then maybe big. Nice one for the leaves, or for what? There we go. Not great with paths. I feel like it needs more blocks, but the only thing I really have to keep it dirt is rooted. Okay, I guess. That's simple, I guess. That's not terrible. I don't hate that. I do wish the uh, the foliage came out a bit though, just to make it a little bit more busy, not as uniform. That's a lot better. See how much more alive that feels with just adding some grass. There might be too many ferns, honestly. That's probably better. Okay. Cool. This is our this is our set. Our first set. That's pretty awesome. One down. We don't really have a second one to build because we have the already existing location. Now it's just figuring out what exactly um, 
figuring out exactly what the story is. So let's go back to the go back to this. Arrow dropped in the ground, a donkey left behind, a dog tied up, unleashed, la uh, leads back, leads Lance back to the villager. Um, let's actually change that to leads to a burned down village. Um, leads Lance to a burned down village in the background. A villager fortress. So that's that's the first one. Earth. Um is firing, let's leave him charge charges the two villagers. Beats one villager. But one manages to escape. Last tracks the villager there's a okay. That will be its own scene. So should we start with scene one? Let's see. How would we do this? So I've killed a villager. I kinda wanna see what happens if I kill a sniffer. three blows. Oh, I have everything. Okay. Hello. It, oh my gosh. <laughs> nice sniff. <laughs> Not exactly. I wish it would tell me what I could do. If I turn this down, it's closer. <laughs> That's pretty funny. I don't hate that. This is a little fast, though. Run! <laughs> Bro is sniffing. Maybe, like, sniffing on the case. It's like... I think I got it. <laughs> okay, what about a what about a pillager? I got a little silly funny nose. I like how it works with fresh animations. Oh, it doesn't work with this though. What about the crossbow? Oh, that's awesome. Oh, that's so cool. How does it, how does it detect? Is it just random? I'm trying to figure out when does it, when does it do the thing? Oh, interesting. I can make him really scared if I look up. Okay, so it's just random when he does the animations. It's good to know. Okay. So I'd have to get lucky with that if I wanted to use that. These look so weird. Fish. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. Barely see me. What is this? I'm having too much fun with this. Some of them have powers, I know that. The Elder Guardian. Can you shoot his beam? No, okay. Phantom, I can fly, right? I think the two animation mods are conflicting with one another. really like the way that looks except for when it's moving so I would have to turn off the mod I guess when I'm playing as another character or turn off the fresh animations when I'm playing as another character that's unfortunate but at least we can get it to work that way okay should we get to work on the first scene then how are we gonna do this Maybe it's just one, for simplicity's sake. Maybe it's just one pillager. <sighs> I'm 
trying to figure this out. So if we do one pillager, no, it's got to be two, because then I'm gonna I'm gonna miss out on that great bit. Okay, I am going to. I'm gonna. I'm gonna okay, I don't need to save and quit. I don't know why. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna export this. I'm gonna send it to myself. I am making a skit. So we have... Don't need shaders, I just need mods, okay. We have, together, as a as both the chat and myself, we've put together part of a story so far. We haven't finished it yet. Um, and we're going to... Made the story, and we're going to create the story. I'm going to record the whole thing, and then we're going to... I'm going to post it on the channel. So it'll be a community-built story. Now I can send this to my... To me? Yo, and then I'll get my laptop. This is the final thing we're doing for the subathon. Just because... I feel like this is probably all the time we're going to have anyway. Let me grab... This. Download that. Sure, update CurseForge. The spooky. I've got my laptop in front of me. Cool. Alright, while that updates, I'm going to use the bathroom. I need to... You're right back. It's done! Yippee! Minecraft is already running. Oh. Yes, hello. How are you, cat? Wherever you are. Yeah. 
Minecraft open. All right. Okay. So now that we're back, I think the first thing we're going to work on once I get into the world is just the chopping logs. That's probably the easiest thing to start with. Um, I'll do sound effects and stuff in post. But right now we just need to focus on the visual aspect. One thing we should probably figure out before we even start this is... Is it going to record the animations and stuff in replay mod? So if I start moving... Gotta load the thing. Thank you for letting me know I'm online. Really appreciate that. If I run around, I'm doing the things. I got my sword. Ooh. Okay. Let's see if it records that. Save that replay. If it doesn't, that poses an issue. Because <laughs> then the fancy animations don't even show up. Turn that off. Okay, well... That looks like it's working. Give me the sword. It works. It's a little buggy, but that's okay. It works. That is all I needed. Okay. Don't really need any of this stuff. Full screen. Turn off V-Sync. Done. Multiplayer. And go back into the world. Done. I need to send myself the skin that I'm currently wearing. What the what? Is this the first time I've used... I guess this is the first time I've used Essential on my second account. Huh. No, I haven't. That's not right. Okay. It's the katana, right? Yeah. 323 mods. That's not even accurate. <laughs> I think I have less mods, but still... A ridiculous amount. I have... This is the quote-unquote vanilla one, plus a few extra. There are 165. Probably got 10 of those for this project specifically. Okay. Let me grab my skin. I forget where I keep it. All skins 2.0. Oh, you know what? Hold on. I gotta do something real fast. I can't show this just in case there's something... Spoilers? I don't even know if... I think it'd probably be fine, but just in case. I gotta do this without you guys seeing it. Where the heck even is it? Okay, it's not in this folder. I'm looking for my, my skin that I'm using. I need to make it blink. No, I don't. That's too much effort. Two. If I can find it, there it is. All I would have to do is open this with Photoshop. And then go back to Skins 2.0, Blinking Variants, Blink, Blinking Skin. This will take like 10 seconds. Give me one moment. Yeah. Such a, a short stream. I'm actively adding blinking to my skin for this. Okay, I need to add this as a second layer. Perfect. Cool. Interesting. I didn't know that happened. I'm putting in probably too much effort into this. But you know what? It makes it cooler. What is that? I need to get rid of this stuff. I can probably show this part. 
I switch to scene four. And then switch to... Actually, let's just go back to this. Play capture. There we go. Oh, I pushed the button. There we go. This is... I'm trying to do this. I gotta take... Uh... Oh, jeez. I gotta take my blank skin. And then... I can get rid of this. Other than those two pixels, it's identical. So let me copy this. And then paste it as a second layer. And then... I can take... The, or the pencil tool, grab that, and then on this layer, it's like I'm blinking with the scar, and then I'll grab this. I think that's all I need to do, actually. That's the only difference. Oh, I need that one, too. Let me grab... This color. No. Grab this. Grab this. Copy. Copy. Blank skin look funny. Yeah. It's just so I can put stuff on top of it and I don't have to remove anything under. I, I took way too long. Or I, I, I went way too long before without doing this. And every time I wanted to change my skin, I had to create it manually. It was so annoying. Get rid of these. Grab this, this color. No, grab this color. Oh, juice. Give me the eyedropper tool. Thank you. This, unhide that. There we go. That's all three frames, I believe. This is what it should look like, right? I do need this stuff down here. I think. And all this stuff. Uh oh, undo. Bam. Bam. Lapow. Yeah. Uh, I do need this, but I need it without this. Oh, that makes this way easier to see. Grab all of this. This stuff I don't even think I need to bring over, but just in case it messes up something with it. Figure probably better safe than sorry. Add that to a new layer that will go on the top. Uh, I'm 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 literally doing this to add blinking to my medieval skin. That's literally it. <laughs> Let me turn all of these off, and then I need to delete this. Use oh no. Yeah, we're good. We're good. Fine. Delete that. I was I had the wrong layer selected. Yeah, we got it. Make sure nothing is overlapping. I think, uh, I think we're good. We want this, and then also that, and then... Not this one, right? Yeah. Alright, that's the whole thing. So then I can export. Quick export as PNG. Blinking. Medieval Lance. All skins 2.0 blinking variants. There we go. I can go back to Minecraft and upload the thing. Oh, okay. It was it was showing this. One. I was gonna say why was it doing that? Play capture. Okay. Don't need the thing at the bottom for blinking. It's good. Yeah, I thought that would be the case. I really should make. I should add that to the blink, or add that as a separate layer in the blink um, template. I think that might be smart. Skins. That's what I was looking for. Why do I only have one? That's an outfit, that's why. Skins, there we go. Select by file. 
and then I go and grab that skin I just made. Bring that in. Uh, that's fine. Get rid of this one. Delete. Now this one, you should see blinking. Yay, that's a little bit odd. I feel like it's not blinking the same as my other skins. Animation is weird. I don't like how I'm breathing. I think that's right, though. What if I just cover up the left eye? Come on, do it again. Okay, it's right, it's right. The scar just looks weird. Okay, we got this. <laughs> this is turning out so cool. We literally haven't recorded anything yet. So, we've got our character. We've made him blink. We've got our antagonists. We've got an idea of what we're doing. I'm thinking maybe... What if the crossbow bolt goes here? Maybe this is where he chops instead. And that could be like this. And then... Yeah, okay, okay. And then I look over. I'll like look over at the tree. Be like chopping and then look over at the tree. And then the camera will come over here. And then I'll go like that. And then the two pillagers will be over there. And the one guy will be like, you dingus, you were supposed to hit the guy. And then it will cut back to, to me. And then I'll be over here and then I'm like, Whishing! and then I'm like, Argh! yeah, see, see, I got this all envisioned in my head. This is going to be perfect. I don't know why I'm at one and a half hearts. Much better. Is it going to be so cool? OK, so I need to get my second account in here. Got it open already. Oh yeah, I need to send myself the skin. Very spooky. Welcome back, Teresa. I didn't say that. Welcome back. Making sure I'm sending this to the right server and not just some random people. Error updating skin. Error has occurred. Thank you so much for telling me. Um, I not wardrobe. There we go. Emote skins, skin, select by file, uh, that button, this button, and then save image, cancel that, save this and download, save this, do this again, with that button. Linking Lance, choose here, limb, add skin, go back. Okay, quit the game because it doesn't know how to use essential. This is going great. I can close out of, uh, close out of this now. They exported PNG, it's fine. Yeah, yeah, so what we're doing um, and I think you of all people would enjoy this the most. What we've been doing is we've been collaboratively writing a story. Um, we've been doing this for two hours and 20 minutes now, a little bit longer. We've been collaboratively writing a story and then together coming up with a plot. We're coming up with a protagonist, what the style would be. We chose fantasy adventure. It's going to be a, what did we, what did we call it? A there and back story, so the character is going to start doing something, and at the end of the skit, we'll be doing the same thing. You accidentally dozed off, and now I'm covered in saliva. I've had that. Don't worry. That just that just means it was a really good sleep. But yeah, so now we're we're making a story, um, and it's going to be about medieval Lance, since I have the assets. So we put together a mod pack. I have the window land. Yes. I think so. Cool. 
I should be back. Slash T. Lance. Twinsies. Say cheese. What the what? Hello. <laughs> yep. This is um this is how I do stunt double stuff. It's giving me the basic Minecraft tutorial like I haven't played this game for 14 years or th uh, 13 years. Okay. Everything should be fine. Turn brightness up. Okay. We're writing a story and we're making a skit. We've all been working on a story together and we built a set here. Um we've got like a little starting house. And then we're going to try to take the script that we've been working on and turn it into an actual skit. And then we're going to post the skit on the channel. That That's like the big thing for the stream. So I've got my second account I'm going to play my stunt double for some shots. I need to give myself that, 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 and that. Um, I need to switch V. Toggle this off. One should be... X should be in the second slot. That can be here. So then... Where's my quiver? My keybinds are messed up. Where's my quiver? My quiver's not there. Where is it? Where's my quiver? change my controls to base block select item select item these there's uh, so many keybinds holy moly change that to that get rid of this get rid of this lighting that oh my gosh Cape dust. That don't need that. This don't need this. Auto clicker don't need that. Toggle perspective set that to B. World map I don't need this. These off so they don't conflict. I forget how tedious this is going through every single keybind. That don't need that. I don't need anything from replay mod. So many keybinds. This is probably good. Cool. That is something to my do list in Discord. Okay. Where's my. Where's Mm, makes me think sad. I do have two accounts, yes. But so it shows up on my character. Supplementaries. Common tweaks. There it is, okay. It says back! Why no work? Let's offset, movement GY. That's really funny. About. Um, hey Damien. Or Damon. Are you out? Okay. I'm not sure why the quiver's not working. It shows up on mine. Oh. Working for a second.
You just lost your drawing pen? Uh oh. Yikes. Is it underneath the couch cushion? I don't know. Better grab a wall. Yay, I'm glad. why the quiver's not working. It shows up on my other computer. I've got it on my back there. See? But it doesn't show up on this one. It's so odd. I'm really not sure. Hmm. That's fine. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna let that discourage me. We're gonna go. So what do I want to do? Um I need to play A pillager. <laughs> oh. It would be funny to have something fall on top of the pillager and like look up in fear. Like an anvil above or something. Um, it depends on what I'm recording for. Like, um, for, for voices, I typically have it locked at negative 12 I think for music I'm usually between negative 30 and negative 45 and then for game volume it's usually at negative 50 to negative 40 depending on how important it is that you need to hear it pillager lands <laughs> I love this mod. Yes. Oh, you didn't even see the uh, the sniffer, Therese. Look at this. <laughs> oh my gosh, so scary. Run away! <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's so good. I love this. I'm not streaming to Twitch now. I'm just streaming to YouTube. Hello. This, this, the one where I'm playing other creatures is called Identity. I have my second account on my laptop. <laughs> I love the running. Look at this. <laughs> it's so cute. Quite delusional. I'm I'm actually a sniffer now. Um. <laughs> what else? What else can I be? Be a camel. That's <laughs> so good. Oh, I love this mod. Become a bee? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> this is on Studio Blocks too, so I get to work with this when I make skits there. It can be an Enderman, a Glow Squid, a Hoglin, a Husk, a Panda, Sniffer Lance. Oh, that would be so cursed. I love that it works with fresh animations, too. But considering the skit is going to be about, like, the Ravager is, like, the main villain. Um, the fact that I can control it and it has the animations is just awesome. It's 
me, Tango. What's up, guys? I've invaded the dungeon. <laughs> but yeah, that's pretty great. <gasps> oh my gosh! Look at the moving animation! Oh my gosh. <laughs> It's so cute. <laughs> it's like a little bug. Yeah. <laughs> you got games on your phone. You got games on your phone. Hold on, hold on. You got games on your phone. Oh, it blinks too. I love it. Okay, let's uh, let's do this, shall we? <laughs> We're running out of time, and I'm, I fear I'm not actually going to be able to do this because I've been so distracted with it. All right, um, so the first shot, I kind of want to do this handheld. So what I'm going to do is have my camera here, and then have my second account as places to be. <laughs> so what I'll do is I'll take uh, snow layers. Say I want to be. I actually want to be slightly higher. And then I'm going to do this. And turn my FOV down. Yo! So what's the first shot going to be? I think the first shot's going to actually be a perspective shot. Like a first FOV shot. POV, that's the word. So I'm going to be. Camera will be somewhere like right here or something. And then I'll be over here. This? Can't even see me, hold on. What I'll probably have to do is actually take this and break that. Oh, I'm not even looking at the right log. That would also help. Do I want to have it? Oh, that would be so good. I don't know how I would do this though. I need I need more more second accounts. And I need like a smooth motion, so I'll use this. Then I'll just swing it really hard. Oh, I can't swing it hard enough. Now this have to be handheld. I mean that could that would work, but I I need to do a blind cut or something. Do this, and then I don't know how would I do this? How would I do this? I'd be like looking up. It's like, oh, what's that? There's an arrow in the tree. And then shoo. That's kind of the angle I want. So I can either I think I might have to do this in replay mod. Which is fine. I think I could pull that off in replay. This is basically the process I go through all the time. This is why videos send uh, tend to take a long time. Okay. So, I think the first shot I'm actually going to do is I'm going to be down here. And then I'm going to be like this. Oh, I should probably... I'm going to create a button. Okay. Something like that. But I want to be zoomed in. Mm, maybe not. I think maybe the first shot would be instead... Break that one. Something like this. Yeah, something like that. Let's go. Wish I could do like a cleaving shot instead of a downwards one. 
Something like that, I think. What's up? Uh, it's me. But also, it's it's not me. Me too. Oh, you know what I just realized? I'm gonna have to hide everything just to be able to record. I'm gonna I'm gonna temporarily hide everything. All the uh, all the camera stuff. Hide everything there. Hide snip. Hide snip shadow. So that way I can actually record. Because otherwise it won't it won't work. And then I think I also want to do shaders. Because why not? I don't have any shader packs. Oh no. Hold on. Let me get some shaders. Shaders! Let's do... My favorite shaders. I'll grab... You grab, grab it from my other mod pack. Probably the best way to do this. I have so many folders open. Okay. Let me grab this. And then copy. Open a new tab. Let's go for... Studio Blocks. V2. Shader Packs. Copy Astralex. Paste that over. Boom, it's there. Um, I got hit or something. I can't, I haven't come up with the lore. Oh, look how good that looks. Are we thinking yes? I think we're thinking yes. Do I want to hit... Do I want to miss? Let's stand back for that. I think I have to... I love it! Isn't it so good? I wish it was slower. I think I could do it with, um... What is the what does the wood axe look like? No, oh, I gave it to the wrong account. That doesn't make a difference. Hey, Wisteria. Nice. I'm still on my 12-hour stream. We're about 20 minutes away from the actual time, but we're going longer. I broke that. I have more. Here, Lance, you place it. Okay, Lance. Thanks. Don't you dare break that. Oh, I'm in adventure mode. Hold on. Oh, oh I should break it. There we go. Perfect. Cool. Okay. That's our first shot right there. It took us... It only took us almost 12 hours. Go so hit that. And I don't want this... I don't want this axe. Okay. The axe should not show up. Why is the... Oh, because I'm holding it. That's why. Mining fatigue slowness? Maybe. Or slowness... Slowness, no. Mining fatigue, possibly. That's not... A, that was a good idea. Okay, so it changes this one. Yes, this is that makes sense. I'm just I'm just hitting around it. 
slowness I don't think would fix it. In fact, let's see, does it does this even do it? Fact clear. I don't think that makes a difference. But the long swing, that was a good that was a good idea. Actually, I can't really tell if it's making a difference. All right, we'll try that. Okay, so what do we want the first shot to be? So if we do this, the record button. Okay, there's our first first recording. Do this. That's I like the leaf. That's that's cool. I'll just move over. You won't even be able to tell. That's not bad. Hey, Destiny. Hi, Marshmallow. Welcome back. That is our second shot. All right. I think that's good. I'll edit in chopping sounds later. Wait, was the snow in the... It wasn't. Okay, good. I forgot I had that there. I'm in adventure mode. I gotta read this. Okay, cool. Hello. I just realized this will be the first video I post that's in 2K. Because I'm, I'm streaming in 2K and therefore recording in 2K. I also want to do some, some shots above the area. Oh, look how pretty that is. So cool. Yeah, I've been I've been drinking lots of water. I'm on my my second water bottle right now. I haven't been drinking enough, but I've had other liquids. I've got two different. I had chocolate milk, and uh, I had chocolate milk and some kind of pineapple apple or uh, pineapple orange. I don't think it was guava, so it wasn't pog. I think it was like pag. But I'm drinking water now. It was better when it was, had ice in it. Okay. That's a nice shot. I think two cans of Mountain Dew. Ah, yes, very healthy. All right. Hmm. So what's next? I've done some shots of... I've done two shots. I've done this one, and I've done this one up here. Do I do the shot of the arrow? I, I think I can't use this one. Unless I do something... I gotta break this. I gotta do something like this. Maybe, maybe below. And then... Oh, I really do need a third account. Is it too loud? I'll turn it down. Maybe that's better. Yeah, that, that is a bit loud. Okay. Okay. I'm trying to figure out I think this is the angle I have to do for the bow. It'll be something like this. Ah, 
Um, not sure yet. <laughs> I haven't decided the lore on Lance's second eye. So I think I'll do something like this. I'll have it focused on the log. And then just... And then it will it will do like a whip. So it'll be like... I'll probably have to do a blind cut. Because I have the motion blur, I can actually get away with that too. So if I have myself here, let me go grab the have myself here. I'll be able to like look up at the at the thing. And I'll do this. Oh, I love the depth of field. And then I can do I can whip and nay nay. So it'll be like this. And then I'll cut that together with wait, hold on. And then I'll turn. But the problem is, I need two pillagers over there. So, the only way I can see this working is either with replay mod... Oh, do I have mocap? No, I don't have mocap. Dang! I don't even know if that would have worked anyway. Hmm. I could have had a mocap of this character... ...standing and doing the turn. And then had my second account and main account here, and then used replay mod. Alternatively... How could I do this? I could do this. Uh, we're doing a skit right now. Villager. Whip and nay nay. Forgot how hard it is to see. So what I'll what I'll probably do is I'll do a sneaky little editing trick. So you're gonna you're gonna you're gonna get tricked a little bit. That doesn't go there. Do that. Now the only problem with this solution is I can't control when they're looking at me. So I have to actually do this. No one's going to notice that one piece of grass is different. Do that. And then hopefully they'll look at me. It's the two guards. So then I'll have the shot that does the blind cut. And then a second one, it's like this. It's like, and I'll, I'll turn and I'll be like, what? I was attacked by the pillager guys. So this is going to be really a precise movement because I have to first do the whip. Which is already a precise movement. And then I also have to do the precise movement on my laptop. <laughs> okay. So let's try the first one, I guess. Actually, I can get rid of these guys, first of all. There you are. Come here. I like how you can just hear it off to the side. Okay. So, yeah, for the meantime, that's fine. I guess I gotta do the replay shot with this. Because I need to be standing in both places at once. So what I'll do is I'll have my second account be the one shooting. And then I can actually turn off shaders for now. Okay. Off cam killing. Pretty much. It's like hidden transition. And then this account needs to be in venture mode. And I need you. Shall we just? The I can't triple click on my laptop with a touchpad. Atana, there you go. And then I need. I have a crossbow, right? That's the one thing I do have. Yeah. I didn't really pay attention to what side it was. Like, I'll be right back. 
Okay, I'm back. Yeah, pretty much. Cool. And the axe should not be visible. I don't need this stuff. Yeah. Well, let's hope it works. Okay. And because I'm doing this in... Yeah, because I'm doing this in replay mode, I should be fine here. So I have myself lined up over here to fire at the tree. And then get ready. Start the recording. I'll give myself a little bit of extra time. That way I can prepare if any particles are a problem. Let's do this. And I'll do... That was terrible. Restart. Start over. Whatever. Bad. Doesn't work, and that's okay. I can I can start again. Let me check the timer just to see how long. I've got two hours and five minutes. Timer is counting. Oh, you know what? I just realized if I get a sub or anything right now, it's probably going to pop up. <laughs> oh, I, I hope that doesn't happen now. All right, yes. Um, all good. Grab my axe. And action. Okay, that's, that's probably good. So that'll be one recording. And then I actually want to redo this. Not the whole shot, but this, this, I feel like it wasn't high enough. Actually, I feel like that was kind of, let's try that again. Let's try that again. Let's scrap that first recording. I'm going to shoot higher this time. <laughs> 